Justin takes it down with a bet. It was off. Hello, we are back. I think my intro might have not gone through. I'm not totally sure, but we're back here and we got a little upswing poker duo commentary team coming at you today. Of course, I am Doug Polk and I am joined in the bunker by none other than Mike Brady. Mike, thank you for flying out to Austin specifically to sit here in that chair next to me and watch some 510. You're so welcome, Doug. It is so great to be here. Can't wait to watch some action today as we're starting out, I believe, six-handed. A couple players showing up a little late. Classic poker player move. It's never happened before. All right. Also, let's get some table sound going. Always good to hear the table. And we got straight right out of the gate. Cupcake flopping a straight here against a couple hands that might want to play some poker. Yeah, an action flop indeed. Everyone got a piece. A couple open-enders with pairs. And the bottom end of the straight there. Let's see if Salim wants to peel here with his bottom pair and open ender. Getting some good odds. Might feel inclined to put the call out there, and he will go ahead and make the call. Eight of Diamonds falls on the turn. Add some boat outs for those guys with pairs. Cupcake, of course, still in the lead. Cupcake's going to go big. He goes 300 into 340. Justin going to get out of the way with the top pair. Nice fold from him there. And Salim gets out of the way too. Cupcake takes one down. So we've got E in the one seat. Poker line in the two seat. Cupcake in the three seat. And Salim in the eight seat. I believe that's all he sat down so far. Those are my decision. That one's your fault, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. Jump on in. Apparently 2.30. 2.30? Yeah. 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 We, we haven't yeah, even yeah, done right. an orbit yet. Yeah, yeah a lot oh, of action. <laughs> it's been crazy. Super crazy yeah. action. Pocket seven's here for Poker Lion. Going to open it up under the gun, although we are shorthanded, so that really is more of a late position raise. He takes it down, E oh, making yeah. the fold with ace three off. <laughs> Tried to talk him into Deluni, but they weren't into it. <clears throat> and and we, we are suspending are. time. There I am, both in the bunker and out in the room. How is that possible, Mike? The magic of editing, or maybe a better phrase is just okay. broadcasting. Yeah. We'll be here. Yeah. What timeline are we so. even on? Those are a bunch of $1,200 buy-in Mayhem main event tables. One million guarantee. It's going to absolutely blow that guarantee out of the water. I think we had something like 400 entrants on just the first two days alone. So it's going to be a big tournament. As we hear see Salim picking up 7-5 off on the button. He's going to play it. Pops it up to 40, it appears. And he takes it down. Those are very reflective glasses. Always uh, an interesting move at the poker table, for sure. I, I would be worried that you could see my cards, although that's probably impossible. Yeah, I don't think the angle's there, but I would definitely be worried about it. Eight has been the, uh, the curse seat. Easy peeling. Whoa, whoa, are we talking <laughs> curses? You can break it. <clears throat> it's definitely the game I want to be in if we're talking curses. Yeah. It, it's been pretty ridiculous. Everyone that's sat in the eight seat has gotten stacked within, like, Three orbits? Really? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> so, just, so just be careful. Small yeah. sample. Yeah. Not a small plenty, sample. Plenty, of, <laughs> it's true. plenty of sample. Plenty of sample. Like 12 days of streaming. Yeah. It's cursed. 12 times, dude. It's cursed. Yeah. yeah. <clears throat> Cupcake making a little bit of a tight fold in the big blind there. 6 4 suited. No flop. Ooh. Um, you just hate to see it. Nice. You really do. Straights, flushes, pairs. So many different things can be made. Woo! The Christmas right, sweater was the best. Good. We're, 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 not, we're not doing anything special for tipping, right? We're just our hands so far. Yeah, whatever. 
Oh. We're not doing the thing? I mean, some, what's no. the thing? I don't know. Oh, like a card? The, Did you just say thing and there was no thing? Just, yeah, the thing, yeah. Yeah, you know. <laughs> I mean, yeah, we can like block card for two. This one's mine. Do you mean this one? Right? Yes. Yeah, take that. And Jake Abdallah, a.k.a. the Llama, takes his seat there, wearing his poker uniform. I love that it has the blanket. That was a, that was a fun stream. Yeah, that was, uh, I made a few ill-advised plays. There, there, there was one I can think of. <laughs> <laughs> it, it made the reel. <laughs> yeah. Salim is opening it up today, raises it up with Queen-4 suited. Looks like he's driving the action early here. By the state in the hand, but... All of a sudden, went to like six or seven thousand. I'm like, mm, I could stand that much. He he sometimes plays real crazy. We're playing ten ten. Ten ten. Okay. What's up? Oh yeah. Bullshit. Go back to the other hand. I need to see the review. That's right. Everyone gets wanded here at the lodge. You want to play in the stream? We got to make sure you're not hiding anything fishy. Throw the red flag. Indeed. In Indeed. today in today's poker climate, it's just a, it's an important part of it. It sure is. Unfortunate, but true. Can never be too careful. And E picks up the birds, as I call them. The birds, huh? No one else calls it that, so I really yeah. shouldn't do it while commentating. He's got yeah. aces. It's not, it's not a thing. <laughs> <laughs> probably, probably why. We got uh, uh, the crows, as I call the threes. The crows against the birds here. Ooh, and Llama's got the penguins here in the big blind. Yep, 6-5 suited. Kind of a great hand to have against aces. It's nice. Let's see if he decides to put in the squeeze. Ooh, that's not a good decision, considering E has the aces. Well, I'm just going to pop it up to it look like 180. Yeah, this is not going to work. I don't think it's going to get through. E likely going to come with 4-bet here. Kind of awkward stacks. It was pretty yeah, cool. they're, they're a little shallow. I know. They, they have <clears throat> bullshit. I guess they have to have them out like Texas early. shallow, 200 yeah. blind Steve. Oh, it's straddled though, right? Oh, what's the straddled? I would assume this is straddled. Okay. Maybe, maybe not. Maybe I'm wrong. You guys want to complain about the live channel screen? That could be the. That would be so awesome. Well, Greg says he also calls them the birds. This is an interesting spot here for Llama because he has the kind of hand that you want to have versus something like aces, but. But you're out of position. But one thing also you have going for you is that the price is relatively cheap. So he might feel that even though he's obviously behind here, it's worth taking a flop. But he's going to make a prudent lay down. Yeah, I think in position, if you find yourself in that situation, in position with 6-5 suited, you're, you're always peeling. That said, he's 4-bet size would probably be bigger. The next time. I think I would have taken a flop there, Brady. For the stream, at least, right? Yeah. But also for me. <laughs> Indeed. Uh, As we see the players in the game here today, E, Poker Lion, Cupcake, Justin, Allen, Llama, Stream Regular, Pierre, and Salim all in for 2,000. This is a match the stack cash game, meaning that if a player builds their stack, any other player can rebuy for that exact stack. So early on here, we're going to be playing 2,000 deep, but that is likely to change in a big way. Have you heard of anywhere that plays match the stack other than in Texas? I have not. Because I've never heard of it. I'd before. actually never even heard of it until I got here. But it, it's a pretty standard format across the state, so. We do things a little different here in Texas sometimes. Justin looking out of pocket six, he's going to open up the button. And now Pierre with the big hand. Cowboys. Yeah, he just gets to the table. I think this is his first hand dealt in, picks up the kings. Always a nice feeling. He squeezes, raises rather, to 200. Front of the person next to you. And then, mm -hmm. Pretty much. Justin looks a little like Skull Mike we can, when you can only see the 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 beard, the, the, the beard, you know, and, and the bottom of the face. Yeah, I tried to. At first, my first instinct was it was it was Skull Mike. But anyway, going back to the hand, Justin does make the call. Ace on the flop for Pierre, but he's gonna go ahead and bet the flop anyway. One twenty-five into a pot of just about four hundred, and Justin looks like he's gonna go ahead and make a raise. Small raise, too. He, it's an absolute min raise. Interesting. And this is kind of brutal to face as Pierre Ooh, because yeah. it, it, it's the size that you'd sort of expect Justin to raise if he was raising with, like, ace-jack for some reason. It kind of puts that on the table, right. whereas if, if Justin has raised, had raised bigger, 
he'd be repping specifically like a set oh. or two pair. Now Pierre's oh, concerns are not so relevant. I think he's going to be feeling pretty good, <laughs> considering he beats even the hands that Justin is representing. Let's in see if he incredible can. turn here for Pierre. No kidding. Oh and man, Justin. Even more incredible that Justin reaches for four of those four, or rather those black chips, four hundred dollars into this nine hundred twenty-five dollar pot. Pierre's now thinking about his options. If he thinks Justin's particularly strong here, he could decide to raise and try and win all of it. But, you know, if he thinks Justin is bluffing, then it could make sense just to call and let your opponent continue to fire. Uh, in this particular spot, calling would be a really good play from Pierre, but it looks like he's going to raise. Yeah, and I, I don't blame Pierre for making that play, even though it's obviously not going to work out in this case. But when someone bets that small size in position on the turn... Friday, I often see people doing that to kind of get a cheap showdown, quote unquote. <laughs> right. So he could be doing it with like a hand like Ace Jack with plans to check back the river. Pierre doesn't want that to happen, so he goes for all the cheddar right there on the turn. Numbers are good. I feel like a speaker just feeding in like. Part of why did you end up going to? Like some chip mm -hmm. shop like an occasional. Oh, yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah. Cool. You know? Just, uh, Just so we know what's going on in like, the tournament, <laughs> right. Place, right? I feel so secluded. Most, I mean, the most uh, touristy stuff. Oh, all right. It does feel really? a little secluded and quiet. First time there? Mm -hmm. Oh, I, I love it. I'll That's early on. on. I know. We can't even be antisocial and just stare at our phones. I know. Poker Lion getting into the action now with the A7 coming in for a raise here. Players getting out of the way. Salim looks down at King Six of Diamonds in the big blind. Definitely a playable hand. He's going to play it for a re-raise. Nice hand to use. Always nice to have a high card in your hand when you're three betting as a bluff. More than likely going to work. He gets the Seattle Kraken fan poker line to fold. As you know, Doug, I just moved to the Seattle area. I did not know there was a hockey team. The Seattle Kraken. They're relatively new, apparently. Yeah, I think I think two years ago. Yeah, so, so it's somewhat so reasonable I didn't know, but, you know, it's a nice surprise. Get to go to hockey games. Yeah, we see our cumulative winnings here so far. Pierre up $800. Uh, Ian Cupcake both up small. The Knight is young. Llama down 200 bucks, And Justin running that bluff with the sixes into the... Turn set from Pierre down just about a thousand dollars. You're pretty much all the blood in the game so far coming from that hand. But then I ate the cupcake like a psychopath. I <laughs> tore it in half and ate the bottom and then I ate the top and they thought it was a serial killer. These these yes. stakes. I've played this game a few yes. times. <laughs> and how it plays at the start of the night versus the end of the night is just is pretty absurd. Because you can only buy them for two K. And yeah, so sense, you just play, you know, 100 or 200 blind poker, depending on if there's a straddle or not. Yeah. And then someone doubles, a bunch of people add on, and then someone else doubles, a bunch of people add on, and boom, you're just playing some deep stack poker. You take off half of the bottom and put it on top. No, 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 and you make it a sandwich. Yeah, and you just like, and it's like, I never tried that. That way you don't just That's like cover, you can try it today. Yeah, you don't cover your face in frosting. Those all have some sort of topping on them. There's like, oh, I mean, if they're like, in Zeno, then if your yeah. face isn't covered in frosting, though, then people like talk to you and stuff. That's true. Yeah, we were just talking. About yeah, <laughs> we can't just like, yeah, zone out. Yeah, I need to look at my uh, solver ranges between hands. You should just have like a cupcake tattoo, and then you're just like. <laughs> well, I'm not gonna make the raise with Jack Two oh, offsuit over Cupcake Slim. Looks like the hat. game is livening up I mean, a little sooner start. than we expected. You a free hat for saying your name was Cupcake? Mm -hmm. That's a cool hat too. Man, I could run that live. Man, I think they called me. Cupcake. This is an aggressive they maneuver. Call me French fries. It's <laughs> lava. Yeah. Every time I go to the house, they call me you know. IPAs. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. They call me IPAs. <laughs> oh, man. It's okay. You have water. <clears throat> Pierre with the psychology. He just got both of us. Cupcake mm -hmm. flopping, about as good Here as you can expect with 7 6 offsuit. He said, Open ender. Yes, Llama goes for the C bet and bangs off a jack on the turn. 
Now he's going to continue betting, almost certainly. You know there's actually a lot of checks here. With Jack 2 specifically? I mean, it should normally well, not the range. Well, but yeah, I don't know how many, uh, how often you're supposed to have Jack Deuce, but I think it actually mainly checks if you do have it. Because if you do bet, you're supposed to bet big and polar, and it can't really go three. It's close to go three. So a lot of times it's a check. Just to get nerdy for a sec, I could imagine Jack 2 specifically benefiting so much from protection from not having an overcard that it does find a bet to check back river a lot of the time, something like that. Hard to say. We are talking about, we are talking somewhat advanced strategy about a hand where a guy ISO'd with Jack 2 offsuit, yeah. so it gets a little yeah. bit weird. But I, I've just looked at a lot of these turn spots, and, and typically speaking, it's a lot more polar, and your weak top pairs that are turned actually do a lot of checking, which is interesting. Indeed, well, it goes bet fold on the river. Llama takes it down. Cupcake with the with the just throwing it away on the river, which was a good decision. It would not have gotten through versus the the jack on the turn from Jay Llama. Correct for Strano. Yeah. Oh, it's free here. Okay. Yeah. I didn't even know we had them. Hopefully, they have gates and compressors on these. Cubby Yeah. I mean, we drink the milk Maybe I should just like whisper things to you. like, <laughs> I have pocket sixes. Of course, not. <laughs> Get it together, Sophia. Damn, C2 is looking good to <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right. They call me Lobster Bisque, if anybody. <laughs> oh, man. That's another good one if you want free stuff. That's, That's what I'm saying. Go to Steakhouse. They call me Steak. They call me Steak. <laughs> they call me Mistake. <laughs> like no, man, they call me Wagyu. Uh, here. Pierre going to open it up with the King Jack offsuit. $20 straddle is on here. Folds going around, and that's it. <clears throat> Take it down. That was a monster. Uh, that's where all the face cards are on the deck. A monster. Yeah. 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 Even if I got there, I wouldn't have felt good. Yeah. Yeah. One of those. I'll give it back. Yeah. How's he do it? He just sits like down, and then just immediately. Actually, I'm going to do this to make it easier. Here we can Strings take down. a little view of our... New studio launched What's two it? weeks ago. Real, real estate. Okay. I got my first in-person look at it today. today and today dang, it is very estate. impressive, especially in person. Oh, they like the it's really all real, real, other than that fireplace. Yeah, just, and that and artwork. That painting. Yeah. <laughs> and the chips estate. on the wall. Yeah, that's what yeah. I'm yeah. 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 really curious what that could be. Yeah. That sounds fun. We're playing for real estate. I believe we have a double straddle on here. So we're playing 5, 10, 20, 50. We just skipped right over pink slips. We went right for deeds. I like it. A few folds around here. Llama looks down at the queen ten of clubs. That's a hand you're going to want to continue against this raise for me. A little, little suited Broadway action. Yeah. He's going to come in for just a call. Slow playing, if you will. Yep. 40% of a royal flush. you can win a nice gym with a half-completed pool that's never going to get finished. Yeah. That's my house right now. Ace-jack-7. Top and bottom for E, but a gutter to the nuts for Llama. <laughs> You're going to go with a one-fourth pot bet here on the flop. Llama now getting a great price. Does decide to make the call. Looking for a king. An eight, maybe you can make some moves with a double gutter. Doesn't get any of that, though. Three of spades in the turn. Flush completes. Both players are got to be a little worried now about players with spades. Yeah, he could check back here, and Llama could have a chance to steal this pot, but it looks like that's not going to happen. He's going to go for a bet. He takes it down. It'd be like a whole movement. Yeah, Mike and Rick were like serial killer stuff. What? Do you like, you know, like straight up? No, just rip it off. Oh, you're just like afraid. Oh, yeah. What's the other worst way? Just lick off the frosting. <laughs> that's yeah. the worst that's, possible that's like way. That's the toddler way of doing it. Yeah. <laughs> and then Kids. putting it back. But if you do that as an adult, <laughs> just that yeah. and then you just, just lick the frosting off and put it back. Should I be doing that's, that during it while I play hands? I mean, that's psychopath that's, stuff. That's some alpha shit right there, honestly. <laughs> that's messed yeah. up. Are you going to call me if I'm licking the top the of a pen? top licker. <laughs> I don't know if I'm the more or licker. less likely to call someone that's licking the top of the <laughs> Honestly. Yeah. That's a pull. Put that pull in the chat. Yeah, that's weird. Yeah, that's a bad nickname, though. Top licker. <laughs> oh, God. I don't want to be called top licker. <laughs> oh. That is a pretty yeah. bad nickname. Top, what? top licker. We were talking about, like, if you're just licking the top of a cupcake. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then put it back. Are you more likely to <laughs> oh, call Oh, we're putting it back game? now. Now it's a whole other level. <laughs> that's Todd stuff. That's yeah. They're all his cupcakes. Yeah, that's true. 
That's what he did on the way here. He licked all of them, and now he's casually throwing it in there. There's like a little meal on top of each of those cupcakes. So like... That's pretty. Oh, they like. I'm gonna look at. Is it like voodoo style, or they're just like all crazy? Uh, I was gonna say they didn't go crazy. Holy crap! Those are beautiful. Checks down in this limped pot. I, just, I get one of those. Llama's got the best hand. You know, you say cupcakes, you don't think they're gonna look like that. No, I didn't go to H E B. Yeah, those are nice. It's like he's thinking about going for a little bit of value. Does bet the river. Mrs. Cupcake, the assist on that. She told me about the place. He's like, you can go drive over to 183 and get it. Takes it down. Do you guys do butt channel fish hands? Just because she wants to call me. Every 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 blind counts. I'm trying to get you know. That sounds a little bad. I was watching. I was like, it's serious. I look at ten dollars. Hey, how dare you? I like the water. You know, I gotta reorient into poker mode. I haven't played in a while. I appreciate it. Here you it's go. room. Yeah, that's that's like the most alpha room. drink order I've heard in a long <laughs> time. Right, it's not warm. Yeah, it's room. Yeah. Thank you very much. <laughs> this is room ten. A couple of jack deuces oh, into the muck. Oh, are there? I'm sorry. <laughs> I didn't know there were better water bottles. Did I get one of those too? I don't think we have too yes, much please. to play with in this hand. Uh, I don't. <laughs> Mom's in there, though, the 10 5. It'll be warm in no time. Came here to play some hands. I tech. Mm. I like it exactly. It's hard here for Pierre. I just like those waters a lot better than I like these. If it's 82, I send it back. Well, it's it's like we're in a time warp. These guys just played a hand with the same flop. Sure. Same action, same probably. You have the same hand? I don't think we can uh, actually. Same, same action, same flop. Yeah, they're checking it. And Llama has a similar yeah, hand. The tap water? I didn't this time it's pair versus pair, though. The ultimate I'm cooler. Some part of Austin, ultimate. Right? Someone might lose $15 I mean, no, here, Brady. I, I like briefly Ten. saw it, you know. $10 extra. <laughs> That's the kind of action you're only going to see here at the lodge. <laughs> I had to let you get there. Yeah. <laughs> the product sells board. itself. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe I'll win for bucks because it's a six. <laughs> Thank you to Dat Win with that 1999 Super Chat Sandwich for Rick. As we see our second look at the cumulative winnings here. Not too much blood so far. Pierre up 800, E up 510, and Justin down 985. Everyone else pretty much even. And we're playing 5-5-10 with a $10 big blind Annie. Rather, 5 10. I'm really glad we, we moved over to only using big blind any games. I gotta be honest with you, I was playing in 2-5 yesterday, and I was wishing that there was a big blind any. I mean, it's just the better format. It, you're supposed to play more hands, you're supposed to be more aggressive, you can fight more, you can play more hands. Also, no money comes off the table here in Texas because there is no rake. So the stacks grow exponentially, especially at smaller stakes. You get to play deep stack poker, and you get to play a lot more hands. It's a superior way. To play right, poker. Yeah. Anyway, back to the action. We have a big one brewing. Pocket right. jacks for okay, E, I, ace king for cupcake. Yeah, we're e, play a three bet pot. E does just call the three bet, which is very reasonable. We get the nine five six flop with two hearts. Neither player with a heart. E makes a procedural check to the razor. Goes check check. Five of clubs on the turn. E's got to be feeling pretty good about his jacks now. His hand can benefit a lot from just taking it down. So I think he'd bet, but he does not. Goes for the check, and now cupcake is going to bet himself. It looks like he's going relatively big, 250 into 375. Kind of a weird spot here. Oh, 350. Cupcake, by checking the flop back and betting this turn, he's rubbing some kind of specific hands. Maybe a hand like ace five suited. Maybe a hand like aces with a heart, something like that. Yep. But really, he's mainly just looks kind of bluffy to me as, I, I agree. as someone that's played a lot of poker. Why would you not bet the flop yeah, with your really overpair? The, um, the but anyway, he does fire the turn, and now he's reaching for trips again, Mike. Yeah, I, it looks like he's going to go for, I guess this is a bluff, trying to get E to fold a hand like maybe fours or like maybe like a nine, something like that. So I guess it was kind of a protection bet by Cupcake turning into this yeah, bluff I mean, on the river. He's going to sniff it out, though. He picks up the chips, drops them in. Oh, oh yeah, it's sparks. Yeah, you can do that. They, I think the other place in orange. Yeah. yeah. Wow. That $1,975 pot is going E's way. It would have been interesting to see what would have happened there if he had just bet the flop. I think if he goes bet, bet, jam, it's going to really put Jax in a tough situation. Um, but I think for two streets with an overpair like Jax, even on a scary board, well, not that scary, no overcards, but regardless, a board with a one to a straight. It's going to be kind of hard to fold for just two streets of betting. Definitely. Yeah, go for it. Thank you. What do you got in there? What's that? What do you got in there? Uh, a little over two. 
No, we no, have, in, the, in, the, in the flask. Oh. oh. <laughs> he was like, I'm not concerned with the dollar. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. We're, We're just drinking. down to business. He's like, alcohol, I'm in. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, hey, has it going or anything? Uh, no, that's uh, Yeah, I was going to stop and get something. Oh, but oh that's I right. Yeah, okay. That's my drink. I can, uh, I can pretend it's soda and drink a bunch of it. Do you know I used to like uh, Pellegrino, but then after Topos, the Pellegrino doesn't do it for me anymore. Pellegrinos are it's uh, bullshit. It's much like, less carbon. Yeah, it's just yeah. like I drink it and it's like, what is this? Yeah, exactly. Nice hand, man. That's on the same way. Topo hits you differently. It really yeah. does. Uh, Raise uh, call here yeah. pre flop. <laughs> Poker line with the That's King Five of Clubs. He flops quite big. What do you flush do you draw you and straight draw? Well, nut flush draw, Mike. Game. He's got the yeah, nut flush draw. Club comes in. Oh, that's yeah, the yeah, nuts. He quickly yeah. check folds versus the big bat yeah. with Jack Great ten. Yeah, Someone on the tight cold side, cold. but versus an yeah, under the gun raise. Yeah. Yeah. More what reasonable. Was the, what was the flop size? Like like he went seventy five and a ninety. Like ten a day now. I drink a ton. It's pretty tight folds with Jack ten. Yeah, you generally don't fold when you have the gutter, right? Like if you have ten nine, you could let it go for sure. But yeah, when you have the gutter to go with it, those are kind of the ones you just suck it up and call with, even though it doesn't feel. So great. Hey, you know you're gonna manly be behind, but sometimes you're ahead and occasionally you can get there. So yeah, exactly. And then when you do have like the 10-8, the queen two, you can kind of consider just letting it go because you don't have too much playability beyond your pair, which is merely a bluff catcher. Cupcake limping in here under the gun, ace to offsuit. He's here to play some hands. I think it used to be Coca-Cola. I think bought them out. Table filling out, by the way. Players are arriving. It still says mineral water. Yeah. Pierre looks down the A7 to heart. He's going to raise it up. $50 to go. Yeah. <laughs> Mineral and water. I don't know if it's true, though. Yeah. 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 I didn't know that. Got bubbles. I know that. They're all good. Yeah, I mean. <laughs> they got more intense after Coca Cola. Can't complain. Bottom, so so they they doubled down on their different. Thanks for believing me. E with the 6 5 of hearts here. In the small blind, he is going to go for the 3 bet. I do not. Makes it 200 to go over Pierre's 50. Pierre's got a hand that he can definitely continue with. All right, all right. Can kind of go either way, four bet or call. He does just call. This flop has some hearts. We're going to see some action. <laughs> no hearts. It's, in a good, it's a good one for E. Oh, this is actually an interesting pot developing here. So we have an open ender for E. We have middle pair top kicker for Pierre. Both players with enough to kind of play some poker, but don't have it locked up. Don't believe me. He bets the flop. Pierre will make the call. Ten on the turn. Will E continue to tell the story? He raised pre. He bet the flop. He's saying, "Hey, you know what? I have a good hand, Pierre." No, he's gonna he's gonna wave the white flag. I really like betting his hand on the turn. I That's love an betting his hand check. on the turn. And now he picks up showdown value, so this is more than likely gonna go check check. Well, you might be thinking though on the turn is you have so many other hands you could bluff with if you're E, Ace Queen, Ace Jack, Queen Jack suited, stuff like that. Maybe you just prefer betting those over the six five, but perhaps yeah. Now E is going for a block bet, very Can tiny bet. For fifty dollars. <laughs> I don't beat one single hand. I mean, I guess. But you do, Pierre. But you do. Yeah. No, no. I mean that's okay. I'll give it. I have a six. Oh, I beat a six. <coughs> no. <Let's go. laughs> So he does go for that block bet. That's insane. I thought you would have just had an ace. I guess well, I thought I was getting max value out of an ace there. Rick, 100%. Rick, the last time I fold 10 4 off. Yeah, Pierre's right. Italian man <laughs> faces baffling river bet. Right. Yeah. In the blender. <coughs> In the blender over 50. Write that down, Mike. That was a good title. That was a good title, yeah. yeah. I, really I didn't think you were. Tell the team. Uh, alert alert the YouTube like team. Bet more. I thought you were looking for some action. What was it again? Italian man faces baffling river bet. I was right but wrong. I was like, I think he's just got an ace. That's good. But he had me fucking crushed. The thumbnail just has Pierre's face yeah. looking yeah. puzzled. Yeah. Yeah, we got some high quality photos of Pierre, too, so that'll be easy. Very nice. That said, though, he's a quite stoic guy, so mm. I don't know if we'll have that expression that we're looking for specifically. Fair enough. I forgot the cardinal rule. Don't fuck with Pierre. So Ace, ten of clubs. So Taking it out pretty popular. He always has my fucking streaming. number. Oh. All you had to do was bet um, three times. I, not really. I, I mean, obviously, <laughs> some players are shared, but we, there's a lot of people, new people. Another look at the cumulative winnings. Cupcake, after losing that pot with Ace King versus uh, E, was he's game. now down $1,000. But as Doug said earlier, the knight is young. Instead, and it remains that way. Congratulations, you played yourself. <laughs> it would have been even worse if he had like seven or seven, six, two pair. Yeah. Six, eight or something, yeah. where he just beats you by one pip. Yeah. Yeah. Nice kicker, dude. <laughs> I feel like 
like a, I feel like a bigger idiot. I like the look on his face when he won the hammer. <laughs> yes, <laughs> that's what I'm saying. You were so happy. <laughs> no, dude, I had, thought I was getting Yeah, he and I were on the same page. He was like, I'm fucking paying you fifty dollars. I was like, yes, Ace Nine, no good. Clumsy caller. King seven four top pair for cupcake. Checks around. You wouldn't even have a pair. Salim gonna take a stab. One twenty five. Cupcake gonna make the call top pair. Oh, is that coming soon? Firmly in the lead, but there are some interesting turns here. Ooh, spicy one, Mike. Feels weird calling you Mike. Mm -hmm. You gotta go back to Brady. You can call me Brady. That's gotta be Brady. Yeah. Yeah. I've never uh, called you Mike, like Mike once in my entire life. I don't think oh, you have. There are too many Mikes out there. I agree. But there's only one Brady. Only one Brady. Yep. Yep. I can think of. Yeah, these are. <laughs> I, did I tell you I went through my phone the other day? I had 22 no, no, Mikes. No. It won't be I was trying to find it. You have mentioned that to me. I was trying to find a specific mic. And I had to scroll for just pages. Literally pages of mics. As we see Salim take it down with that turn bet. Aggression pays off for him. Pick up that flush draw. Yeah, nice bet here. If you can buy it outright, it's eight grand, but then there's right. there's like rentals and stuff. And yeah. Insane. If you like rent it from uh, Deck Master or whatever, yeah. Shuffle Master or whatever. Deck Mate. Deck Mate, Shuffle yeah. Master or whatever. New room just opened by oh, me and there's like 60 mate? tables. They all have shufflers. Yeah. <laughs> there's literally like yeah. one table in that Texas? runs a day. Yeah, in Houston. Yeah. yeah. They're just like dead right now. Yeah, they just hate life because that no. overhead is egregious. Yeah. Oh, okay. It's Tito. <clears throat> huh? Oh, yeah, which, oh, you're yeah, different. Oh, 5, 10, 10. Gotcha, gotcha. What's your name on the stream? Tito. Oh, she, she called you Alan. Alan's cool. Mm. I think Alan was who was supposed to be here. But, uh... Oh. Yeah, that's yeah, what they said. Alan. I'm getting my <coughs> phone. I haven't looked, but... This is like, probably not Oh. Yeah. <laughs> you know, it's not... You're not wrong. There. I haven't it's not even a funny <laughs> nickname. <laughs> no, Alan? Sure. It's like, <laughs> play the whole Alan. Alan. It's kind of funny because I'm not. Alan. Oh, <laughs> Alan's like the dude who fucked something up. Come on, Alan. You can never look. Yeah. Action folds around to the big blind. He raises it up to $40. Tito, who recently joined the table. Llama doesn't have much going on in the first straddle, but he's going to call anyway. Oh, my mistake. That was not a raise. We have a double straddle on. Four-way limp pot with some card sharing here. We have three-way. Real premium hands here, pre-flop, Brady. Real premium stuff. It's going to be, as Slick Rick likes to say, a jump ball here. Whoever wants it most is going to pick up this pot. A couple players pick up a gutter. Tito checks, and it checks around again. Tito is going to take a stab. You can't check, guys. Coming up at the end of this month and early next, the Spring Madness 100K Guarantee. This is our seasonal 100K Guarantee tournament that we're running several times a year. We ran it during Black Friday. Then we ran it in winter. Now we're running it again here in spring. 100K Guarantee, $300 buy-in, four total day ones. They're on Friday and Saturday, March 31st and April 1st. They start at 11 a.m. and 5 p.m. You can come play the morning flight, and if you're not successful, you can play the night flight too. So, great tournament. Come check it out. Oh, it's like the 777 game. I was very confused. When I, uh, I was like, no, I got an eight doogie, I got an eight low, and he was like, that's none of that's good. <laughs> none of that is good. Those are the best bluffs, though, right? When you don't even know that uh -huh. you're bluffing. Oh, I was. I looked. I'm sure I looked very confident. Yeah. I was like, I don't know how to play these games. Put in four bets. It's like, yeah, 80, 80, 80, 80. Yeah. Couldn't wait to get it in. It's like, all right, yeah. man. <clears throat> yeah, I was in it to win it, dude. Another jump ball situation here. A couple players do have gutters, but nothing nothing too strong. Tito's taking a stab, and it's going to get it done right here on the flop. Whoa. Don't brag. Heating up. <laughs> I'll I'm out. Straight. I'm out. <laughs> <laughs> you want to do the nick game when you see the monoflop? Yeah. Monocolor? Oh, sure, yeah. Full game? 
Co color or, or the... It's the, called the Knit Game. Just color. Oh, and you play that? Oh, that's the stand-up game? Is the Knit Game? Yeah, yeah we almost stand-up. Stand we we rebranded. Oh, okay. Like we're, get, we're getting get older. Old. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's exhausting already. This is by far my favorite. Already had enough extra stuff. Everyone was getting too no fit. That's burning yeah, calories. Everything, all this <laughs> everything I love about the game and nothing I hated about it. When you're six foot eight, you hate the stand-up game. Because you're like leaning over. You rip your pants for everybody to see. Six flex, buddy. That happened. Six foot eight, Brady. Nailed. They they <laughs> let me know that my pants Cupcake. were ripped after the stand-up game. <laughs> oh, good. Yeah. At least I told you. That, that is tall. Hour of, nice guys, man. Straight up hour. Of, All right, we got yeah, some yeah, hands so looking to play some poker. Right That's how you gotta be. Poker lion opening up the king jack. Cupcake yeah, and yeah, Tito That's both in there with some club right holdings. <laughs> Salim looks down at the ace seven in the straddle. What is he planning on doing? Oh yeah. I don't want to go. Discipline yeah. fold there. We're going to go three ways. <laughs> Jack, nine, deuce. Top pair for lion. I am six, two and a half, but thank you, Pierre. Oh, you're, you're six, four. Okay. Six, four is a cool height. If I could pick. It's going to bet the flop. Pants. I highly, you, I highly you, recommend you would resubscribe. Yeah. Would you, <laughs> you should try it. Would you rather be five five or seven five? Takes it down. Ooh. Five 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 five, 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 five seven, easily. Seven five is just healthy shoes later. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, your basketball so career though. Right. Why does everyone lie about their height, Brady? I think a lot of times it's not even <laughs> intentional. They just, they I, just I think convince the, themselves that's the wrong number. Yeah, I think you sort of unconscious, like subconsciously, are like giving yourself that extra inch, that extra half inch, whatever yeah. it is. If they're lying more by more than like two inches, it's kind of similar when people lie about their age. They know what they're doing. Yeah, like, yeah. And that's just sure. straight right. deceit. Okay. All right, now okay. Stop. Three, three, yeah, so I've always said I'm 6'3", but I measured and I'm 6'2 and a half. So I'm like, yeah, is it, is it Miss Ling say 6'3", and then I say 6'2 and a half, and then I'm like, does that just sound... Well, that's insane. <laughs> to say that? Yeah. Okay, so 6'3 it is. <laughs> Thank you, Brady. That's like I just like, needed the push to say 6'3". <laughs> you know what that reminds me of as we see Cupcake pick up sevens? It reminds me of when you're a kid, or like there's a kid and they're like eight, and, and you ask them how old they're, and they're like, I'm eight and three quarters, because yeah, they quarters. just want that extra three quarters, you know, because it's, it's significant. I know. You don't need the extra half inch, dog. Okay. Oh, that's nice. <laughs> Tito gets in there with the ace three offsuit. I'd be like, no way, dude, I'm five ten. Yeah, I guess I'm just, I, I don't want people to think I'm lying about my height and saying taller. People get angry on the internet, Mike. Why, why do they do that? Why are they so mad? Have people gotten angry about, at you about that. height? I've seen that. I mean, I guess no one's ever said anything mean about me on the internet. But I've heard of other people it happening yeah, to. Yeah, fair, fair. Yeah, it does happen. All right, uh, sevens here against the ace three from Tito. No one has improved as we approach the turn. Turns the nine of clubs, pairing the nine, and Tito's going to fire again. Tito looks like he wants some action today, Brady. Yeah, he's getting after it. That's a flop and turn here. And that's not a great run out to try to get sevens to fold. One of the better runouts I could have imagined for sevens on the flop. Oh, he's reaching for chips, though. Yeah, he's going to put those sevens in a tough spot. Not sure that's going to be enough, though. He bets 350. 450, rather. Yeah, it's like... But it is. Cupcake gets away from the sevens. Pretty miserable spot with sevens. A lot of draws missed, though. Could definitely see putting in the hero call. Tito arrived late, and he's weaving through traffic. <laughs> Weaving. No blinker. Right into the lanes. Here we can see the cumulative winnings. Pierre and E both up a thousand bucks. Justin and Cupcake both down a thousand six hundred respectively. Everyone else kind of in the mix. Is Lama your favorite poker player? Of all players? Yeah. <laughs> oh, well, that's pretty strong. My favorite poker player. I find when you play poker at a high level, it's kind of hard to consider anyone other than yourself your favorite poker player. I, I can imagine, yeah. But if you rule yourself out... When I deploy the wheels, we're all the same. That's just Tinder bio. No, he's not my favorite poker player. Shots fired. 
as we see Salim find the three bet with a7 offsuit versus Llama's loose open, and he's going to take it down. Well timed from Salim. These Llama opens are just real llama -y. Yep. The jack deuce off, the jack five suited. Jack deuce off wasn't even open. He raised that over a limp. <laughs> yeah, I isolation. Another player had showed a willingness to play the hand, and he's still like, jack two off? Let's go. Let's take it to the dance floor. He won the pot, though. He had a pair. That's why we're sitting here, Doug. What if the dude doesn't care that you're taller? Is it a you thing, or is it like the dudes have a problem with it? I mean, I agree with you. I'm just asking if it's like, you said heels. So like, is it because you don't want to be taller than them in heels, or you think they don't want you to be taller than them? Usually guys don't like that. I've never had this problem. <laughs> yeah. You never had to like tippy toes in a picture? I went in on a date one time with a girl that was <laughs> I did. He's crouching. Wow. <laughs> and we both were like, nope. Mm -mm. Really? She married a five foot 10 guy. I married a five foot girl. Five foot four he looks you down at pocket jacks here. He's going to open it up. Weird. All your kids would have been in the NBA. <laughs> King <laughs> eight off. Why did you marry the six foot four? Get in there. I'd be in the NBA. Like, well, little blind versus blind action. I just need a raise. <laughs> Poker line with the re raise. You're, you're six two and you're 14. You're doing okay. 135. I was, like, I was five ten when I was 14. So he's four inches taller than I was at that age. Pocket jacks again here for E. Gotta decide, does he want to play for all of it? Blind versus blind, or does he want to trap? Worst nightmare. <laughs> it's like he is going to fast play and put in the four bet here. <laughs> well, I mean, he Gotta say, I like how both players are playing this one preflop. Like Poker Lion picked a nice hand to re-raise out of the big blind. He's, he's the computers have taught us that um, these offsuit kings right, do right, like right, to three bet right, blind versus right, blind. Right, yeah, but it ain't right, Brady. It ain't right. What well, ain't right? It's just a, yeah, it's just a king out. and an eight. Like it's not even a real hand. It's not, it's a it's a, not even a drawing hand. I think yeah, you have the eight seven suited whatever. But but this I had a friend computer's coming into our country here in Texas and telling us <laughs> what to do with our king eights. I'll have none of it. And he pays the price. And a real hand takes it down. There's only a dollar. That's all I'm saying. And then and then. And then he kept growing, and now he's taller than me, so oh. it was more of an investment for him, I think. <laughs> I, think Pierre, I think Pierre might have been at the table when someone was, they agreed to bet me that my name wasn't E. <laughs> no, I wasn't. Were you not at the table? Man, that was... Wait, your legal you know. name is E? Yes. Really? That's yes. I don't believe That's you. That's fucking yeah, yeah, we can That's bet. <laughs> we can bet. 20,000. See, <laughs> joke's on you, man. The end of that story is I lost the bet, so... <laughs> oh, you lost the bet. No, obviously I didn't lose no, the bet. No, he's hustling. <laughs> Like, let me finish the story. No, no, no. I'm just like, I'm just hustling yeah. Pierre, obviously. Yeah. yeah. Trying to get my money back. You changed it, though, right? To E? No. No. Oh, you No, good. that was like a, like accidental birth name. Oh, okay. Yeah. I heard someone named I. It was like, I want to do an I name. And then they got distracted and they just left it on the certificates. Oh, I, yeah. It was some, <laughs> mine was something similar. My yeah. mother was just literally two stone and put my first name as in the middle and put my middle initial as my first uh, name. That's awesome. So that's how I got stuck. That's, that's got to be one of the greatest names ever. Do you pu get pulled over by the police and they, what do they say? You know, knock on wood, but I haven't been pulled over since I got that car. Really? But before that, yeah, I got pulled over a lot. That BMW, for some reason, just, but like, I drive like a grandma now. Um, what do they say when you see the, the name? They're just like, what's your name? I'm like, it's E. I'm like, what's the rest of it? I'm like, the rest of my Focusing here on the poker now for a moment, like, poker lion. Bang the flop it's with e. six six twos, but Justin has three of a kind. It's it's worse like just gonna put out a raise. Like e, like, yes, like e. Hard to imagine e. Poker e. Line be like able to fight letter, back like, too much, no, and he like will make it lay down, <laughs> make yeah. the lay down like, here on like, the flop. So e. I'm like, dude, I, my brother in Christ, I, what do I have to do here? <laughs> Can you use it in a sentence? Right. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. E, yeah. He punched you after yeah, you asked too many yeah. questions. <laughs> That's the sentence. You like a little cool. Lamborghini out there. Have you thought about old Lambo? Naming kids it's like gold. I owe you. Oh, I. I well, I someone gold. gave me the funny idea when I was younger. They were like, if you have a kid, like right you have there. to name him oh, really? like lowercase e. And I was like, oh, <laughs> little e. Or, or e square. Look at it while you're looking at your cards. I can see it, but I'm lazy. So it's <laughs> but, but no, no, I went the other direction and got the. Yeah, I can see it around corners. gold. Yeah, it's a little different. None of those for me. That's my first dream name, lazy eye. Ooh, that flash. No, it just flashed to me. Yeah. I mean, I saw it, but how easy I saw yeah. a black car, but I have no idea what. Yeah, I don't know who that Lamborghini is. I've never seen it before, unless it's like he's the guy losing wrapped it or something. Five hundred dollars a time at two <laughs> one two, right? Yeah. Every second, it's always something crazy. It's always those guys. I love it. Yeah. 
I like Lorenzo's though, the blue one. Yeah. This is cool. Justin picking up the Cowboys. Second appearance from the boys today. Going three ways to the flop. Get the ace, ace, eight. Tito gets a little piece with the nine, eight. The two. Justin going to continue. Looks like he's going to go pretty big as well. He goes 200. Tito makes a quick call with his eight. We're going to take a turn heads up. Card below the board. Justin's going to slow down with a check. Tito's going to go for a bet. going to take it down. Who has the the Tesla that says 3 bet light? 3 bet light? I know it is. I'm going to say it okay. on the stream. Oh, it's just 3 bet light? Light. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I like that better. I'll, 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 what's his address? Yeah. yeah. I'll tell you after this. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, if it's not known info, then yeah, don't share. I got a social too. You got a what? Oh, it's social security. Away. Yeah. It's uh. Yeah. Mother's maiden name is. <laughs> Forty. Forty. Could have just let me take it. Apparently, Could've. didn't have to be a Bob dick about it. It's a. It's Ooh. a. <laughs> I should have three bet light. Yeah, we were just like, yeah, three bet light. Somehow Julie was just like, you want you take it around? around, around, with around <laughs> Julie's like the friendliest person in the world. Did let you take she just gets in there. Yeah, she definitely gets in there. She's like, I went from like no knowing her at all to like, oh, we're like best friends now or something. Yeah. <laughs> it's just like, she's so friendly. She just left this morning. Oh, yeah. She went back to New York or Vegas or whatever. She went to New York for like, Half a day and then just went to Vegas. Yeah, we were in the, me and Josh were, were in Vegas for the store max. Oh, you were there, but you, and we were at the RM. We were like, okay, we're going to grab dinner. And then she comes by and she goes like, where are we going for dinner? <laughs> oh, I, <see. laughs> I guess we're going to get far. <laughs> I, I, I like her though. She's, uh, she makes friends really easy. Justin takes it down with that well-timed river bet. And as our good friend Slick Rick just said in the chat, gave me the idea to do it, let's get a roll call. We got a little under 800 in the chat. Where are you watching from? Let us know. So, so if it folds to me. Yeah, the next time it folds to me. Yeah. Pot. Pot limit, you pots. can only bet two streets. Okay. Anything, person who's from wait, the farthest what, away what, wins like, a anything. cookie hand delivered by Slick Rick. Anything goes. Yeah. But like, don't do a 10x raise. Just stand it's pot limit. Yeah, it's oh, pot it's pot limit. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. I mean, you can still get all in though. <laughs> yeah, if I keep raising you. Yeah. You're running the cap small. <laughs> This <laughs> is every time it falls to us. Every time. Okay. Okay. It's not happening. Shuttle down. <laughs> you guys need to tighten yeah, up. Yeah. No. <laughs> <laughs> it will happen at least one or twice in the session. Uh, it's gonna happen during the uh, the Nick game. <laughs> oh shit! And I'm definitely never. I'm going. Happen. I'm going hard. <laughs> it's like yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna price him out of this pot. <laughs> one twenty-five. We oui, oui. Good matchup of hands here. Salim raising it up with King Queen of Hearts. Pierre picks up the Ace Queen offsuit. He just calls. Flop comes Ace King Jack. Both players with a pair and a gut shot. Pierre dominating with that Ace. Just try to lower it just a little bit. And everyone looked at you right when you did it, man. Trying to be discreet about it. My knees, like, Selene bets the flop gets called, and both players Check turn the straight. This one's going to be a chop, good. more than likely. 525 in the middle. Spot's just awkward. Cause it's just like, yeah. Yeah. This is a weird, weird size table. Is the new table going to be nine top? Who knows? I have no idea. 
privy to that kind of information. Not dialed in. No. Pierre's going to just check call with the straight. You get the eight of hearts on the river. Both players with the nuts. Pierre checks it over, hoping Salim has a hand that he can bluff with. But we're just going to pass some time for a moment here while these guys get some money in on the river and then chop up the pot. The one to the straight spots, especially when it's a high board, it's kind of hard for that much money to really go into them. It's so easy for someone to have a straight. 600. Yeah, I mean, Salim, to be putting in money without a straight here would pretty much have to have like five, six of clubs, something like that. Not incredibly likely. Jack, nine of clubs. Yeah. Right. <clears throat> Chop it up. We want you to While we chop this up, time <laughs> for a word from our sponsor. What's up, gamblers? My name's Alex, and I'm a big poker player. I'm a big sports better. I've made over $400,000 sports betting. It's documented a bunch of different places, so you can look it up, odds jam. But essentially what this tool does is it's a data-driven sports betting product. It pulls odds from sports books and shows you discrepancies, plays where you can actually have an edge. Right, So out of the millions of odds on sports books, what Odds Jam will do is show you big discrepancies like this one, where every book is pricing this wager around minus 115, and you're getting plus 106 on Caesars. No emotions, data-driven sports betting. Check it out. Odds Jam, seven-day free trial. I think you'll really like it. I appreciate you guys. Thank you. Remember, if you head over to Oddsjam, you can use coupon code LODGE. Oh, I'm in. Yeah, you like the chat? Yeah, I dig it. I guess I should face it. Yeah, we appreciate Oddsjam for sponsoring the stream. Go check them out if you are a sports better. As we resume the action, Cupcake picks up a six suited. He's going to race it up to 50. Tito's on the button. He's going to re race to 100 with Queen Jack offsuit. A huge part of sports betting, by the way, is making sure you're getting the the best line. So if you do sports bet a lot, something like Odds Jam can, can help you make sure you're getting the best price on your action, and that can be the difference between a winning bet and a losing bet. After a couple streams, it's like definitely adds up in the long run too. As we go three ways to this flop, Salim calling out of the straddle with eight seven off. He flops a gutter. Cupcake's got nothing with the a six suited, and Tito, after re raising, hits that queen. He's going to continue his aggression. He's going to fire the flop. This is Beaver, made by Beaver. Whoa. So people with red paint can wait yeah, for this side. Yeah, you can also buy an I Heart NY shirt in Texas. That's a side. I actually grew up in New York, so... 8-7 here. Does yeah, have you know, a gut right, shot. If you're in on the next region, uh, you're nine, yeah. Yeah, yeah, right. Player left right. behind, though. Also, Maybe he was closing the action to feel a little bit better yeah. about it. Oh, yeah, I was actually... I went to high school. <laughs> high school Mississippi. What is he going to decide to do? He's mulling it over. Going to lay it down. That's a L.A. hat. Been the Burning Man a couple times. Carmel by the Sea, Northern California. Oh. Yeah, yeah. It had to be custom made because my head's too that, big. That, that's a man that's been to a festival or two. Yeah, that's that type of hat for it's sure. A bestie oh. hat. It's Dude, a I work hat. on RVs for a living. I'm always outside in the sun. You can see this thing is all stained and dirty. Yeah, it's almost like sweat. We had we had the yeah. same idea too. I was like, for sure. <laughs> yeah. That guy's like, I'm never getting sunburn on my neck again. Nope. <laughs> nope. I hate the sun. I wear the sunglasses We're in everywhere. California. Um, we were down in uh, San Diego for about a year. We actually oh, live cool. in an RV, a mobile home, That's and we awesome, travel man. around the country. Well, I've lived That's there. Amazing. My parents live there too. Oh, it's so it's like the weather is just natural for humans there. It's crazy. Yeah, it's you just feel comfortable. San Diego's really cool. You could be naked downtown. It's great. Not that yeah. the laws will let you. Doesn't stop some people. <laughs> <laughs> you can in Austin. Yep. When I went through Key West, it was like that. You'd be surprised. It was a dude that turned a mask into a jock strap. He was wearing just that. Yeah. Rough life. That was weird. Yeah. Spreading awareness. Just walking around. Yeah. Spreading oh. something. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's true. So soft. Some We're uncomfortable to table talk We're today. Huh? Yeah. It said, hey, do you want to do that game too? Oh, I was just. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, no. <laughs> Almost as bad. I was in Tennessee. So far, the table talk's been wilder yeah, than yeah, the action. Yeah, that's, that's that. certainly true. Way better oh, it's, it's exactly what it sounds like. That's you know, awesome. Giant skyscrapers and shit. No. Another look at the winnings so far. Not too much movement. Ian Pierre both still up $1,000 and 
and you cupcake like had to work to hide your accent. Is down that? a couple of okay. I actually did have yeah. speech therapy for like two years. And yeah, when I moved from Texas to New York, because it sounded like this. Yeah. I was like, I love my cousin. You're from Texas? Mm -hmm. No, no, Tennessee. Like middle of nowhere, Tennessee. Ace but queen for cupcake. Like, apparently huge because like raising it up. Fifty dollars to, to go. The proximity of Nashville. It's like 30 minutes from Nashville. Ooh, just an AC of diamonds into the muck. Worse than Austin. I'll hope you keep some real estate. Pierre is yeah. king here. I was there when I was 16. Okay. <laughs> there is 50, right? Pot starting to brew. Yeah, I would love to. It's going to raise up to 150. Now Salim looks down to 97 of diamonds. We do know a couple of diamonds are already dead. AC of diamonds into the muck. He's going to go Sleeps. ahead and raise it back up. Yeah, he puts in the four bet with the Gabe Paul hand. Yeah, I moved from New York to Texas. In Tree Fitty. My last name's Green. Looks like Cupcake's going to make a quick call, and this is kind of going to give Pierre a nice situation. Kind of got to be licking your chops when you have this, money, this many chips behind. Not so much. There's already $870 in the pot. Pretty beautiful spot for Ace King to just rip it all in. That's hilarious. In, like, at recess. Yeah. Sorry, Mr. Green. Like, yeah. But I was too young to appreciate it. They should have given you a like, name, no, to expect, it. like, a letter or something. Somewhere like, G. A. Like, Mr. G. Some name that would have been. That's <laughs> so why you can't always see monsters in the closet. Sometimes it's just the 9 7 and the Ace Queen. Of course, sometimes it is also the Aces, but. Did you play the odds, you play the math, and this jam with Pierre is either going to take this down pre flop yeah, or he's going to get it in ahead. Oh. Oh, okay, okay. Ouch. I'm never going to do it again, though. Somewhere Westlake is losing his mind. I did it one time, too. I thought it was like, they, they gave you a little <coughs> bag bonus. I've done that exactly <laughs> once. Yeah, yeah. get those down. <laughs> I'm not going to show you kings anymore. You know people play as many bowls, have a good time. Do you have kings? I'm not saying. <laughs> Tough spot now for Cupcake with Ace Queen. If he thinks Pierre has something like Jack, he's getting the odds to call. But if he knows it's Ace King, he's going to have to lay it down. He's getting some pretty good odds here. Someone just did that to me. Like I three bet with Kings, and he literally showed me aces and told me to fold. It's, it's, it, everything was racked up. He's like, I don't want to lose. Just fold. And he's like doing it all with aces, and I was like, Oh yeah, like I don't know. <laughs> and you a million dollars? No. You're like, I think you're bluffing. I'm not folding. The bad thing is, I ran twice and I hit my set on the first run. We run it twice if you call. Oh, I Pierre no offering to run it twice before the call. Yeah, okay. That's got to be some sort of tell. I don't know how to read into it. Yeah. <laughs> Hard to say. All right. He does, does call. Let me call. No, it is two and a half hours. See the queen. Good read. Good read. No pair. No pair. What he said, no fair. <laughs> yeah, that makes it worse. But he's got out. Here we go, Ace King versus Ace Queen. Not twice, though. This is Queen once. Ooh, Ooh 8, eight five. Nope. five. Five. Yeah, no pairs the board. We'll chop. Four. Four. Four, four five or Queen. Right, nope. Queen None of them. Ace King holds in the first run. King. <laughs> I need to like Jack ten. I need queen. Four kings to come just now. Yeah, I know, right? Queen. Queen's coming. So is it. Hey. Queen, queen, queen in the window. The door. <laughs> window or door? <laughs> Oh, door. <laughs> is it window or door, chat? The window. The, I think door. it's the window card. Yeah, the second Do door card. Matter. Door card? What is the door card? That's What's thing, happening right, right That's now? A thing, right? That's definitely a thing. Window, help us out, chat. Door. We have 850 people. We need help. Is it both? So could, it, could it be both? <laughs> Queen in the door. Queen in the window. Window sounds yeah, more right than door. Might be a leak. He's like, I have Ace King. Yeah. Like, yeah. yeah. <laughs> was he serious or they kind of like know each other? Oh, that's right. Yeah. He's probably serious. He's just a wild guy. Yeah, he is a wild guy. He was absolutely Either way, chop it up. That was, up. In that moment. That was yeah. not a friend. That was a, the first board was a mono. He beat me in the pot. I'm like, oh, yeah. That's I, a think I think we've had like three or four. <laughs> yeah, here's a little pro <laughs> tip at home, by the way. Some people like to do a thing where you do the stand up game or the Nick game when you have an all one color flop. I'd recommend against that because no one ever remembers. It's just you sleep on it indefinitely and then someone goes, oh, yeah, what about the Nick game? Oh, yeah, have we had a. We've definitely had a flop with all the same color. Yeah, because somebody, somebody called me. All right, window it is. What is door card, though? Oh, stud. Thank you, Rick. Rick Antol, shout out. Thank you. That would have killed me, and I would have never figured it out because there's not so much stud content on the internet. I don't know if that. What's the door card in stud? 
First it's, up, it's like you're you oh, have okay. the two down, one up. That your door card's your one. I see. Why would I know a stud saying? Anyway, open from Tito. Do you ever be here? Four bet from Cupcake. Pocket Kings. Like three hundred fifty bucks. Do you have a pair? Yes. Ah, oh, fuck. Never mind. I had six, seven high. No pair I gamble. <laughs> No pair again. Honest poker here at the lodge. You ask your opponent what they have, and they tell you. Do you have a pair? You should have lied to me. Of course I'm lying, Phil. I mean, that's poker. He just said ace four, and you're like, Compared to half the hands you could have asked. No, so... The action's coming around. I mean, yeah, and as as it is, these guys are talking about some sports bet, and I say I'd be all in on that. Right as it's my action, and as soon as the words come out of my mouth, the dude slams his chips yeah, down. Slam, slams them down. And, and like, Jeremy, break it. Who this Jeremy said it was binding. Oh, I, don't know. Oh, it was a binding I, I knew that he was asking me for it. And he did it with. Can we just the knit game with is the, on. Right. You, if you're not familiar, I, this I, is I, formerly I, known I, as I, the stand up game. For a second, I wasn't all that mad about it. Win a pot, and your knit button goes away. The last person with a knit button pays the rest of the table a set bounty amount. Not sure what amount they're playing for. I'm sure we'll find out as they go. Yeah. Yeah. We're just taking a, I went a minute ago. We're taking a break. I thought that was all playing no, the game. Everyone like room. Everyone's <laughs> pissing suddenly? I mean, I already it's had to broken. go, but I was like, I can hold it. Listen, these man. are a lot less quality than I thought they were from the Listen, screen. man. There's some collusion going on. Yeah. <laughs> I feel way less safe now. Or I'm up maybe like 50 bucks. I think it's a good time to quit. These come up really, like, come up nice on the stream and they, they do just kind of they you guys really just want to collude while they're gone yeah, exactly. we've got a a team bathroom break <laughs> which you don't <laughs> see all that often in yeah. poker we'll just do this real quick but when you got to go you got to go and sometimes four guys all have to go at the same time kind of cute cute yeah. it reminds me of the ladies at the club <laughs> club yeah exactly <laughs> exactly justin picks up pocket tens he raises it up to 30 Tito calls with 8-4 suited. Yeah. Love to see Tito getting in the other day. We'd yeah. have seen a lot less flops if it wasn't for him. Wait, the Nick game's not going, right? Jake, we're just all I think it is. Yeah. So some players just gave up one of their hands in the Nick game. We were, gonna, we were gonna do it without you, but you came back. So. Tito bets 75 on the flop. Cupcake gets out of the way quickly with his four high. Now Justin has pocket tens. Brutal spot for Tez here. Two over cards. He does just let it go. Tito wins. Yeah. It's an easy way to get get rid of your knit button. Tito just taking it to the streets here. A lot of loose play. Thanks. Yeah, well, he, he, he missed the pregame uh, talk. Yeah, yeah, I missed everything. We're not even supposed to remind you. Mm. We're supposed to let you uh, let you muck and then not. And then be like, haha. Oh, okay. You're still okay. Like, so what are the rules of this I mean, mucking thing? thing? What is happening? Oh, you just if you win the hand, when you win, you have to show it. Okay. And then she and then she you can give. Oh, you have to show it. That's right. That's right. Okay. We we played one hand. I remember. I'm down to keep going. By the way, I don't want to be the be the one who got out early on it. It no, 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 you're good. <laughs> because, like, so it's on, uh, maybe, uh, maybe next uh, time you have to take a piss. Apparently you know it was I mean? on that hand. I'm, yeah, I don't know what's going on. I thought, Wait, like, oh, I thought we were waiting, but then we can't. I thought we were watching, too. But then yeah. I sit down, I sit down, and they're, like, she throwing the buttons away. You didn't get a 20. I was a little slow. He said he'd willing to take it back. I'm willing to take it back. That's fine. I don't care. Oh, you're the 20? It feels weird doing that, too. What's happening, Straddle? Okay, I'll go. Give me my I guess I'll go up to 40, then. The $80 straddle, straddle is yeah. on, one folks. This is going to be a big one. We go from playing 200 blinds deep in this 510 game to now playing, what is that, 25 blinds deep for the most part? We're playing 510, 20, 40, 80. Good spot to pick up a good hand here. As we see Salim first up. Looks like he has a hand that he wants to play. And he's putting together a healthy raise. Looks like 380. He's got pocket nines. Always fun to play these hands with a huge straddle on. You look down. Super high stakes spot to pick up, you know, something like ace king, something like nines. And here we see Justin jam it all in. So it's thirty-two hundred dollars, but it's essentially only forty-one blinds, considering they're playing with an eighty-dollar straddle on. Now Tito wakes up with sixes. Not the best spot for sixes. He does get out of the way. It's going to be interesting to see if Salim puts in the rest of the money here. That is your hand. What would you do here, chat? Let us know in Salim's situation. Obviously, you know Justin has ace king. Try to put that out of your mind. Yeah, yeah, 
you made that three hundred and eighty dollar raise and you faced this all in. Are you continuing for fifteen hundred more? Let me know in the chat. Whoever, whoever loses the Nick game gets the first pick of Cupcake, though. Ooh. Consolation prize. Pick this one. You cannot pick that one. Oh. You cannot pick that one. No. Oh, you have a special one? Oh, that one. Does it do something? Is it just. No, it, like, does the, it, the top come off and you hide your weed? It delivers it? chips to other people. <laughs> oh, it does. <laughs> I love it. It's an expert at that. Yeah. Oh, there is that. Yeah. Okay, 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 okay. So it's all of me. Yeah. What's your. It's essentially only a 20 big blind jam here, by the way. Salim started the hand with what? 20, 24 straddles, $1,900 or so. And the $80 straddle is on, so I, I mean, kind of hard to imagine folding nines. But he, it looks like he is consulting. Is that a conch shell? Conch shell says call, and he does just that. Queens? Nice. Nice. Wow. Yeah, you saved Fair money. fight. That was a reasonable tank. You saved me some money. I yeah, think. definitely. Not aces. <laughs> I mean, I would have been fine if it was aces. No, I know. Oh, I would have lost. I followed once. Yeah. <coughs> Whatever you want. You call. Run it. Run it. Run it. I rip it. Let it be done with. Right. New outs. Clean flop Clean for nine. nines. More outs for the ace king on the turn. Oh, Full dang. house on the river yeah, for Celine. He way. takes it down. I think he wins. Nice hand. I think he might. Man, what a sick turn, though. Hand 37. Action's starting to heat up. Yeah. All of them Are you kidding me? If you started yelling monkey, then you would hit it. 1800 and 7. Could have been worse. Could have hit an ace or a king on the turn. Mm. Yeah, and then just been done super dirty on the river. Yeah. <laughs> Feels so much worse when it's that way. Yeah, it does. <clears throat> Good nice Thank you. <laughs> if you haven't already, please subscribe to the channel. It's free. We're putting out streams four days per week. For now, we also put out tons of highlights compilations with some of the best hands from our streams. Nice answer, nice answer. Free to subscribe, and it helps us out a lot, so please hit that button. Uh, and while you're at it, hit the like button. We'd really appreciate it. Oh, uh, 16, 15, 25. Yeah, it matches the yeah. yeah. It is matched the stack. What's the big stack? Whatever he has. Yeah, probably that one. It's uh, 18 six. times 2 is what I think yeah. it just became. Mm -hmm. 35. Yeah, whatever. Somewhere between 35 and 4. Whatever. I think it was like 17 something. Look at those beautiful lodge chips. I don't know if you've played here or not. Some of these chatters, I'm sure, have. Some haven't. But the chips here, especially the new ones, those greens and blacks are of our new set. They are really cool. Really nice colors. Nice design. Really fun to play with. Yeah, yeah. And the $50 straddle is on again, or it could be 40 We'll see in a second. So the stakes are quadrupled for this hand. Sorry, 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 Salim's sorry, first up. Sorry, 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 sorry. We're all angry about it. Mm -hmm. Where did that shell even come from? I don't lock our odds on <coughs> ever happening. That game. Uh, yeah, I don't understand how he got it through security either. Oh. Just just the, the card cell yeah. setting on the wand. Put the SIM card in the hall, I guess. And... Calls around the table to Pierre, and he's going to raise it up out of the double straddle. Cupcake calls the ace eight offsuit. Llama with ace four suited. I would think he's going to get in there too. Oh, sorry. 
be a vlogger thing. Because he gets a discount on every action. Twice, I <laughs> know. <laughs> the same yeah, hand. Queen 7 7 flop. This kind of got steeper, too. <laughs> no player gets a piece. Pierre does have the backdoor flush draw with that ace of spades. Pierre's a strong player. I expect him to leverage that. Lama gets out of the way. Aggression takes it for Pierre. You guys have show for the yeah. yeah, it's it's up to you. <coughs> oh, it's it's not mandatory. No, it is, but it's still up to you. If, if, if you want to surrender the button. <laughs> oh, I see. But you could not surrender the button and yeah. not show. Damn. Uh, so if I would have mucked, that would have been <laughs> forfeit. Yeah. Oh. We would have told wanna, you eventually. I see someone do that on purpose. <laughs> yeah. As soon as she picked up just your like, card, yeah, I can't show this one. Yeah. I'll stay yeah. in. I'll stay in. We're just waiting. And then it's on the it's on the screen, man. Yeah. I would really like to see a, a jam there from Jake Preet. Or at least consider a jam. It's a Nick game. People are really trying to get out of there. You have way more fold equity than you might expect. You got to be a little more willing to go the distance when you're playing the Nick game. Yeah, for sure. Ace four suited a good hand to do it with as well. I was like, wow, John. I Twenty dollar straddle on this hand. Until you are so rich, and I am so emasculated right now. <laughs> like, my God. Justin lays down the ace five of clubs. Tito's in there with the ducks. He's thinking about this with the ace six diamonds. He's gonna make the call as well. Taking a flop. Three very different kinds of hands. What's she reading today? Ten nine six. Jack ten connects for top pair. He does have a little piece here with the bomb here in the back door, not flush draw. Because he didn't finish the book in one. <laughs> she's, one on the first, she's on the first. She's on the first. Pocket twos for Tito though. Not not too happy with this one, but he's firing anyway. Tito doing his thing, coming out firing. 375 is going to get through the bottom pair, but he's got to go up against the top pair. I've done it. You can do it. I don't think. Start something. Poker land reaching for chips. Well, Tito's moves finally. Get caught with his hand in the proverbial cookie jar, or will he get through another one? Ooh, Jack on the turn, top two for Poker Lion. Tito's gonna fire again. Five fifty on the turn into a turned top two pair for Poker Lion. Bit of a dicey spot. He just calls here with top two. The river could be a seven, an eight, a diamond, a queen, a king. So many cards. And he's just going to rip it right here on the turn. Just a lowly pair of twos for Tito here, but he's thinking it over. <laughs> I, got I mean, I guess he could be up against <laughs> something. Ace, queen of diamonds? Something that's worse than Ace, twos? Ace, queen of diamonds? Pass that shit over. <laughs> Poker line does take it down. <laughs> what book did you buy? It's called The Road. Oh, that's a good one. Yeah, yeah we talked about that last time we were. Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah. You, yeah, 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 yeah. I still haven't started it. <laughs> I, I started the first chapter. That's it. That's it's awesome. about a. Uh, it's the same guy that wrote. Uh, no Country for Old Men. No Country for Old Men, yeah. It's a good one, I read The Road, yeah. Yeah. Dark. It's dark, yeah. Sure I, I watched the movie. Yeah. Yeah. It's about it's a post apocalyptic. Yeah. Yeah. Another look at the winnings for the day so far. Still in the early hours. <laughs> Salim and Pierre up about 2K. Was there a big pot with Salim while I was gone? Yeah, so uh, with the $80 straddle on, Salim raised it up to 380 with pocket nines. Uh, and then the four seat. Justin picked up ace king. He jammed. So he called. Sleep on the flip. Classic coffee, flip. Classic yeah. race situation. <laughs> to me, it's uh, morning right now. There's no time in this room. That is true. Yeah. Can we just 
when we were playing after the stream the other day, it was like a time capsule. It's even more of a time capsule here than it is. Oh, no, I got to watch through there. the door, though. Yeah. So. There's no clock in the studio room, <laughs> which was not an accident. Really? Yeah. Wow. That's too much. And then, of course, we pump oxygen in there, you know, extra oxygen to keep people alert. He that one's a joke, right? We don't do that, yeah. Just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> that is a thing casinos do, That's right? That's a thing, yeah. Yeah. yeah I to play and then I think there's certain okay. scents oh, that so some casinos pump in that make you more alert and awake. Yeah. Hell yeah. There's Should a whole thing to getting people to oh, lose to more money. To stay longer, yeah. yeah. <laughs> but not here at the Lodge <laughs> Social Club, <laughs> other <laughs> than, of course, the lack of a clock in the stream. I just don't think it's going to be staring at the clock and thinking, you, 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 you can't read your poker, put your phone away, put your stuff away, play some poker with your friends. Yeah, I mean, I think anything on the screen, or rather anything anywhere to look at, Agreed. is not really going to be ideal for a poker game. It's always going to be faster action, better action, when there's nothing else to do except for the table in front of you, the thing in front of you. The cards. Totally agree. Thank you, School Mike, for the five dollar donation. Doug Polk packs his own lunch. I did bring my lunch to work today. I guess dinner, really. It was very sweet. I just had a little, a little uh, one ounce of walnuts and a and a protein shake, and uh, I'm revving up for a little bit of 93% uh, lean beef with vegetables for dinner. A little rice in there. Mm. Let's go. So you're at home and you measure out like an ounce of nuts. Yeah. Does that sound nuts to you? A little bit. <laughs> One ounce of nuts. Jack, we just call it the Houston heads up down south. Mm, I'm sure you nuts guys are have caloric, man. You got to be careful. Yeah. They're really caloric. You know that? Nuts? Sure. Yeah. But healthy fats is good. I tend to just take them by the handful rather than by the ounce. Yeah. That's a, t that's a tough strat when you eat too many. I tend to do that. I wasn't oh. suggesting that. I didn't know it was like a thing. Thank you. Maybe not. Think after. So beers that come on the stream? You just can't do it on the stream? <coughs> no. Uh, I think it won't read to both. Can we, I, oh. I'm with the owner. <laughs> I pay for them too. I'll, oh, I'll, really? I'll buy all of Pierre's beers if he drinks yeah. more than five. Oh, okay. <laughs> no. Oh, yeah. no. That's a, that's uh, a sucker no. bet, I think. I'm not, it's definitely right. a sucker bet, but I don't know for who. And he's switching to cores. Yeah. If anyone wants to make me uh, that offer, I... Right. Yeah. <laughs> right, right. If anyone wants to make that offer for me and up at the seven, I'm in. There you go. <laughs> it's a bid. You got, you got action. Five's, five's no good. You're, <laughs> I'm you're not, number seven. I'm not even buzzed at five. So. Yeah. You're number seven? No, I would, do, I would do that offer for seven. But where you're, I'm the one drinking. And we get to choose you, the beer? You want, you want someone to offer you for seven? <laughs> yeah, they'll pay for all my beers if I drink seven beers. So um, 35. So you're just dollars? looking for free beer and you're willing to chug it? Yeah, but if we get drunk. Yes. Then. Yeah. Okay. All right. I Willing. Do it. Willing. Got it. Willing. You just really want to get drunk? Yeah. yeah. You, get th you, get a 30, you get a $35 bounty when you hit when you finish the seventh beer. <laughs> yeah, willing to chug free beer. I like that. Oh, I like it. Should have put it I'll do Seems that good for the action, yeah. Brady, when tonight? Is it gonna be a tonight? player like gets the their seventh oh, yeah, beer I'm for free. Yeah. Or sorry, seven beers for free when they drink their seventh beer. I love that incentive. I would just hate to be the, the card room having to deal with drunk people having seven beers, you know? That would be a mess. It'd be horrible, yeah, totally. No, Definitely not something you want. All club flop here. Pierre catches a piece with the eight, but it's no longer good. Justin, oh, you, you, Justin's you, you got the niz. Actually, you should put a cap on it. He could really get you good to start tipping like a thousand each time, and then be like, "You owe me five. He's not going to slow play. Yeah, right. Trying to build that pot. Unfortunately for him, <laughs> he's unlikely to get looked up by anyone. Sorry, it was buying. Pretty tough in these spots <laughs> when there's a lot of people in the pot and you have the the nuts. It's just really kind of difficult to get action unless someone has the king of clubs or maybe the jack of clubs. But it's like he's going to find a bluff at the wrong time here. Breathalyzer in his car. We tried it the other day. Notoriously unreliable. It is. Mm -hmm. I, I thought it was pretty close to the one the cops had. That's what he said. You also got pulled over? No, no. Oh, no. They're, they're just <laughs> so my friend's breathalyzer did not say that. <laughs> They've gotten a little better over the years, but they're not. None of them are reliable. Like, the cops aren't reliable either. They as long as it matches whatever the cops say. Six. Right? The cops use it for probable cause so they can blood test you because it doesn't stand up in court because they're, yeah. they're not accurate. Mm. Oh, right. so if you blow, let's say, 0.02, it could thinking. still be like, ah, I don't know, we should blow this here. He lets it go <laughs> to Justin's <laughs> three bet. If you're a point or two, they might just, just let you go. I don't know why Jake goes on about this breathalyzer thing. So I, I have a breathalyzer in my car so that anytime I drink, I can I can just do a quick breathalyzer. And if I ever, you know, at 0.08 or looks close, I'll just get an Uber. Okay. Right? So that if I have a couple of drinks, I know where I'm at. 
Just seems seems reasonable. reasonable. Sure. And uh, Jake just hates them. He hates the idea of them. He thinks that they're basically worthless. I don't put words in his mouth, but they don't hold up in court. And, and he just has a problem with even using them. I, I think even the idea of one is insulting. Okay. So he's more of a feel it out yourself guy. Yeah, exactly. He's a feel player for sure. Why not just know? Also, yeah. then you, you get the peace of mind of knowing if I get pulled over, I'm going to blow a point oh five, point oh five, or point oh four if right. I had two beers. Right, right. Or whatever you had. I'd rather just know. The chat is like, no! Breathalyzer strategy. Why not? You Come into the Upswing Poker Lab soon. The other night I played poker with Pierre until like four in the morning. And then, and then we're like, all right, we'll, we'll go out and we'll see. We'll just like make sure we can drive. And we were both totally good. But it's kind of funny. You're at 4 a.m. blowing into breathalyzers to make sure you can drive home. Yep. Probably was a good game. It was a good game. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> No, I've never gotten a DUI chat. I just uh, well, I like to play it safe on the on the drinking and driving. Back to the action. E looking down at Ace Queen. He's gonna make a 250 to go, facing an open on the button from Salim with the Ace Seven off. Yeah. Or a keg. It's one beer. One unit. Cupcakes in there with the Queen of Diamonds. He took the course. The course says it's two. Yeah. I'm taking a flop. But I thought we were a private game. <laughs> I'll have ah. King Cup. nine five. Uh, Cupcake middle. out flopping E here. Order a <laughs> He's gonna continue. I pay for half it, he drinks them all, it's, it's, right? It's, <laughs> we didn't say I had to finish seven and it's, half an hour. It's more fun than the stream if they're all lined up. See, I wanna see him it's like a marathon, man. I think it's more fun for the stream if he just has them lined up and yeah. he just That's what I was thinking. Ace on the turn. Back to back. Very bad yeah. turn here for Cupcake. Yeah. Really, oh, only an ace oh, <laughs> puts E in the lead. Yeah, because I didn't show. Check, check. Four hearts now. Yeah, I actually... Could see Cupcake being able to bluff at this one now effectively should he choose to do it. E more than likely going to check. He's got just enough to just check and try to win. But it looks like he's going to go for a block bet instead. $125. Stupid. over there. Hand. Does take it down, loses his oh, net button. We forgot the net. I, I forgot anyway. The net game was going on. Explains a little bit more. Yeah. Some of the preflop action for sure. It does. Yeah. Argument for them being too strict. Yeah, you do. Uh, you could be my lawyer. Yeah. Right? Yeah, I think you guys are being too strict. <laughs> I don't know if I ever want to play here again. That's Another look at the winnings here. Bit of movement. Yeah, Not too much blood still, though. Yeah. The game does get worse if he leaves. Yeah. Hey, 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 hey. I object. <laughs> Not be dicks about it. <laughs> oh, sorry, I've gone too far. <laughs> no. Yeah, that that one was too, <laughs> that was too far. Moment. Hey, you, you don't you 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 don't play real good. <laughs> too far, man. Where am I? Yeah. Oh boy. Just thought I might have brought tears. I couldn't see through the sunglasses. No, I'm crying. Through the I've sunglasses. Crying. I've been crying. Hard to tell. Uh, Llama with the 10-7 of hearts, yeah, I'm just making it 55 here. to go. Pierre looks yeah, down, right. ace king. He's raising it up to 150. Enough, you start seeing it come out the bottom. Come on, Pierre. Come on, Pierre. Defense. Cupcake come on, with the Pierre. pocket sixes makes Poor the call. That's yes, some solid defense right there. Nick game's still on. Good luck, Jake. Thank you. I got you. I think these might be the last two players in there. I'm not sure. <laughs> Jake and who? Ja Jake, Jake and Cupcake, I think. Okay, I see. Oh, six on the flop. Bottom set. Oh, no. Cupcake, Cupcake. Does, Cupcake does not have a net button. He's going to lead. I know. Oh, man. This is going to get dicey now. Fairly sizable lead. What does Llama want to do here? He does have Pierre behind. He can have all of his open pairs or... Even some two pairs of straights. Oh, it's that dumb. Should only take eight hands, right? But he's also in the Nick game. He's got middle pair. He's got a gutter. They can go for hours. Might just rip this. Maybe not. There was hours where, like, and he does. I told you. Come on, come on, come on. Maybe it was. He doesn't like this. No, that's such a good hand. Oh my god. Oh shit. Eight. Jake gonna need an eight or running tens. Something like that, something crazy. But twice now? Uh, yeah, once. Once is good. Running sevens works too, I think. Indeed. One eight is all I need. Just one singular eight. Ah. No dice. In my head, I was thinking nine nine the dirty <coughs> way, but. 
Right. Right. And Llama is nine, all nine, in nine, and nine, all nine, out, nine, but he's no, reached into his pocket huh? for some chips. Oh, no, you know, what am I He won. He won. Yeah. I, for some reason, I thought you lost this too. But if you lose an all in, though, you, you lose the whole knit game, right? New rule? New rule? <laughs> New rule? No. If you lose an all in at the knit game, then you're like, you're like the why, loser. Why would we do that when you can lose more? Than By the way, guys, if you want to play on the Lodge live stream, contact Skull Mike. He'll get you into a lineup the best that he is able to do. We have a lot of people coming into town to play on the stream, so make sure to schedule early where the seats might like be filled up. The river bet yeah, hit him up on social gone. media. That's generally oh, the easiest way to do it. Gone. Twitter, Instagram, Skull Mike Poker. Um, I think it's my button, right? Couple players still in the Nick game. Justin and Llama, heads up. You know Tito got rid of his Nick button. He was the first one to get rid of it. It's not surprising. Having seen Tito play now for... <laughs> an hour or so here yeah, those are yeah, on a Friday a afternoon <laughs> coming into the evening. Llama <laughs> 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 carrying on his attack <laughs> to get rid of his nip button. Going to open up the king four hearts. What is that? He makes it 100. I believe we have a double straddle on here. I'm not sure. <laughs> he makes the call with ace queen. Yeah. Just 5, 10, 20. <laughs> And Justin calls as well with six five clubs. Ooh, ace five of hearts for Tito. Not a lot of color options that would Four ways to the flop. Yeah, Everyone's I mean, got kind of a pretty good hand. Eight five two. I don't think any game in Couple here pairs here. Yeah. Justin and Tito. Table, yeah, yeah. Mama not gonna bet the flop. Right. One, three, one. Checks through. Seven to diamonds. Justin picks up an open ender. And there's a bit of a mini game going here. If Justin wins this pot. Llama will lose the stand-up game and vice versa. You'll never, one chips will never matter. On Just gonna fold here. Tito makes the call against Justin. Both players have a pair of five. Tito has him out kicked. Ace on the river. I guess some Justin decides to bluff at this one. It's going to be the wrong time, but he doesn't. He decides to take his little bit of showdown value and checks. Tito's gonna go for value. This is gonna be music to Llama's wallet. Unless Justin's considering last, like, making a move. Glasses or the, yeah, Dude, these, are, these are horrible. Okay, yeah, I, I mean, I like it. 1,200. The check min raise here on the river as a bluff. So that Matt would wear a, a different Doesn't look like Tito's going to even really consider folding. He's quickly counting out the $300 call. Sorry, $600 call. It's the worst feeling, Brady. When they immediately start reaching, for Does sure. Does call. That's a look there. Yeah. You should put that on your social, I mean, your, uh, your online Good defense, good defense. Good I don't have any more of that. Yeah, yeah, really, that's, really 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 that's, that's, like that's a good bet. That's a good bet. I was, Super I was terrified I was happy at the check, and then I was real sad at the check raise. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Uh, was, yes. That, yeah, exactly. That was, that was, that was, that was very strong. strong. You can tell, but look at these glasses. Yeah. <laughs> no, they speak for themselves. I don't have to say anything. It's almost worse if you like point them out. Yeah, dude, those those have got to just be the nuts in, in a tournament. Like, how does anyone ever fold to you if you're wearing those yeah. in a tournament? That was last night. Yeah. yeah, he had Oakley versions of those. Yeah, so he was serious about it. You can really see things in the reflection that's of those. The, I think I think that's Matt's strategy. He got something to make him look like he's he's really trying hard. Let's see if we can see his cards through those when covers. he looks down at them. If the camera remains on him, it's so hard with the I angle. He had a, um, oh yeah, it's bad. So bad for me. I don't think he had I had a turtle neck that he, he was like this the whole time. God, a turtle neck. Kill a game. Who wears it? No, we're still playing. <laughs> still playing the Nick game. Justin There's with the ace and clubs is going to raise it up. Two fifty to go. Tito folds the king eight of clubs. Fold up over his mouth and sit like this. Llama folds and has to pray. Kind of do that. Two fifty. I just like the sweatshirt. I feel like I'm I can sorry, see his man. cards. Yeah, like, look, I can see the back of his I cards in the in the glasses. That's specifically from the camera angle, though. Defense. Yeah. Have to drink what do you get? And Justin wins a pot, and Llama will lose the stand-up game. Just move him to that fridge. In other words, the Nick game. Sorry, the Nick game. Right. Winning, it's not that great. That's not, not that great. That's yeah. not yeah. That yeah. It's kind of a sweet play by us here at the Lodge where it seemed like the stand-up game was largely popularized here. That's 
true. Then it's kind of spread to other streams and other places. I know they play it at Bellagio and stuff sometimes. Now we've just rebranded it. Well, it threw actually, it for a loop. It was actually at Bellagio first. Really? Yeah. It was at Bellagio, I think, almost a year before we were playing here. Oh, okay. But okay. people really, really liked it here, and I think I think we kind of... We put some I'd gasoline say, on the fire, maybe. I think it's fair to say that we popularized it in some capacity. But uh, I, I don't think we can say that we, we started it. Um, regardless, the Nick game variation definitely started here. So, if you hear Nick game, you know that started here at the lodge. Indeed. These really are wild to look through, and then not. Yes. A lot of clubs out there here. We should have done the hoodie too. Yeah, that way, that way you can, like... Looks like a visor on my... Are they connected? Yeah. A lot of clubs out here. No, on the back? A lot no, no, of clubs. Yeah, yeah. Okay. <laughs> That's how cheap they are. <laughs> can we just get a club flop? Two clubs in the flop? Is it possible? Are there, are there enough cards left? Yes. There are just enough. Barely. I like call because he called. Look at all these calls. Look at all these clubs. Same. I'm hoping for clubs, Brady. Let's see some blood in the water. Spades. That makes sense. Yep. For my phone. Justin does connect Not with fair. the pair of queens as the three better. Math, okay. math is so annoying, you know? It really is. Yeah. Yeah, does not cooperate most of the time as we see Cupcake come to life here with a lead. Is that actually a real show? Hey, that's 375. Oh, man. This is going to be interesting. Justin now with middle pair. Can't feel great about it, but hard to fold to one bet. Lion's still behind as well. What do I do? Conch Dan, I think he's talking about. Does make the call. Thank you. <laughs> oh, a raise. Yeah, you gotta be holding the conch. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Another min raise from Justin here. Okay. That's gonna take it down. The, old the game is out of the muck. That's why he folded. Mm -hmm. Oh, Justin claims to have miscounted his chips there, and that's why he put in too much. Well. Either way, you know, a pair of queens against the five high, you're probably gonna win at some point. But you might win more if you let him blast I, off. I, I, I'm inclined to agree with you. When my opponent has almost no equity, I prefer to let them bluff. Indeed. Sometimes their bluff will work, though. Like my hands Should've just up. announced min. <coughs> yeah, there you go. Yeah. I'd like to. That'd I'd like better. to raise the minimum. Min, min? is what just, you just, you just say that. Yeah. How am I always first to act? It feels like. What is this oh, game? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no matter what happens, I'm fucking first to act. <laughs> yeah, it does happen. If you straddle, you avoid this problem. Forty. Permanent under the gun. <laughs> You're gonna be first tag against him. Oh, the shallow? Yeah. You go to Carol? Ace of hearts. Under the ace, eight of hearts under the gun. Or slam should open it up. Flopping and not flush draw against. I mean, Tito got in there with the nine tray. Even by Tito's standards, this one seems a bit low. Yeah, exactly. Somehow it doesn't connect, but he's calling anyway. I, I gotta say, I love the style. The style. But it's going to get tough big. now because Salim <laughs> Paris is 8. He has showdown value. He has a great draw. And Tito <laughs> has a 9? <sighs> has a 9 and a 3. <laughs> Slim does bet again, and Tito's float unsuccessful. He lets it go. Prudent lay down. Prudent indeed. You do that any guy got first. Okay. I guess to be a lie. She's so powerful. Are we doing The main event here at the lodge for the 2023 Spring Mayhem series is happening right now. I think we have something like 700 entrants already in this tournament. Don't quote me on that. It's a rough estimate. It's going to be well over this million dollar prize pool. Going to absolutely blow that million dollar guarantee out of the water. It's happening right now. Come on down to the lodge today to play the 5 p.m. flight or tomorrow to play the 11 a.m. or 5 p.m. flight. It's just nice not having to put out posts on social media saying, help, we're going to lose hundreds of thousands of dollars. It's nice. I enjoy it personally. I love not having to set up a spreadsheet calculation to figure out what overlay we're on track for so we can advertise it. It feels much better. I absolutely love it.
There you go. By the way, I, I got I got a fact for you after this hand Ooh, that, that I cannot fact. wait to rub in your face. Oh, no. Poker line raises it up with the ace-king offsuit. Tito finds the 4-3 offsuit, re-raise. Finds it. He finds it. Now, now I have to wait to have something rubbed in my face. This is just the worst. Yeah, you won't have to wait long, perhaps. Poker line puts in the 4-bet. Tito quickly calls. Kids, just gonna be home for a few weeks. What? Play video games. It's gonna be like, awesome. like snow. Hell no. Can't last. What's that? You know, you gotta set it up. We're gonna get after baby. Like, uh, you're not gonna Jack be seven five. Gin for Tito. Bottom end of a gutter. About, about as good as you could hope for. Opponent doesn't pair. You do follow the straight draw. Poker Lion's gonna bet 110. It I mean, appears. there's legitimately zero percent chance Tito's folding here. I've watched this guy play poker for one hour, and I can tell you, there's just. It'll be a cold day in hell before Tito's folding a gut shot in a four-bet pot. No shot, especially <laughs> after playing the sand free flop. He's, he's putting a raise out there, Brady. He's putting a raise out there. Trying to make uh, Poker uh, Lions ace-kings indifferent, I imagine. Hey, this is just uh, tough with ace-king now. You're going to have to call. You're getting a great price, but... Yeah. Just, if you don't hit an ace or a king specifically, it's, it's like, what it's are you going to do? It's going to get hard. Ten on the turn. Pokeline does pick up a gutter, and he's got that kind of valuable ace of clubs in his hand. Oh, Tito's reaching for chips. He's reaching for chips. Tito is an absolute animal. Oh, my God. He's firing the turn. Oh, man. What do you really do here as Pokerline? Do you float again? I mean, they're kind of deep, so maybe he could reason that if he hits a queen. But this is tough, Brady. This is tough. You're just floating on a prayer. You, it's hard. Hard to even think of hands you beat, really. He's gonna call. Like, oh, Tito. Eight on the river. If Tito fires one more, he is gonna take this down. What does he do? He's a man on a mission. He's reaching for chips. Oh my! Eight hundred on the river. Or nine hundred, it looks like. Nine hundred on the river. How are you ever good here as Poker Lion? How are you ever good? What what hands can you ever beat? It's hard to imagine bluffs you even beat. Tito could easily be bluffing here with like a hand like five four five six. How 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 how? Okay, so he's. There's just no way. And it works. Tito There's with an no absolutely way. epic hand, re-raises pre-flop, calls the 4-bet with 4-3 offsuit, raises the flop versus C-bet, bets the turn, follows through on the river, and he takes it down. As David Bivens just said in the chat, I thought shotguns only had two barrels. Tito had three. Takes it down with pure heart there. Incredible hand. We had the wrong game. What the hell? We had the wrong game. Some butts are going to start vibrating and shit. What are you guys doing over here? They'll be like, no, it's cool. I'll deal a hand. Do you have the extended you too? Absolutely. Absolutely. No, no, So, Doug, if you recall a couple days ago, we put up a video on YouTube of that hand where Jungle Man ends <laughs> knocking over Nick right. Airball's chips, yep. right? Yep. And we had put a lodge ad at the end right. of it. Right. A little bit of a long lodge ad. Right. And you had brought up in one of our business chats that you thought that was a bad move because it was going to be bad for video stats. Well, here's two facts for you, Doug. Oh, God. Number one, the video is at like 200K views. Clearly, it's not holding it down too much. Nice. Number two, there was a guy at my table yesterday who said he watched that video at 10.30 a.m. in Houston, saw the ad, and was like, wait, the Lodge has big tournaments? L looked up the tournament schedule, and then came and played the main event. You know, when I'm wrong, I'm wrong. And uh, I can accept the loss on this one. Yeah, got him. You got me. Which is kind of messed up because I recorded the ad. Yeah. <laughs> No, Lesson learned. Oh, this is kind of unconventional. No, no, no. <laughs> you, you, you it's going to be a, it, it's going to be a big turnout yeah, there for this tournament. It's like looking good. Afterwards. And no doubt. Hey, man, you see next week? Then you know. <laughs> if there's one <laughs> tournament to travel for at the lodge <laughs> per year, there's actually kind of two. I would say the Mayhem main events. The, as far as something everyone can really play, right? Like a $1200 buy-in. It's pretty accessible if you want to play for a big prize pool. LCS is great, our other series are great too, but that $1,200 buy-in million guarantee level, just really nice. I think a lot of people will uh, will enjoy playing something like that. 
Do you think we're going to cover our main event this year? In the LCS? 3K buy-in, $2 million guarantee. We missed it by about 300000 last time around. I, th I think we'll figure it out this year. I, I hope we do. I hope we do. We changed the structure a bit. You can register into day two. That's going to make a big difference for sure. Sped up day one slightly. It's never a good sign when the pros are complaining that the yeah. structure is too good. Yeah. And we had a couple of those. So I had people at my table saying, Doug, why didn't you make it so I could fire more bullets? I'm trying to give you guys money, and I just can't now. I was like, you think I'm happy? <laughs> you think I'm happy we're going to overlay by... Overlay is more fun when you're a player. It's a lot more fun when you're a player. <laughs> Sweating it. It's the complete reverse sweat now. Llama with the ducks. Let's it go on the flop. Yeah, Cupcake takes it down with that flop pair of sevens. Yes, Jake, we need to put our ducks in the locker. Oh, they actually wow. get yelled at. Oh, they have to leave the room. Oh, shit. All right. Uh, Actually, yeah, how did you get past you the wall? I meant to leave this we, whole we thing in the locker. And then when you brought the cards out, I realized it's still on the Can you get us like a hundred blue or something? And just, we have it. Thank you. No. Uh, here's my magic trick. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Watch the beer <laughs> disappear. Wait, did she look? I'm banned from I'm public parks. Dude, I'm not. <laughs> magic. Did I just get wrecked? Yeah. Did, did I just get wrecked? You get ignored. <laughs> She's got to wand people. She doesn't have time. Wow. I mean, Damn. They didn't get Dirty. to hold on, nothing. He's got cards, it's right? funny that the first time I've ever seen somebody bring cards to a poker game, there were two of them. Two, yeah, that's what I was thinking. What are the cards odds? Yeah. <laughs> Pierre opening up the 7-5 of clubs here. Hey, Sophia, can you, can you just, uh, blues when you get done? When yeah. does the new table come in? Question from chat. I think we have our smaller table coming in. A couple weeks or something like no, that? No, it's already ordered. It's actually on its way. Yeah. Okay. Something a little cozier. Like a get some better camera shots for our players. I, mean, it's way too many blues, but it's I just good. hate how much arm, like, arm room they have, you know? I don't like yeah. our players to be comfortable. It's hard to get multiple players in the same shot. I think the new one will really bring everyone in a little bit more, a little bit together. I'd love to be able to get three, four players in one shot because the table's so small. Okay. I don't think any other room's doing that either. No. I think Cutting I'm, edge I'm, stuff. I'm very excited about the direction we're headed. Or we could each just put in an amount to the deal. Anyway, back to the hand. 10-9-7, Pierre. Going to bet the flop here with bottom pair. Poker lion, middle pair, top kicker. It's going to go ahead and make the call, yeah, playing a turn. Oh. I, we, Both we players have some very vulnerable yeah. hands here. A lot of, a lot of cards yeah. either one of them is going to want to see. Three of diamonds, two yeah, flush draws out there now. Poker lion checks once Take again. I imagine po Pierre is going to slow down, and he does. Checks it back. Jack on the river, any aids a straight. He can like, he can like literally put like a fingertip here and like a fingertip on Pierre's hat. But is either player really likely to bet? I think I might go check check here, guys. That's not Taylor. All right. <laughs> Pierre's thinking well, I, it I over though. I like it. I'm All right. There's one dealer that's taller than me. Is so. he gonna represent right. a straight? His name's not Taylor. Might I mean, work. Her boyfriend is maybe the one you're thinking of. I don't know which one of them is taller. Who's taller? But he might have other hands he wants to bluff. He's thinking this over. Why is Taylor? Clayton? Clayton is such a I'm thinking of Clayton. Game. Okay. Like I think Taylor is 6'8", yeah. Yeah. I don't know Taylor, then. He's great. Why don't I know Taylor? He's going to bet, bet. He's going to represent an 8. He's, he's, he's going pretty big, too. Just I did, I, Poker Lion's got to think. I'm so sick of these straight runouts. Just give me a good clean one. Like no river bet. Like wow, this is a huge bet. 800 into 480. It's a room crowd. Just like look around and then the three people you see. Is like three oh, yeah, yeah. He, he went to Disney <laughs> with us last year and we put, we, he purposely would wear a neon shirt. And Tough spot. The kind of good so news when you have ace nine here is your opponent has a straight or nothing. So you don't have to be worried about 10. You don't have to worry about Jack. You don't have to be worried about two pair. Yeah, he's saving them too. He either has a straight or he's bluffing you. Yeah. Making, so a nine's the same yeah, as a jack or a three or two pair or whatever. The question is, what eights does he think he has? What hands are good to call versus that? I think there's a chance Poker Lion sniffs this one out. This one's a much more reasonable spot than the Tito one. In, ter in terms of how easy it is to call. The, that, the Tito hand was, was, was pretty unreasonable in general. But Very unreasonable hand. This one more reasonable. <laughs> Could definitely see Poker Line making this call. It's kind of interesting if Pierre just like pots it here instead, or maybe bets three quarters. 
His range looks quite a bit different. Could include some like two pairs and stuff like that. But it does get through anyway. Poker Lion lets it go. Pierre takes it down. If Poker Lion watches this stream back, he's going to think to himself, man, I wish I had made some maneuvers here versus these guys on the river because they are they are getting out of line. Here's where the lads are at. Couple players down 2,000, Llama and Justin. Celine, the big winner at 1,900 so far. Llama rocking the short stack. A natural born tournament player if I've ever seen one. Oh yeah. <laughs> Um, I just have to Uber home. Cupcake, can I take one o mine home? Yeah, sure. My girlfriend? Yeah. Uh, like I said, just leave me the Twix, one of the Twix ones. The course light. Pierre makes it 75 <laughs> over the $20 <laughs> straddle with Ace-4 yeah, suited. Course light yeah, take the seventh one home. It's a course light, that delay. The course light to go. You want to get it broken up, don't you? <laughs> Look what I brought home, sweetie. Yeah. Eating a donut while I had this door. <laughs> Tito defends with a 9-2 offsuit. You're not stealing his straddle today. I spoil my and he outflops Pierre, <laughs> King nine eight. Don't worry. First to Hawaii. Yeah, no, this, warmed yeah, it up yeah, for you. Yeah. No problem. Pierre continues for fifty, gets called quickly. <laughs> Queen of Clubs on the turn. Pierre Ooh. picks up the nut flush draw. Getting a little spicy on the turn now. Do you guys hear how Doug reacts to seeing nut flush draws? He gets excited. Yeah, just it's nice. Yeah, it's nice. Well, because now. You get to barrel, probably. You could get there. They could fold. The world's your oyster with a flush draw. And the barrel gets through. Do people still use travel agents? Look at everything on your phone. That's hilarious. You have like specialty trips that you do in special areas? You probably plan a whole big deal, right? Like you could probably coordinate. That's what people tell me about poker every time. You like that? Yeah, that's pretty good. But there's the... I do okay. Yeah, yeah. So like, what? do you do specific areas or you just... Uh, international, research? all international. Cool. That's and I personally, would, I do all inclusive resorts as the main thing. My wife does basically the rest of the world. Oh, okay. Okay. Next, next trip. I'm, I'm coming. You're coming for me. I'm coming for you. I'm coming through your. Oh. Yeah, dude. Pierre's drunk. I don't know if I like this inquiry. <laughs> I want to go to Prague. I'm coming for you. Yeah. I can feel it. I want. Uh, my oh, wife's coming. Prague. Where are you? Are you just gonna call her? Right? Go to Prague. No. That's a straddle. No. Yeah, you're too good looking. You don't get to work on my all right, I won't. Yes! It wasn't very good. You didn't look, right? I, I, I didn't look. <laughs> I call, sir. Oh, no, there's yeah. a lot of money in Destination Remember, you only have two streets. Oh, so you could do like, oh, like, really? like okay, a party event. I do individual <laughs> trips, too. Uh, okay. Never mind. He was, he was trying to call. Destination Tech 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 yeah, he was trying to call. What just happened there? His hands are not that good. 100 families. Left ass Jake. It's crazy. Couple of premium hands. Couple of Tito's. You get one mulligan. Ever gets one? Okay. You guys are I don't want to use an app. Like <laughs> you got to mulligan before the other person reacts. Yeah. Sir, we try and play poker. Yeah. Someone's going to eventually take a stab at this one. The question like, is who. The size try not to. Is. It's all about what you feel. Really yeah. Try not to People start racing each other in the pots. Yeah. <laughs> just, you, you don't want to be like Joe Ingram in every interview where he holds the mic range. right here so the whole like time pot. while he's breathing. What's the pot? You can say whatever you want. Side chat. Well, <laughs> but I can only pot raise, so what's the pot? You have to figure it's it out yourself. The dealer can't help you. This isn't a PLO table. So. <laughs> I was like, can I tell them? My favorite was, I'm yeah, you can tell me. bitch. <laughs> Twice. Mm. So, like, they know, they've got what to know each other. What is going on here? Says, okay, yeah. Otherwise, it's not cool. All right, so Jake has bet small on the turn. Pierre has raised. Oh, you're calm. You're calm. All right, I'm going for value. Whatever. Now Jake is going to re-raise? And Pierre calls? Okay, so that was absurd. No one has anything in the turn action went bet, raise, raise, call. 10 on the river. Long has the best hand right now. Neither one of them believes the other player. This is actually kind of incredible. They both have nothing, and they both think the other guy is full of it. Alright, I'm gonna go for a blocker bet. 350. <laughs> wow. Insta. Wait, somebody's got me wrong with the cards. Hit the felt before one somebody has me wrong with the cards. Time. I got a flush draw. Oh, they played it blind. Uh, Pierce draw and bet. Oh. Nine high. <laughs> oh, God. No. Yeah. Oh. oh. Value tap. No. Let's go. All right. 
to the, to the people watching this clip in the future, we didn't know it was blind. No chop. No chop. No chop. Oh. That makes a lot more sense. Oh, yeah. That does make more sense. Oh, Lord. That was the quickest call ever. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, neither one of We should do this more often. <laughs> no, thank you. It's one of my best formats. I love it. <laughs> How do you win with nine high? Uh, I'm definitely gonna win the bet. Call that the DQ problem. game. You just don't look at your They hand. seem so I, casual I in the so hand. I was kind of enjoying it. I was like, these guys are really in there. You know? Yeah. So that explains why Jake was really rooting for Tito to fold because I think he had said to Pierre, like, sort of in a low voice. If it folds to us, do you want to play it blind? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that makes sense. Yeah. And it also makes sense why Tito obliged and got yeah. out of the way with the, with the premium 10-7 uh, offsuit. That was the surprising yeah, fold. Like, that's not a Tito a fold. Question. Can you see if the bathroom is open? Yeah. It was closed for cleaning when I walked out there a little bit ago. It's open now? Okay, cool. Okay. I believe you. I hope they turn off my mic. Well, we do I too. Already folded. My bad. It wasn't my brain. Justin with the oh, eight seven of clubs. He's gonna raise that. <laughs> Tito's in there with the queen ten of diamonds. I don't know what I'm doing. I just heard Lama about this along for the ride right with the jack seven of hearts. <laughs> yeah. so and Pierre's right. gonna go ahead this and defend with the king five. Yeah. Ooh, we got some action here. Straight for Llama. Top pair, sure a gutter and a flush draw for Tito. Bottom pair and open ender for Justin. There's a lot of action here to be had. Let's see how it goes down. And then my friends, if they happen to... Tito going to kick us off with a flop bet. Right. Llama just going to call with the straight. Kind of interesting. Justin comes along too. They're playing this hand lightning fast. 225 from Tito with his gut shot straight flush draw on top pair. Llama going to slow play again. He just calls. Little does he know, raising would have been a very, very good move against the hands he's, that he's up against. Justin comes along as well. He's drawing dead. In interesting from Llama here to not raise. It's a very dynamic board. A lot of hands could improve to beat you. Just sets the trap. At some point, you're going to have to raise, though. And I think that point is going to be the river. Seems likely. Could maybe call and hope Justin behind does something, but it's just too unlikely. I think I think it's time the the jig is up, so to speak. Time to spring the trap. Indeed, David Bivens asked in chat, "Don't you want to raise it to protect your hand?" That's maybe a little part of it, but it's more so you have a good hand. You want to raise to get value, build the pot. One of the main ways you win money in poker is by making good hands, building the pot, and winning a big pot. You can't really build the pot if you're just calling and playing passively. That's why you tend to play it fast when you have a good hand. At least that's what most of the best players in the world do. Jake consulting the conch right now. It's jungle or helmius and you only ever call jungle. Wow. Lama does rip it for 1680 total. And the Oscar goes too. Run the silly Thank wand and four for two beers, you know? I mean, it'd be a super big party foul. All right, four down. You have four down already? Yeah. Tito was not hoping for this. He was hoping to just face a call, get the show down his top pair, but now he's got to make a decision for the rest of Llama's chips. He's like number fives in the chamber right there. He's getting kind of good odds. I don't understand the idea of pausing. Like, I'm just gonna his opponent did a whole yeah. routine with a conch shell. Typically speaking, guys, when your opponent does a uh, comedic routine and goes all in, oh, they have it. The Usually. Now, I'm not saying Llama that's would. Llama's uh, crafty. Yeah. That's, that's, but that's most time. people, when they do a comedic routine, yeah. are value <laughs> yeah, betting. How often do you see a comedic, comedic routine that it's going to be? Not often. What you see more often is like some sort of speech or something sure. weird like that. It's about that time of the night. Oh, I haven't had a situation like this in a long time. All in. <laughs> uh, you did it in the two of us, which makes me want to fold. It's for you. Someone busy. He doesn't want to talk. He knows we write letters to each other. You go to the bathroom. Uh, it's what, 11 on top? 15, 16, That's four, so. 17, 20. All right, I fold. Get in. 
Nice fold. Such a yeah, yeah great fold. Block. Jake unfortunately left some value on the table there. Definitely could have played this hand a little yeah, faster. The, the won some extra money. But he'll have to settle for a $3,200 pot. Go in his way. You got to get all seven done quick. Protect against yeah. diamonds. Like if you try to space that out over a couple sip, hours. Sip on cores, dude. You're, yeah, you're peeing. Are we doing a new game? Or no? Yep, I'm in. So, yeah, sure. Yeah. a red flop? <clears throat> yeah. I forgot about the whole red pop thing again. Yeah, I, I only happened no, to I notice it because I sat down and my bothering. <laughs> that's, that's what y'all should have done, though. You should have said if I go to the bathroom, Ooh, I lose. Yeah, next next time, put the bathroom There, there are so many better sure. ways to construct See, it. Better. The next seven beers. <laughs> yeah, exactly. That's true. <laughs> run it, run it back. Same set. Oh, yeah, yeah, you're good. The next group, they're paying double. Yeah. Hopefully they get a new Like, all I'm getting out of this is free beers. I'm not really winning anything. <laughs> this is, I'm just drinking you, seven You quarters. act like <laughs> seven beers isn't winning. It's not it's seven I'm switching. I'm switching a different beer on the last two. Mm -hmm. I assume so, yeah. It's a pro tip. On the on the sixth beer is when What's you really got to switch up, you know? Coors Lights are the same price as the... Switch up to what? Eagle Something or light. Or ah. You have five beers in your stomach. So you're punting right you're drinking a heavy wheat I'm beer. The sixth one hits especially hard. Up my game. <laughs> Poker Except Lion throwing the Robbie yeah, in the muck. It's called a level up. Yeah. A level up. No, thank you. It's cool, man. You're drunk. We know. You have four wasted. Cores. I don't think he is. Four cores. He's wasted with a tummy ache. Queen Jack of Diamonds for Tito. Making it 75 to go. We're still at 50, right? Yes. Yeah. 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 Playing the Nick game right now. You win, sir. Look Damn, how easy here. it's been. That's first twice in a row. Wow. Well, the first time Kyle was cheating. Oh, yeah. You for, for the second straight net game, yeah. Tito yeah. first yeah. to lose his butt. And this time, all the players were at the table, so. Almost. Goes to show. No matter what the conditions are, the best come out on top. You're forgetting. I have to imagine Tito is one of the best at the net game. What's the chance that Tito loses a net game tonight? I think it's very low. Very low. I forgot about it. 15, 20 to 1. Maybe it's more. Game I like to play where you like well, so every every one time one you're seven to one, right? This, so there's, I don't there's forget that. So yeah. and then you play more there's games, there's so we would go lower because you should lose one. So yeah, right. twenty to one. Okay. <laughs> I wouldn't lay the odds, but I think I might like taking Tito with those. You know? Yeah, I agree. If I had to pick a side of that, I, w I would take Tito. You already won the Oh, queens now for Tito. I, have, I can't drink these for the last two. Look at all these nets he's dealing with. Wish I had McConaughey's. Oh my god, he just wins preflop. Oh. Otherwise, I get, I get it back. It's <laughs> awful. I, I hate to see it. Especially when you're playing a lot of hand, you're going after some pots, you look down, queens. Ooh, my favorite. And it's the nit game. There's Everyone else has incentive to win. It's just brutal. My favorite feeling in poker is there's a guy to your right, and you've been three-betting him a lot, and you can get the little little, little sense, okay, I've had enough of this shit. And then they open, you look down, pocket ace. And you three-bet, and you know that this person is going to do everything in their power to not fold. Four bet, call, float, raise, whatever it is, they are ready to fight, they're sick again, pushed around, and you're sitting there, and you got the rockets. The birds. The birds, as some say. <laughs> At least two people. <laughs> and thus plural. Cupcake, opening A7 here. We're playing the Nick game, so players have to open it up. Tito, he's in there. Ten six of hearts. I'm a poker purist. He knows you guys are all full of shit right now. Mm -hmm. Gonna make the call. Llama well, looking down the ace jack of hearts now. Got the best hand going. He's just gonna call. Oh, Pierre with the pocket kings. The Cowboys. This hand's starting to heat up. 375 now. You got one yellow over there? Yeah, only yeah. one yellow. For now. Cupcake going to make a pretty aggressive call here with the A7. Tito's out of there. Pink, pink is 5K, right? It's going to be hard for, for Lama to let this one go. 5K plus oh, is he, is he talking to the... No. Counts. Not so talking to the like console. He makes the call. Three-way to uh, the flop. It's always about nothing. Nope. Nope, nope. Ace, queen, 10. King's now in last place. And you know what? As they say, chat... Always an ace. Llama now with a commanding lead here with his top care, top pair second kicker. 
But Cupcake is looking like he's got ideas. He's jamming. Oh, man. A little awkward here in... Lo Wait, hold on. Count. Did he just lay down Ace Jack? I think he just did. Wow. Should be good. I hope so. Easy lay down, I guess. Oh no. Representing a bigger bit than I had. Wow, what a fold here from Llama. Folding the best hand. Pierre now tanking it out with a worse hand. I think there's a chance Pierre calls, guys. Kind of shows you how. What different area codes we're in. Your ace five is no good this time. My ace five is no good. No. Is the cupcake in play? I need to know. Mm. What a jam from Cupcake. He might get a better hand to fold and a worse hand to call in the same hand. Five. Let's listen to Pierre. What do you say? I'll show you one. <laughs> that will confuse me even more. <laughs> oh, good. <clears throat> oh. Yeah, that that will do. Mm -hmm. Should have shown the other one. Oh, I'm not. Why are you reminding me? But thank yeah. you. I caught myself oh. too late reminding you. Damn, Damn it, I had a better hand. <sighs> wow. Oof. I'm probably That's not what I expected. Anyway. Now we see why. Nope. What'd you have? <clears throat> you got there? I have, I have now we see why player. Llama plays short. Kings? Bullshit. Four the best hand. Damn it. No, I did. I was too scared. I was stupid. Like, I'm just so used to you beating me that I just wanted you to fold. Like, no, I, never, uh, I never want you to call me. I pulled something pretty I, good. Yeah. If you I, I was probably going to fold it regardless if you show me the hand or not. Uh, if I don't show him the AC calls, because I'm an idiot. No, no, I think I was going to fold it out. Well, before you said that, I, was, I think I was going to fold it right. What do you do if he shows you a 7? If he shows you a 7, then I don't know. <laughs> right? <laughs> yeah, that's that's the move. That would have been the, the confusing move. card. No, I probably still fold it. I, I would have called bullshit I agree. on the 7. I think you do still fold, but still. Yeah. That would have been it's great. Funny Pretty nice yeah, to be thinking about what to do versus a bet on the river. Then your opponent shows you one card. And that card beats you. Was it seven of clubs or no? Makes poker a little easier. Doesn't happen as much as I might like. At least not to me. If it was seven of clubs, you are behind. You should have shown seven of clubs. You met our hand? No, you can call me Carlos. Pierre picking up the queens, raising it up over a couple of callers. She called me Carlos, and I said she can call me Carlos. Why? Yeah. Because I was Carlos before I was good. The tilt raise, right? Tilt raise. Then I was Carlos from Mexico before I was any of these other names. If it breaks, you don't have to I'm deal trying with it. to repair it. You can return it. I can spend about four or five hours here and get called ten different things. <sighs> yeah, so just, like, I just don't just like reaching for his her. cupcake. Salim making a move at the wrong time. He makes it 300, Salim. trying to get rid of his knit button. But just 5-4 offsuit. Now E's got ace-3 suited. He gives it a quick think, but he does let it go. Poker Lion now with tens. This could get pretty bloody. Everything here is kind of nice, and that button's a little... Yeah, you want maybe a yeah, little, little really tiny cowboy hat? Like, these look really good on the stream. They do. Oh, these look they really look, cool. Why they don't you use shit. those? <laughs> yeah, Poker Lion's got $2,300 behind. He's going to put in like a four bet. Mike had a crap hit, uh, a craft uh, party? Craft, craft project. 800 oh, to go now, and the action's cool. back on Pierre. The ones that they, uh, Both so players still have their knit buttons in front of them. The They're incentivized to win the pot. The so one. I expect this one to get all in. Yeah. yeah. Call Mike. No, it says Skull Mike and Suck Rick. Oh, yeah. It yeah. does you say can't, suck Now you can't unsee yeah. it, can you? And I do, I do see, like, Call Mike, because I can't yeah. really see the S. I don't want to read anything that says Suck Rick. Yeah. <laughs> no, I, I have one of the, the hoodies. It's, like, my favorite. Because, like, on the hoodie, it's, it's like, because it was printed, it looks even blurrier. Oh, so it just nice. looks, it, for sure. That's awesome. Like, from normal, this far away, it looks like that definitely says Suck Rick on it. Could be a collector's item someday. I hope so. <laughs> I'll, get, I'll get Rick to find it for sure. The Pulse. next Norm Chad. Yeah. That'd be sweet. Pierre rips it in there. I hope they get that big. Yeah, I do too. Poker Lion's got to call like that $1,500 like stack like off, and he does time. that. I like good things to people. And they're once is fine. And they're running it once. Max Payne here. Is that trademarked? I have a pair beneath you. Ouch. Tens versus Queens. Classic matchup here. Roughly a $5,000 pot. 
Peter number one. Okay. Oh. Six high flop. Pierre is safe. Four. Seven on the turn. No extra outs. Lion's going to need a 10. No dice. Pierre's going to drag that one and get rid of his button. Dirty dog. I'm just dirty double through me. No need for the risk. How do you, how do you lose a hand? You're like, tilt raise, queen. <laughs> <Pretty insane. laughs> I get three bet, four bet. I think it's called lying. Twenty five hundred. That's my fault. It's in my backpack right now, so I, can I wait till I fold and then go grab the money? Yeah. Okay. Uh, it it doesn't matter. Green and black spot. Or one stack. I'm not showing you any more cards. Oh yeah, get, get like one stack. Not gonna be scared okay. to be calling me anymore. I showed you yesterday, so I returned the favor. You returned the favor. Remind, remind me how that one played out. Just like, grab it. You opened okay. like a million X. Yeah. yeah. And then I, I woke up with kings. I the way. And I laughed. But there was like, I didn't want you to look at your cards. I just wanted you to call without looking. Yeah. I, and I had kings. I laughed and I say, oh my God. And went all in. <laughs> there are the updated cumulative winnings. Yeah. Poker line now. No, no, no. I looked at both. Throwing the, the, the party down 2,500. And I was like, big, yeah. I, ha I have a big hand. And then I showed you kings. And you're like, I call. You're the big, you're the big <laughs> and then got there instead of a bit. But that's the worst part is that I got there on the first uh, board too. We ran yeah, the, you, yeah I got there with sixes. That's been a lot more fun. Or llama. What's Six llama. Oh, okay. I'm small. Defense. I, I don't have chip trainer. That was very small. Tilt raise again, dude. There's tilt raise again. You got, you got winner still over there? What the hell's going on right now? Up tilt raise. 100. 100. Nice try. I think it's said 200. <laughs> oh. I heard 200. Yeah, like what's, what's the minimum? Nice try. I was just gonna give him. Yeah, yeah. I know, I know, July. Just being goofy. You guys going to goofy? Oh, we're doing goofy. I don't know how many beers are you in you. This is number five. You'll start laughing at jokes after six. Oh, I'm no, switching to a better beer for those six and seven. Oh, you might have tried. Trying to ice on me, man. He takes it down with a well timed three bet. Five four suited. Boom. On to the next one. What a fold. This guy's got his got headphones, a hoodie. Your, Sorry. It's the glasses. <laughs> yeah, this is having the opposite effect. I thought I'd get called more with these dumb glasses, <laughs> but man, they're very intimidating. Mm. Put it on my tab. Yeah. Why from Washington to Sugarland? Job or just? On uh, yeah, my wife got transferred then. Okay. To Houston. Sugarland. Poker's good, so got that going for me. <laughs> yeah, it looks like it. Man. I mean, not, not right now. <laughs> <laughs> that's great. <laughs> that's that's too. Now you can keep the five. Now. That's awesome. <laughs> I like it. <laughs> Cameras look fancy. Yeah. It's way better than the old ones for sure. Uh, yeah, those look nice. Yeah. Those gotta be Seven. expensive. I wonder what those are. Probably. 3K, I was gonna say 3K each. I've just been informed we have a special guest joining the game in approximately a half an hour. Keep an eye out for that as we see Tito with an open ender. On this all diamond board, Salim's gonna take a stab at it with a pair of fours. E gets out of the way with the best hand. Tito peels. King of clubs on the turn. Tito checks again. Like this was gonna be you like could do service. like a whole red carpet thing with it though. Like, like Salim going like for another bet, 400. Kind of yeah. He's gonna yeah, take it down man. and get rid show. of his knit button with that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Jungle said he would only come if he rolled out a, a red carpet onto the sidewalk. Oh, nice. <laughs> that sounds like it. We brought the handheld cameras out there. He came awesome. straight from the Whataburger and just oh, red I'm carpet. I'm gonna get some big way. names in May though with those high roller events. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think so. People will definitely start gonna do The action's too like, crazy here. Killer that streams. Stream stream week was a good advertisement. Don't come here. Come no <laughs> one <laughs> come here. Yeah. Everyone stay at home. This place is full of nits and pros. Yes, that's it. Everyone yeah. here is very nitty. Nits and pros. What's the other thing one could be? Because I'm neither. A whale? Mm -hmm. him. I'm a travel agent. You're a travel agent, yeah. <laughs> yeah, a whale. <laughs> Made one joke about travel agents. It didn't go well. I'm not doing any more of that. Shout out to Alex Seidler in the chat. Asks what's the knit what's the knit button in front of the players. 
if you're familiar with the stand-up game, <laughs> then you're familiar with the knit game. It's the same thing. It was just a little bit of a production issue to have the players standing a bunch of the time. Have to adjust the camera angles, so we use the knit buttons now instead. Same game, new name. Tito picks up ace-jack offsuit. He raises it up over a couple of calls. We're playing 5-10-20 this hand. Basically, we're the same price, but you get an expert. Oh, that's really cool. I didn't know that. Yeah, I, I, I used one, I used one, one year for, for Disney, and I like planned them. I was like, dude, this is... Really? Uh, th now, there are agents that charge it's fees, and, and they do well with that, too. Uh, Llama calls it 6-5 suited in position versus the Razor. Um, uh, is it like scrolling your website right now at the bottom of the screen? <laughs> Paid advertiser or something? Yeah, dude, you get, you, get the, you get the free shout out. You get a, you got a mic. Uh, people that watch this stream, I probably don't want to work with. <laughs> Chat, chat's good people. Man. Wow. Why, Shots fired at chat there by Cupcake. Damn. Heads up to the flop. Comes eight eight two. We have free shirts. No, no peace for either player. Tito's going to uh, continue. Cool. I was chatting with people. They seem real nice. I saw, yeah, they, no, I saw uh, they finally have black. This is a good community. No, absolutely. I mean, I'm not. I'm not climbing. And Lama lets it go. I'm in there. Mark Redding just asked in chat, "What does it take to get a seat at this game?" All you got to do is contact Skull Mike at Skull Mike Poker on Instagram or Twitter, or you can email him Skull Mike at thelodgepokerclub.com. Hit him up if you want to play on the stream. Give him as much notice as possible so he can get you in. If you're planning a trip out to the lodge, say a month, two, three in advance, hit up Skull Mike. He can probably get you on a lineup if you give him that much time. Sometimes, if it's the week of, a couple weeks before a stream, there's not going to be any spots. So if you really want to play on the stream when you come into town, get ahead of it. Contact Skull. It was awesome for the RV business, too. Pretty confident he'll make it happen for you. No, for about four months, I didn't know what I was going to do for the rest of the Whenever you... Oh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, sure, just whenever you grab something like, from someone uh, else, I don't need one. People right. wanted to have somebody tell them what they could and couldn't do travel-wise, and so they kind of came back to travel agents when they weren't there. Awesome. Oh, yeah, it's on. I forgot it's that on I won the nip button. Yeah, I didn't all, realize all they were the same price. I thought that they had to be more expensive. expensive. I couldn't it's imagine. No, it's because it's it's making, it's making a commission, too. Oh, it might be bad for you, yeah. They don't set their own pricing. You're getting positive during the year. Yeah, whatever whatever third party you use, whether it's a website or a business or whatever. Yeah, yeah, they're all taking it. They're all taking it. You know what I mean? There's no workout for people working. A few not so good hands going to the flop here. Pierre connects with top pair. Llama's got an open ender. Or rather, a gutter. Jack clubs on the turn. Doesn't hit any players. Tito looks like he might be firing with his queen high. But he does check. Llama takes a stab with his gutter. Pierre with trip jacks, of course, is not going to go anywhere. Underrepresented hand. After checking the flop, but most of the time we're right about the same, and people. And that's the nine for Llama. Yeah. Makes the queen high straight. Yeah, if it's close. I think that's great. You get somebody actually handling it for you. And mm -hmm. What size is he gonna go for value here, or might he even go for the check raise? Yeah, you suck. <laughs> Got him. <laughs> Six <laughs> beers. Yep. <coughs> the dick has showed up. Oh, five. It's going to go about a pot size bet, 180. Quick call from Pierre. Llama's going to take that one down with the straight. Now there's one degree of separation. I'll work with you. There you go. Sicko. Ooh. That plays so bad. Where's on bigger? All right. Fire eagle for the last two. Oh, my God. I'm down to two again? Now we're showboating. I like it. Well, I actually want to enjoy the last two beers. There you go. Because those were shit. I like people that drink Coors Light on purpose. Looks like you yeah, I got to bet the game. Yeah. Check for the turn. No, there's three. Oh, there's three? I thought you just won. No. <laughs> no. You can have two. Can you, can you, oh, yeah. Can we just peel his hand and keep the... <laughs> yeah, now you have to kind of stick it out because... Well, you should, you should have just mucked But said for him, he's terrible. So you so he's like, for tighter days. Oh, I'm so sorry. That would have been so sorry. good. Yeah, that was mean. It was really two mean. pros and me with nip buttons. Wait, who else? It's just two of us. Oh, it's just, yeah, it's just you and me. Just one pro and you. <laughs> no, you definitely can't go back. <laughs> nope. I forgot a word there. Three uh, players remain in the nit game. Pokerline gets out of the way. He's yeah, one of the three still left. I missed two words. I didn't just you didn't have so Justin hand. gets out of the way as well. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. You, you can... 
problems I raise game? there, you just call so you no, don't okay. lose, and then they raise and we just both lose. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I'm going to sit and enjoy bucks. the last two yeah. minutes. It's in the back now. No, no it goes. but I'll send you in a little bit. Well, not now. Yeah, yeah thank I'm you. I'm not worrying about okay, the knit cool. game anymore. I'm just this, this, man, this man is the knit game crusher. I should have done a double or Yeah, the literal knit game inbox. He should be in for double next time. No, do what? I should have done a double or nothing. I did it before we Could be worse. That's true. On what? The bet. I'm going to finish this before we do the Oh, the the. Oh, dude, you got you got 16 minutes. It wasn't a bet. Right? Yeah, it, it was, was a free just roll, an yeah. offer. <laughs> <laughs> we you knew, lose. We knew I you don't win do many bets, so I'm taking it as a bet. If it yeah. was a bet, there would be some upside for me here. Besides the, you know, the obvious. The, all my chips going to your... Yeah, this is a... You, the you upside is him getting drunk. Contribution think, right? to the table. Yeah, right? but if he yeah. doesn't make it, it's not like... He that, sounds like somebody like, oh, just lost sorry, the bet. Sorry, you lost the bet. He's like, <laughs> still point. drunk. <laughs> chips aren't point. guaranteed to go Jake's way either. I'm just trying to give you a win-win situation here. I'll do a... I'm still trying to find a, somebody that'll take my weight loss bet. What's your what's weight loss? Thing? I won't take. That I'll lose 50 pounds by July 4th. I'll do it if you can by the end of the stream. <laughs> <laughs> Poker Lion raising it up to 250. <laughs> we'll do not have a nip I don't think that's correct. Actually, the graphics are probably a little off. You don't have a nip Poker Lion raised <laughs> to a normal size. <laughs> Cupcake <laughs> re-raised to 275. <laughs> My best material never get dirty. Yeah, nope. This could get interesting yeah. because Poker Lion still has his knit yeah, button yeah. in front of him, I mean, so he's gonna want to win a pot right now. So he's more than likely not gonna like fold. Oh, no. I stand corrected. Cupcake takes it down with the queens. This direction. You trigger an automatic weight loss bet right after. Yeah, we'll gain 50 pounds of I had a decent hand. This doesn't end soon. I might have to just go to the bathroom and see what happens. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, you might not last me. Somewhere in 50, 50 to 60 pounds. You'll range. get back and I'll just be stuck in another two and a half K probably. Yeah. <laughs> another look at the cumulative winnings lose, there. I lose like 45 pounds. I'm like, that $3,000 is the best You're pretty happy. Pierre that. up 3,000. Yeah. Poker line down about 3,000. I'm for sure shit not doing $200,000. <laughs> Sorry, Doug. I bet, I bet you would lose the weight. <laughs> I, I would, if Bill was like, yeah, I'll give you 250, 250K to lose uh, 50 pounds, I'd be like, I, I want him. I just mentioned that. Like, like, I want no him. one who's I, commentating. Well, if you feel but he doesn't know who I am, so. On the way, Well, luckily for Cupcake, Doug is not in the room right now, so. He didn't hear that shot. Llama chooses to slow play with the ace queen suited preflop after a raise and two calls. That's going to allow E to easily come in with the pocket fours in the big blind. It's kind of the downside of slow playing decent hands preflop like ace queen suited or you know pocket jack stuff like that multi way. You let a bunch of people in with other hands that have good equity. Couple flush draws here on the flop. Justin with a gutter to go with his flush draw. Tito's got the nine high flush draw. Poker Lion's got an open ender. A lot of draws out there. Poker Lion bets 150. Justin raises it up to 350 with his combo draw, and Tito quickly calls in position with the nine five suited. I did normal healthy things until like the last four days, and then I was just like. You know, three gallons of water, two gallons of water, one gallon of water, sauna. Poker Lion well, super smart, but has to call three. I believe he already has 100 in there, 200 in there. So he doesn't have to call much to have this chance to hit. Oh, but he actually jams all in. I did not expect that. Now Justin's in kind of an agonizing spot. He's either ha he either has to call this all in with just jack high, or he has to fold a combo draw, which is pretty much never going to have less than 30 per something percent equity. What would you do here, chat, in Justin's spot, if you had played the hand this way up until this point? Are you calling this all in for 2,000? About 1,600 more? Yeah. You can wait until the graphic pops up. And see exactly how much it is. Got a player behind to think about too. It's basically impossible for me to do anything. Yeah, we we wanted to see the Doug Jungle Man like punching, like just some kind of boxing. Looks like Poker Line has a little more than the graphic initially said. There, he's got 2,500. Covers Justin either way, so Justin has to call 1,600. 
to win about a three thousand dollar pot. Yeah. Let me know in the chat what you think he should do. But what he does do is call. Thanks for bearing with us. We just had to count the chips there, see how big the all-in actually was. I'll get to pee either way. So Bill first needs to bet MJ Poker that he will beat him in a boxing match on his knees, which is ridiculous. I'll... Somebody want to take action, I'll pile on MJ. I saw when they posted on Twitter. All in. Everyone in the world was like, can I get action on MJ? Yeah. There's no, there's no, there's there's no chance. Perkins is the only one dying on Yeah, it's zero percent to win. Unless MJ has like a stroke during the match. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, nice. big, I'm the big guy. Yeah, the big nice. guy. Actually, I wonder if there's like a, a secondary market where the line moved up to the point where somebody took it. Yeah, I mean, maybe, maybe, he, maybe he gets so injured. He could get injured. But on your knees, you have it. Tito really mulling it over. The funny thing is, if he calls, he's not going to expect it, but his out is actually the five. He needs a five. He might think he needs a spade, but he needs specifically a five, and he does call. He's in very, very bad shape. All right, let's flip the cards on their back, listen to the table, and see what happens here. Yeah, you got oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, Hold. Wow. Hold. Hold. <laughs> oh, what the hell is this? Five? This is what I'm for right now? Guys, do not come to Texas. There is no action in Texas. Oh, you have double gut shot. Guys, no action in Texas. Don't come here. Yeah. Don't move here. Stupid knit game. Let's see a red five. Yeah. Yeah, one five. Oh my god. What a break. That's close. Hold. What a break. That's close. Hold. Yeah, here comes. Oh Let's my go. Oh my wow, Jekai <laughs> Scoops. Wow. That is absolutely what incredible. What a value bet. What a value bet. <laughs> you guys need Jesus. Now I've got to pay the nit game. <laughs> i got to hit true. up an ATM. I'll be right back. Uh, awesome. Wow. So anyway, poker's going good. <laughs> I've never got like I, like I said, guys. Like you said, po big <laughs> poker's going great. <laughs> $7,600 pot with Jack Nine High. Welcome to the Lodge. This one. I just want to make one highlight video. This one. That, that was like in my head when I yelled. I mean, it's like, kind of like, cool. Like, 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 two, three, 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 they all have like yeah. something. Five and six. It was cool. Because double guy shows. It's never going to hold. You know? like, there's the updated no, winnings. Justin is tapping out down 4,700. He also lost the knit game there, unfortunately, so he has to pay each player $50 as well on top of that loss. Tito down 2,500 now. Pierre up 3,000, and Poker Lion flip-flopped. He was the big loser, I believe, going into that hand. Now he's the second biggest winner, up 2,600. You gotta protect your hand. Yeah, I mean, you found, you found the two hands. You tried to protect your hand, it didn't work. No, like, exactly against those two hands, yeah. You didn't want to go up against their pairs are, or two five's spades. good, but you Jack's go not against, good, eight's not go good, nine's not good. Uh, we, yeah, yeah, I can leave that, leave that there so we don't forget. I can, oh, okay. okay. I'm, the, I'm the straddle. And you can double. Uh, all right, I'll just call. Uh, you can do whatever you want. Right. Yeah, it doesn't matter. <clears throat> oh, who's the Nick game? Who lost the game? Yeah. Uh, he, he, he said he had to go to get money. Yeah, he said he had to go get money. And we're never going to see him again. <laughs> I'll go find him. What? Get his hat. He's just gone. <laughs> Jake's gonna get him. Security. Get him, Throw a card at him. Catch him. Skirty. 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 It's like four security guards right there. Yeah, but if they don't know, they'll stop people. Yeah. <laughs> no, just <clears throat> tackle him. Take his hat until he pays his bounty. <laughs> it's a cool hat. Three ways to the flop. E with the biggest piece, hitting that middle pair. Oh, Anastasia, which and he takes it down with a bet. Oh, that Cupcake actually calls. He's got a little bit going on. Backdoor flush draw and backdoor straight draw, and there they both are. Now Cupcake's got a combo, combo draw. Checking my combo draw. Give it to him. Yeah, that did it. That was a very honest check back on the turn. Cupcake's there. As he checks, says, I check my combo draw. E goes for that this blocky bet, less than 10% of the pot, $50. Cupcake does fold. 
Wait, is that straight? No. <laughs> <laughs> that would have been the best. How awkward would that have been? <laughs> oh my god. That would have been hilarious. <clears throat> Flash muck. Was that, wait, was that a straight? Did you get a submariner? Hmm? Yeah. Did you get it a long time ago or recently? Um, probably two years ago. Okay, so you, you, you didn't get the fuck. straight connector. I didn't get as fuck. As fuck. It was more detailed. I was like, oh, yeah. Yeah. it wasn't like the real bad. You yeah. couldn't think. I mean, back then, you can buy these for three grand, right? Like ten years ago. I don't know if it was that low. It was like, I mean, the retail on them was like uh, probably maybe ten years ago, like eighty-five hundred or something like that. Now, now it's ten years ago, eighty-five hundred. I think so. Okay, I remember maybe more than ten years. I, I remember one be. point you could buy a submariner for, for like, like three, four or five grand. Really? Yeah. Three to five grand? Maybe I'm wrong. He, I mean, that could. But now they're like fifteen. Was it? Just for like a noxious thing. Submariner. Yes. Yeah. Where they go now? Fifteen. Yeah, they're around that range now because they're, they're starting to come back down a little bit. Okay. From where Cause I, I remember it used to be the, the entry level stuff. Yeah, it's like it's like the, pretty much yeah. like the yeah. you know flagship. I mean, they're great. I, I like it. Oh, this is favorite. the worst yeah. pre-flop hands of the night. Yeah, I like I like this one. One call. I, like, I don't like the super flashy ones or anything. No, this is I just for yeah. yeah. I don't have any of that. Is it me? Yeah, okay. It's just oh, you. For sure. <laughs> How much is in the pot? Like thirty five dollars and about hundred. They're just gonna go to the river because it's not big enough. Nice Crash, that was dominated. <laughs> I figured I was probably ahead. To buy wine now, you have to like bribe the guy. It, it depends. Oh, thank you very, yeah. very much. Uh, it was a uh, um, buy all the shit with it. Yeah, you can get like some now they they kind of know. I added a thousand yet. Like they uh, they want you in on the other because they don't make anything on the Rolexes, so they, they but they get to decide who gets what. So right, so they want yeah, you, they want you to spend money. Yeah. Some money. it's so crazy. You walk in those stores where you just spend ten grand and you have to beg them. Yeah, right? you got you got to beg them for your money. <laughs> so yeah, it's ridiculous. Yeah. One of the PLO really one ridiculous. of the PLO players collects them. He's got like yeah. Some ridiculous ones. Well, and if you start, you start buying a few, then it gets a lot. You probably of crushed it in a few years, yeah. in the past few years, then. Yeah. I mean, they're good. Yeah. You can, I mean, they go up who, who, for the most part. One of the field players collects what? Rolexes. No. Yeah. He'd like mine. My, my best one. <clears throat> yep. Yeah. Oh. 59 presidential day date. Oh, okay. Oh, that sounds good. That's a lot of good words. <laughs> 1959 presidential day date. No, no, no. Yeah, that's what I mean. Like, it's a, it's a good one. What are the girls in the live back then? Huh? 20? 25? Um, <clears throat> that's probably at least 50. It's 40 to 50. 40 yeah. to 50. Yeah. Those are the platinum ones, right? Did you, did you, did you, did you ever see that, that super old oh, one that John G has? The gold one? No. If you premium hands seeing the, see the flop here, Cupcake kicks off a gutter. Oh, I thought it was on you. I'm sorry. Oh, it's not on me? It's not on me. If he if he, if he he offered, like, he's like, I'll give you this watch if you give me your card. Like, yeah. Snap. Yeah. Snap. yeah. Like one of those watches. <clears throat> Salim's going to take a stab with the Ace of Hearts in his hand. He gets called <laughs> yeah, by that gunshot. You'll gun never shot. afford this. If you have to ask, it's too expensive, right? Nine of diamonds on the turn. Cupcake takes the lead. He's like, oh, yeah, you know, I've had it since I was 18 or whatever. I was like, Jesus Christ, John. <clears throat> and he springs to life with a lead. No, he doesn't. Pump fake. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. You got you got you got nice what friends. Kind of friends man. you have. Yeah. yeah. Nice. Best friends. I can get free necklace. <laughs> Even that's a stretch. That's exactly. going up. That's going yeah, up. Yeah, I know, dude. Prices went up. Now it's harder. They're cracking down, man. <laughs> Netflix, but I also have to. Salim sign takes out. the lead back on the river, checks back, and drags that pot. <clears throat> yeah. I like how you shake your head like. The Lodge Championship like Series good. returns. Okay, not good. No. In Not April, main event, May 10th through 16th, $3,000 buy-in, $2 million guaranteed. But that's not the only tournament in the LCS. Go to thelodgepokerclub.com backslash LCS to check out the full schedule. There's a lot of different tournaments, a wide variety of buy-ins, as small as 200, as large as 25,000, and a bunch of different game types. There's probably something for you. It's a nice little precursor to the World Series. Or if you're not traveling out to the World Series, maybe you're a little closer to Austin. This can be your World Series. Come on out in April and May for the Lodge Championship Series. There's three five. No, but he has one in his hand. Oh no, wait, no, no, yeah, three, three. Yeah, three outs. He had no, or he had a spade. I guess he had. Poker Lion raises it up to 75 with the Ace Jack offsuit. Am I the other one who sees Ace Jack and thinks Black Jack a good amount of the time, but I never think that when I see Ace Queen or Ace King or Ace Ten? Am I alone? Well, not necessarily. Also, we got any amount of LP? No, because a nine. Oh yeah, he had a Jack too, right? Yeah. 
There was another card other than eight. 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 eight comes, I get a straight. That piece he had like an eight, asterisk eight. next to my name. <laughs> yeah, yeah. There's card only one. <laughs> card that's a lean. <laughs> yeah. Players like still talking about that legendary Jack Nine yeah. high hand. Seventy-six hundred dollars being won. Too many hands up. With Jack Nine high, guess, you do yeah, not yeah. see that every day. A little bit more often in Texas, but even not every day here. Is the weirdest hand that can happen? Nah, I'm so glad we're having never happen again. Oh, yeah, I know. Taylor's coming up. Perfect. I know now. Too attached to the button. Yeah, but I'm raising like there's a straddle and there's not. So. It's a disease. What do we call the disease where you're too attached to the button? I think it's just gambling addiction. <laughs> nine was good. Two nines. Three nines. I've had a glass of wine delivered to me, everyone. Well, when I was in my 20s, I was definitely 16. Now I'm around. Thanks, man. Where are you? 6'7? It's your bed. 6'7? Me too. Good oh, pick. okay. Yeah, I thanks, forgot. Good luck, everybody. Take care. All right, man. Oh, you heading out? Battle of the King Highs here. <laughs> Bit of a jump ball here. Both players with King High. Tito's going to take a stab on the turn. Feet open. And they said we it's a private game. We get to pick who we want? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> just wait till we bust him. <laughs> oh, is Charlie here? He might play. Llama does get out of the way. Charlie? The alternate this is generally not the best. But oh, sometimes get him on Charlie's in here. Here, he's good. He's, oh, I don't know who Charlie is. Uh, he only played once on the Christmas one. He's, he's my friend, but I jammed the 5 2 against him like an idiot. Oh, if I see him, I recommend him. He said he might come up and play. Yeah. Uh, mm. I'll slow play for a second. I just and there's a look at the V-pips. Unsurprisingly, your boy Tito leading the pack Sorry, at 61%. E trailing behind at 20. Everyone else in between. Cupcake, Pierre, and Llama all above 30. No. Justin was more than zero, but he's out of the game, so it doesn't register him as having a V-pip. Do you think they would always have, like, what, two people on standby at least or something back up? I didn't know I was playing. He came and, he came and asked me if I would play. So I, don't know how, I don't know how many. Uh, oh, you came to play a tournament? Or just no, I just was at, I was sitting at 2-5. Uh, Probably what they do. They walk over to the 2-5 like, like, game and see yeah. who's playing. He just said somebody didn't show up you want to play. Is it 5 time running today? Uh, no. It was 2-5 when I was there. There was a list. There was like a list. I usually, yeah. Uh, no, it was there. everybody who was at the 2-5, so they could have probably started it. With the turn, I, I, I call usually call run the five ten on the yeah. uh, game, right? But with the tournament, right, it usually goes right. But yeah, yeah I know what I'm doing. Tournament, <coughs> I'm gonna read this slow. It's like, all right, take a break. A lot of people will play work in the tournament. There would. I mean, I'm, I was sure it was gonna run anyway, regardless, because the tournament. Yeah. Tito limps in with the king yeah, two probably. suited. Later in the day, the game will be super good. Selim yeah, picks up the the eights, so he's gonna raise. You playing used to you living used to you. Brad, unfortunately, not in town at the moment, as we see. Salim hit middle set. I saw someone in chat not, not hoping that Brad uh, is the one who's going to take that seat. Just not in Austin right now. I never played in Houston. They're all kind of near each other. Salim flops it's a been, set. That's a hundred dollars. Like, Tito's got a little piece like with bottom eight, pair and a backdoor flush draw, so he calls. Turn ace of clubs. Going, five ten games, and then so you guys get they get a ten twenty five. You get some. You get some smart one. action. What? You get. You guys get some big no limit. No limit action. Yeah, it's been pretty good. I thought it was only like PLO and gets. I mean, PLO is really popular. Yeah. I'll be off. How much I play when I go down? Salim's turn bet takes it down. Depends on the day. We we basically just like switch off to like a different place each day. No, not that. So we kind of like work with like two clubs almost. But I mean, I don't mind. Almost like a private game within, because there's like we just text each other and we have a list of like 30 people or whatever. But then anyone can sign up. As well, That's but they kind of always wonder how it works here. Too. They just make sure the game's always running. Yeah. And it's like there's so yeah. many people on the text list that it's like Cheers yeah, it always happens, or it always occurs. If I if I'm just in Houston and I'm looking to play, where where would you recommend? Uh, I usually do Prime or uh, I think they're called Elite now. Okay. 
They just they were one on one before they just changed their name. Gotcha. But so Prime is elite or no? They're two different. Two they're like they're like a couple miles from each other. They're in the same area. Gotcha. Okay. Poker line picks do you guys up have Ace to, King. Do you guys have to bring your own bulletproof vest or <laughs> give it a, a at Legends? Yeah, they don't supply them. <laughs> Tito gets in there with three Queen three of Hearts. <laughs> After you get shot one, they supply it. Okay. Yeah, that's, that makes more sense. You're like I'm interrupting. Now you're good. You're good. Got a good one. You should be get on there. I need to come check it out. I've never been to Houston. <laughs> they have the rodeo now. <laughs> Poorly timed to re-raise from Llama here. <laughs> Seven five of spades. Yeah, they, they have like I was just saying like don't fucking go. Rihanna playing and shit. And I used to do that every hand. Oh, now it's like I, I just can't. Mm -hmm. I, can't. Like, I gotta get back into it then. Oh, we had that poke. Hey. Whoa. So we have an open seat. If you guys want, I would play. Love to play with you guys. Storm Storm we can find another player. Yeah. Sit Come down. Uh, Charlie, have a seat, buddy. <laughs> no, sit uh, down. You get, you get I don't even know his friends. Oh, as, as you will. <laughs> All right. You, well, you can keep it warm no, for us. No, come sit. <laughs> All right. I'll yeah, I'll, I'll, yeah, I was like, you can sit till whatever we get to. Yeah. I drove all the way to Houston to play with you. That's 400. All right, I'm in then. Where's Dax? Where's Dax? Whatever, Dax. How much money can I take off the table before Doug sits down? I think we're... I think... Like the biggest tech player on six, right? You can show us that kid too. <laughs> yeah, 500. Yeah. Why don't you give us your best Helmuth impersonation? Yeah. <laughs> Bit of an action flop here. With it going bet call. Poker line's got top top. Llama's got the flush draw. Yeah, oddly, I've never seen Taylor standing up. Like noticed that he was as tall as me. No, he's in there. Oh yeah, you missed that was a funny conversation. Okay. Check yeah, check on the turn. Queen there. of diamonds oh, on the river. Alright. Because I was thinking wait. See if poker line decides to go for some value. I, told him that I don't think he's likely to get it. It's perfect. Perfect. You should have worn the sunglasses with the shirt. It would have been even better. Yeah, maybe. It was just dude, it's it's just so wild, like how easy people blend it's in those four and a quarter. And then you just see Neon color, Taylor's head. Mickey ears. <laughs> and I was like, we're going that way. Look here. And the lion takes oh, it down with that river bet. And with that, let's have a quick word from our sponsor. What's up, gamblers? My name's Alex, and I'm a big poker player. I'm a big sports better. I've made over $400,000 sports betting. It's documented. A bunch of different places so you can look it up odds jam but essentially what this tool does is it's a data-driven sports betting product it pulls odds from sports books and shows you discrepancies plays where you can actually have an edge right so out of the millions of odds on sports books what odds jam will do is show you big discrepancies like this one where every book is pricing this wager around minus 115 and you're getting plus 106 on caesars no emotions, data-driven sports betting. Check it out. Odds Jam, seven-day free trial. I think you'll really like it. I appreciate you guys. Thank you. If you bet sports and want to be able to shop the lines easier, Odds Jam is a great tool. Head on over to Odds Jam. Use promo code LODGE so they know that we sent you. We want them to like us, you know, so you'd be doing us a favor. How's it going? And you'd be doing yourself a favor because so so Odds good. Jam is yeah. great at what, what it does. Back to the action. Tito opens it up with 7 2 suited. Gets called in a couple spots by Llama and Cupcake. What? How many? 10 or something? Okay. You got any? Pretty new. Yeah. Takes good forever to make them. Great poker. You guys should keep it up. Yeah, yeah. I love bloggers. I agree. It's a lot of work, but it's fun too. Yeah. How did you pull that ace five card? That was brutal. Oh, and at Kings? Yeah, brutal. I don't know. He squeezed and he jammed two X pods. This guy's behind me. I'm like, I don't know. I ace jack. It was hard to watch. How do you think I? <laughs> how do you think I played? You didn't even there, really so think about it. You're like, this is a fold. And you fold it, and then he just like tanks, kings. Did you? You folded, right? He showed me the ace. Oh, okay. yeah. You, As we, we take a little look. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. At the Lodge like Card Club, card this is the, the back like, well, section then. of the room. 
All these guys and gals are in our $1,200, 1 million guarantee main event. Yeah, I'm playing 5k, you got 5k, right? Yeah. Okay. I'm in for 5k. Can I just get like a stack of red from somebody? Here. Thank you. Just, I think that's all, all, all red. That feels big, but let me check. Let me it, it was off last time, so. Oh, wait, hold on. It's way off. No, it's no, not no, no, no. One off. One off. Okay, cool. Okay. Cool. Thank you. This you're, is the one time I'm actually going to watch you're, this. You're the court. So. The and there is the special yeah. guest. It was spoiled both by Cinnabon and by our production team <laughs> updating the title <laughs> prematurely. So, so but there he is, Doug Polk. Okay. In the game. It makes the raids easier. Okay. Tim to fly, we are a social yeah. club Counting here at the lodge. Counting is a kind of important part of poker. Yeah, it's overrated. There's math in poker. We've got some good hands here. Whoops, Tito picks up Ace King offsuit. I should learn the math. He's been playing a lot of pretty speculative hands today. So he actually picks up a monster here. He raises it up. E calls with Ace Queen off. Poker Lion just calls with Ace Queen. Both of those players could have put in a re raise, but they decide to call. Just tell him to get out of your way. King high flop. Music to Tito's eyes. It's like written out too. It's like if Johnny has four apples. Yeah, the ACT math was way easier than the SAT math. That's so low. Wow. He said he liked to sit low. Oh, he was sitting backwards. That's why. Yeah, yeah. Thank you. He has a chair turned around. Oh. I'm used to this being like right here, so it's just like easy. Yeah. He did the whole time. So this is the one I would have grabbed. This is beer six, though. That's fair. Yeah, because he was talking about he's yeah, like, I, he's like, I'm The key difference, Tim to fly, for a social club, <laughs> you have to be a member <laughs> to play <laughs> at the lodge, <laughs> since it's a member's club. Easiest bet of all time. Here we go. And then you also pay an hourly seat okay, rental so fee rather than rake being taken out of the pot. You can't take a rake in Texas, so we don't. I don't play a whole lot anymore. You pay $11 an hour to sit at the table. Ends up actually being a lot less than rake, unless you're a massive nit who wins less than like three pots an hour on average. Work or family or? A true, true nit, someone who only plays like Queens Plus, they probably pay more at the lodge, but pretty much everyone else, you'll end up paying less overall with this structure. Poker line picks up King Jack offsuit. He raises it up. Graphics. See if you can find some holes. To find it. Yeah. I, I would need my phone though. You guys figured it all out. <laughs> Longest work. <laughs> You're never gonna be 100% foolproof. The hundred dollar straddle is on this hand, so the stakes are big right now. Hence the big raise to 275. Tito calls with king queen offsuit. And now Pierre is in the big blind oh, with king queen so suited. This is a hand he could definitely re-raise with, but he decides to just call. Reasonable play as well. We didn't factor in the magical seashells. <laughs> <laughs> That's as close as you can get. Everything but the magical. Ace high flop. No one really with any of that. The only small piece is Tito with his queen of clubs. Could hit two running clubs to make a flush. Security! So as you can see, I'm totally taking advantage of my illegal. Yeah, yeah, I can see that. <laughs> There's cook peaks over there, too. In the pink box. Oh, I see. Oh, right. King I, got, I, I gotta get back on my diet. King I, I dieted for a while and lost a yeah. bunch of weight. Yes. And then I took like a couple Maybe. weeks off. And we're now at that inflection point it's okay. where you, you, either, get you either get back or you uh, don't. And if you no, don't, it's gonna be just. I still feel like I'm behind. Down no, for me. <laughs> what, uh, every, every, it might have been the best. You're at the back door. That's probably a bluff of the best hand. Lost the after. And it's not that there's a bet associated with that, but like just in life, I've always lost yeah. the after. I've gained, I just gained it back too quick. You, you have to keep, you have to keep it together. Find some balance. You have a, a two-part bet. That's the three. Uh, five, who gave me five k? Let's get some predictions from the squad here. The squad being you, chat. Um, how is Doug going to do in this game? He's entering late. I think he's going to be buying in for whoever has the biggest stack, so about like 7,000 or something like that. How much do you think he's going to win or lose in this game by the end? Let me know in the chat. Doug Polk's final net result, winning or losing. Just Doug stack to 5,000. We're good. There you go. 
Look at, look at this guy popping off. All right, there we go. Squall blind thing. Actually, it's not on the table. It's all good. We got there. We figured it out. So yeah, I don't know if you know, but if it falls to me and Jake. We're gonna. Oh, they're playing a fun game. Yeah, okay, fun so when I saw that you hand, take, you I didn't realize that you guys. Were there. <laughs> What's up? You want to take the hunter back from there or here? And then this is for you. Thank you. Okay, sounds good. Oh, and one, the last one? This one? I figured you guys were going to start. Oh, yeah, seven sorry. Seven sorry. What am I, doing? I was going to ask you if you want it from here or there. Oh, no. Let me uh, Let me just pay you a black one. There we go. Perfect. I mean, thank you. <laughs> oh, I already forgot about that. Oh, these are new, the new. Oh, I may not have, he, he may not have seen it. Yeah, he probably left before he got there. Oh, how, yeah. am I, how am I supposed to get commentary on my yeah, Jack High hole? It's like a $6,000 pot, three way all in, one by Jack High. It's going to be a good one for the booth. Yeah, for the bunker. Yeah, yeah but it flawed. sucked for the rest. There's yeah, two how people how dirty was that, too? <laughs> yeah, on the flop. <clears throat> I'll take it back. I would have preferred to spade and lose that one. Yeah, it's hard to live that clean, buddy. <laughs> I got Jack High. You're all dead. You're all dead. <laughs> so you have a three, three way, way all in. Uh -huh. yeah, on the flop. Jack High. Jack High won. For like six and a half. K. Yeah, yeah. There's a Jack High for this, this much. Nine I lost the losses draw. then, yeah. And we didn't want it enough. He had a better Jack than the Jack High plus draw. The plus draw didn't come. It went three twos on the end. Yep. Wow. <laughs> You're not going to run one of those very often. It'll never happen again. <laughs> <Screwed up laughs> no, yet. never again. The stand-up game I had a double gutter. Oh yeah, that makes sense. that's true. There were there were multiple. <laughs> there is that. Involved, yeah. And me and the other guy that were we're the only two left, right? Yeah. So it's like, yeah, more action. I understood. Yeah, I understood that. And then he was just like, well, I hope I'm the only one with spades. Yeah. Nope. Uh, and he's like, oh, Llama pick, picks up the jiggities, oh, no. like a, <laughs> raises it up over oh, no, Tito's here. limp. Two chances for five. So he he deserved it. He deserved the five. No, Tito's gonna call. So, I already gave it's him like 30 half K, so I thought it was fair. Oh, okay. Queen high flop, like that. rainbow. Okay. But when I was watching you guys in that hand, you were just well, talking to each other and like, like trying to get reads. And I'm like, this is an incredible hand. Like he has nine <laughs> high, he has eight high, and they're just like, both yeah. totally yeah, yeah, yeah. Got no tank. tell at all. They look really comfortable. They're rolling. chatting back and forth. <laughs> The reed is coming in over the top. This is a phenomenal hand. Yeah. River comes. Snap. And then you bet. He snapped. And I'm like, okay. So, and I was, like, I was like, oh, is the card reader wrong? And then you start going, like, I got a nine. And I'm like, oh, they don't even know what they have. Yeah. yeah. I was like, wow, this is incredibly high level poker being played right here. Pierre knows that Jake's weak, but Jake knows that Pierre's weak. It was super low. Well. Uh, it was you you were right 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 crazy because Pierre now. thought eight high was good. Too. As Doug. Yeah, of talks about a pretty epic hand from earlier in the stream. We see our cumulative winnings. Pierre up 2,500, poker line up around the same. Salim also up 20, around 2,500, 2,200. Justin the big loser, he's already headed out for the day, minus 4,700. Llama the biggest loser currently at the table. If you want to go see that kind of crazy, silly hand, because that, that Doug is talking God. about. It's hand <laughs> Me too. I'm on 40, oh sorry, it's hand 54 <laughs> from today. So feel free to scroll back, find hand 54 and watch it. It literally will take you 45 seconds to watch. It was a very fast hand. And it's pretty funny. You just like hero the shit out of him with nine dudes on like queen jack, four jack or whatever? I mean, you, you hey, can Hey, uh, weird hand on the law is live. Like, yeah. God fucking damn it, Pierre. <laughs> With no context. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The commentator's yeah, yeah, yeah. like, how is he doing this? Yeah. One raise is supporting. We agree on doing it every you pull hand. Out the, the, uh, I definitely want to hear that. Can you pull out the player commentary and just pull in the audio from the booth? Oh, that's definitely the guess the hand. Can you, like, um, yeah. like, yeah. Well, just mute all audio and make new audio, like yeah. you, you're seeing it for the first time. That would be hilarious. That's definitely, I guess, the hand clip 100%. Like, as, as like a reaction clip. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, so I don't know if we can do that, but. It would be disingenuous, but it would be hilarious. To be fair, it doesn't really matter till the end when it's spoiled anyway. Yeah. <laughs> well, then the clip after, like, oh, they were yeah. flipping. That's. But I guess if it just goes down the whole way. I feel like insta snap the river. I'm like, oh. what is going on? I feel, like, I feel like with no commentary, you would just realize by the end. But they'll flip it up like one card, though. It's like, yeah. <laughs> oh, that's true. What the hell's going All on? All the laughing and stuff made it a little, <laughs> a little more casual, too. Yeah. yeah. Everyone knows no laughter at the poker table. Yep. And that's a good flop for 10 9 offsuit. I saw it on the sign when I walked in. <laughs> yeah, we have a sign that says no laughter. Check. Okay. Cup 
cupcake with a pair of trips. He's not going to check anymore. He's going to bet for value. He's up against a couple of ace highs, so it's not out of the question that he gets some action here. He bets 325, around half the pot. Turn. Great. <laughs> Such a bad turn. Ready to be a hero, but not against that action. <laughs> I True. definitely thought I was in the lead. Such a bad turn. How's that nice? Be calm. <laughs> that is so many tens, CJ. It's also so many nines. A lot of tens, a lot of nines. But you did believe him. <clears throat> wow. Well, uh -huh. Which river card were you scared of? All of them. No. I just two quad draws, pretty good, good draw. That's it. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know what I'm doing. Twenty-five dollars draw. Fresh. Just woke up. Yeah. That was, that was a sweet Those glasses off the are yellow so chip reflective. And into the box. Yeah. Uh, I for sure. I would do. almost be worried you could uh, see someone's cards when they're blocked. Yeah, we've been knowing what he had. Just oh, oh, they clearly no. don't have much in view of everything, right? Then why was he winning? <laughs> <laughs> I, I, don't I tell him. I feel like he could have won two grand more without it. Fuck. Four fold, five fold. One of their We were setting up for the long game. Yeah, now I know they that you know that you know that I know. Sort of exactly. Don't a 10 with it. Yeah. So it's, it cancels. I don't know. I could have done definitely. Always. Heads up. It's always easier to say when you look back. Yeah. There's certainly a Five scenario where I just call there and fade whatever the hell they're. The only way I lose is if they check, check. pair. Okay. Yeah. It hits, I that's higher. That, that, that's not happening. How's the baby, Doug? We not. Good. Uh, we're not good. We're He's sitting really well at night. Really already? Yeah. Uh, How many yeah, hours are you getting? I should have just called. I'm, I'm, I'm getting like. Almost totally normal sleep. I, I asked the wrong question. How many hours is she getting? Your wife. <laughs> he's getting almost <laughs> normal. He wakes up like one time. That's Elderly. amazing. Because wow. he's what? Five weeks. Just oh, a few wow. weeks, right? right? Yeah. Five? Yeah. Five weeks. Wow. Yeah. Just he, he usually, he'll go to bed at like 10, and then he'll wake up once at like, it kind of varies, but like three or four, and then he'll go to sleep until like eight. That's really Thank you. That's, that's uh, legit. Good. All right. That's Doug so bragging that's about his new son's great. incredibly Thank good sleeping son. habits. Shout out to Otis. Yeah, it's on you. Otis. Sorry? Oh. No, I was just oh. saying the name. Oh, yeah, yeah. You can look at your hand if you want. Did you want to again? Poker hand? Lion raises yeah, it up to 40. <laughs> no, my Cupcake hand. calls oh, one to his left with ace, ten of clubs. I probably sure. showed it. Uh, next mono, we do the net. Sure. Yeah. Or next hand, I don't care. Or mono, yeah. yeah. Just next hand. Let's just next. I, 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 I don't want to not check in advance. He's like looking around now. Like that first couple weeks, he's just you know surviving and getting back to whatever weight and stuff. But now he like he really loves black and white lines. It's like st we have a ceiling with like what, black beams and like white, yeah, white ceiling. He just like stares at it endlessly. Mm -hmm. Do they hold their neck yet? Five weeks? No, right? I mean, he can like. Not really. Not yeah, really. like not like consistently. Up. No belly time. He's starting to kind of roll over. Yeah. Not all the way, but he gets like, like today in his crib. He was so far over on his side. Y'all got a crib in the bedroom yeah. with you? Um, we have a bassinet for now, and then we'll go to crib right later. And then we have like a nursery with a crib in it. Right, but for now he's sleeping in the old room. At night, yeah, next to us. Yeah. Right, the technology nowadays, like uh, all the cameras oh, yeah. everywhere, uh, and the different things, they, they, they move and they, they make noise. Like yeah, like, yeah, just wait. wait when is one color will start? I had to download five apps. Like, all right, the other day, here are your five apps. I'm like, five apps? Yeah. Like, what's the password to like the crib? Yeah. How do I get in? Yeah, really. He has a legit excuse. I'm gonna straddle a piece. Are we so in it or not? It sounds like not. <clears throat> no. I'm straddling. All right. Um, okay, so we're, so we're is it is it like what they say when you have your first baby? It's the best feeling in the world and all that. Yeah, I mean it, it's so like I really want to get to the point where he can like know who I am and respond. You know, because like right now it's just a lot of responsibility. Yeah. Like there's this little person, and if you guys don't take care of him, you know, <laughs> yeah. he dies. Yeah. 
So that's just like a lot of. Kind of like a tamagoji. That's like a lot of weight. It was kind of like a what? Tamagoji. Tamagoji. Tamagoshi? <laughs> Smaller steaks, but yeah. yeah. <laughs> the baby or the tamagoshi? Like, yeah, the baby. <laughs> tamagoshi is tough. Tamagoshi is probably the end of the world back then. Sorry, you can lose that shit. Yeah. <laughs> Because babies can do something on their own, like Tamagotchis need you completely. Yeah. Completely <laughs> Tito boats up on the turn as the players babies talk about babies. Like Total dependent. Dependent. Well, not much, but. <clears throat> I bet 100. I like Ryan Reynolds uh, talking about when his, his wife had a kid, and he was like, you know, I love my <clears throat> wife so much. She's the greatest thing ever on the planet. And as soon as I saw that child, I knew that I would put my wife in front of a bus to save this child. I was like, Jesus, that's crazy. It's right under the bus. I don't know about saying that. Right? <laughs> like, even if it's true? <clears throat> yeah, I mean, Something's that can't, that can't be good. It's Ryan Reynolds. It's Ryan Reynolds, yeah. I mean, he's a professional comedian. Right? Yeah, I, know, I, know, I, know, I know, I know. I mean, maybe when he's like, Six years old. Not when he's super young. <laughs> <laughs> you don't super love him right away. Uh, he's, how's that work? That takes a while. Yeah, I, gotta, I can't get attached I to mean, it. You obviously you super love them right away, but I feel like there are things that are bonds with you and your parent that you don't have yet when it's just a baby because it's just you taking mm. care of them. Yeah. Uh, <clears throat> like you still love your wife more. more. I mean, I'm not, I'm not like, I'm not, <laughs> Let me answer that question. I'm not falling in this trap. <laughs> <you're saying. laughs> yeah, well so played. At what age do they start to have like more like personality and stuff? I think 15, 16. <laughs> <laughs> Years. That's my favorite. Lifetime. Somebody becomes a shitty person. Yes, right. This is a straddle of 25, yeah. six fold, oh, seven fold. Yeah. I think that's what you do. Wait. He's starting to yeah, smile a little bit, which yeah, is, yeah, which yeah. is yeah. pretty cool. When he laughs, when he, when he can laugh, it'll be great. Yeah. For sure. You know, Looks like Dougie P gets his first playable <laughs> hand. <laughs> I bet he three bets before he open raises. <laughs> what were his first words? I call. <laughs> call in. You know how parents have this bond. We don't get it. You no, know, you don't get it. You know, it's, they're all right. Doug's three bet does get called, and we get an interesting flop. Nine four three. I have a puppy, so I'm trial running. Doug's got kind of a lot going on. With a bunch of backdoor draws, some pair outs that are actually live. But Salim's got to be feeling pretty good about fives on a nine five, or an, uh, pardon me, on a nine four three flop. You, know, you can't, you can't do anything about it. Yeah. 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 I mean, what are they going to do? <laughs> totally fine. How old are your kids? Uh, six and three. A six year old boy and a three year old girl. So you got, what, nine more years? 15, 16? Uh, so it's a personality yeah. development? So you can kick him out. Doug it's picks like up one, one of those draws on the turn. Yeah, He's got an open ender now. <laughs> But I mean, Salim kind of fun, has right? a straight draw as He's well. Fun, yeah. Yeah, yeah, six is a cool. My daughter like hates me, so it's hard because you have to like earn her like love. <clears throat> like my Are son like loves me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. My daughter. I feel like it's like this. When they mommy. become teenagers, it dips a little bit, and then when they get a little older, it goes back up. Yeah. <laughs> well, they say six. That's the year you apparently learn the most stuff. Six. Really? Yeah, the six is when they start <laughs> feeling like a person. I think like mm. five, six is great because they go to yeah. kindergarten. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's a lot. Man. <laughs> I love when my kids are not home. <laughs> <laughs> my kids for sure hate me right now. Just, uh, my phone was going off when I went to the bathroom. It's like, you ruined everything today, Dad. <laughs> Why do you love cards more than your family? Bring them back up, kids. That's an easy answer. <laughs> that's, that's literally the, the words of the text I just read. <laughs> Why do you love cards more than your family? Because you suck, text. family. Yeah. Do you want me to pay for your college? <laughs> Like, you have a new car. It's not my fault that you're stuck in downtown Austin while your brother has a workout. It's the brother's fault, it sounds like. It live, sounds like. We live in a Uber world. It sounds, well, <coughs> it's 16, you can't, but. You can't when you're 16? No, 18. Really? But 18 the older brother is 20. You can't drive, but. Um, I was like, just order an Uber with, for the 20 year old, want the 16 year old ride, and just yeah. solve the problem. I don't know. I feel like that's Why'd you make mom yell at me in the store about the Uber? Oh, so 18 to Uber, 16 to drive. Yeah. I, I, I put all the <coughs> videos with Ray Zolling. 
I mean, I wouldn't want a 16-year-old fucking driving me around. Maybe I'm crazy. Wow, and Salim rips it in. I don't know. I feel like I have no clue. Takes it down. Doug has to fold the open ender. Nice play from Salim there. Twenty-five. Ten eye. Ten eye. Ten eight hearts. Yeah, because that's the only reason I haven't used the rush. Felt like you were around it, and that was a dangerous. Right, so are we starting yeah, to have a or not? We're dancing around each other. Mono collar. Mono collar. Mono collar. Bluffing. Which is like, wait, it's the same thing. Monotone and monocolor. No, monotone. By the way, you guys. No, but on the middle sense. Next game on monocolor, you're just gonna sleep. Like, can you just? Is there any other way to sleep on it? You haven't even played it yet. On the little. Catch everything. On the literal sense, is it the same thing? Because you need eight people to sleep on a fob of one color. Right. Hard. Jay. I might sleep on it, but eight people can sleep so The problem, Doug, is we don't notice the first two or three flops that are monocolored yeah. anyway, so. All right. When <laughs> the button's on pure, we're going to do the, we'll start the I don't object to that. I, like <laughs> <laughs> I bet you I'm do. going for three in a row first out. I bet so. you don't. I forgot to grab. Yeah, so I was going to say, monotone on the li li literal sense is the same thing. Right? I know I know what it means. It means the yeah, same yeah, too. Yeah, yeah. But literally, tone is in the color. Cool. Like, you're just, you know, it only means something you're just different fucking great at English now, man. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to learn. <laughs> Doug defends his straddle with 8-4 offsuit, flops a double gutter. <laughs> versus Tito's ace-8. I'm, I'm working on my citizenship test. I'm going to learn English. Yeah, on the test it says, does, does it's monotone, it's monotone and model colored. What's the difference? <laughs> Are they synonyms? Or Ten synonyms of diamonds on the turn. Neither player's going to love to see that. It looks like Doug might be mulling over a lead here, but he does check. Six of diamonds on the river. Fourth diamond. This is a pretty clear bluff from Doug. Can't really have a worse hand. So he is going to bluff. Should be a super easy fold. So. What we got? This has a pretty easy fold in that board. Yeah, that it should, should be a pretty easy fold. No. Nor monotone. Seems tough to bluff you if you're going to think it over with ASI. That's the whole point. The, <laughs> the, the whole dialogue here. I'm just setting it up. <laughs> uh, where am I at here? Okay. Straddle. Straddle? Save this is a single 20, straddle. 20, 50? 20 dollars. That's what? <laughs> what would I do wrong? Killing my straddles. I'm trying to close the action, man. I'll take it back. I wanted to do our game. That's true. All right. You gotta put more in the highest chance to do it. like four hundred to dissuade them. Yeah. I'm in there. Probably true. No. <laughs> Yeah. Aces. Sorry, oh, dude. I'm in there. Oh, yeah, exactly. <laughs> in there. In there. Yeah. I never thought about that. <laughs> legitimately Li never. Life, oh, life tells. <laughs> God damn it, Pierre. <laughs> blew, blew my spot. We should do this next hand. Give Doug the button on the net. Like King Tensura. Ah, let me get in there. Everybody's How much back. Is this? I think all the bathroom people <laughs> bathroom. <laughs> Yeah. I don't want to give. No, I don't want to give pure advantage. It's too much. We have it. Much. I fold. We should start the nick game now. Not on your button. Everybody That's fine. Nine hand. Nine hand. Lama rips it in preflop yeah, with big slick, takes it right. down. Yeah, no one ever has a good hand when they say that. Nick's like, I'm all in. Yeah, I was actually gonna just muck, but yeah. Here, you know, you know what? He's right. The thing is, like, he can still have a hand, so he's fun. I, I was like, you know, you make a great point yeah, here. I'll do that. I thought we only had to do that at showdown. So yeah, I'll have to do it. What's up? We're doing knit story now, right? I don't know. Uh, I think we're waiting knit for the story now. Are, are y'all starting now? No, want to? I don't care. Are we, are we not waiting day. for the flop? 
We're just doing it? No, because no. we'll, we'll miss it. Doug like, said we're soft for waiting for okay. the flop. Right. So then we'll next do next hand. Hand. Next hand. Next hand. Oh, I like next, that. Next, next hand. Yeah, because you're undefeated in a row. Yeah, in a row. The man, ready, the man cannot be beaten. Oh, my God. Somebody help me Why push all this in, please. Yeah, let's start our next hand. Yeah. You're at 125. I'm in there. <laughs> you, you hesitated. You know, me too. You treat yourself. This, is, this is Queens Plus. Don't under <laughs> Queens Plus. <laughs> can I get some, can I, can I bet on that? <laughs> I was in there. My favorite hand. Nice. <clears throat> Good out. My favorite hand. That's All your right. favorite hand, Queen 10. Queen 10? It's my favorite marginal hand. He prefer the I'm super not in 3K. Or double suited variety. Uh, I <laughs> never want to suit it. You hate when they're suited? I don't, but like, if you say like Queen 10 suited, then you're like, oh, you, you, it's like your too favorite hand is yes. actually decent. It's too cliche. Yeah. I don't, I don't understand, keep, keep I don't understand these words. The cliche. Ask Pierre. <laughs> We French, not Italian. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> um, are we doing the round Jake? show? Cheers. Right. Oh. Are we? This is the I, end I of the seventh one. I proposed it. This is the end of the seventh one. Is that empty? I, I, I know, know. but it now it is. I'm in. <laughs> he crossed yeah, that. I'm going to need to turn second. that over on top of your head. He's also, he, he, needs, so, he needs a signed receipt for every beer, just, you, just you to verify. You crossed that bit. Yeah, I'm oh, going to need some Here's your signed receipt. Seven beers down there. All right, let me keep my money though. Yeah, I'll bring it back. <laughs> I realized what I was doing when I was doing it. No no worries. Worries. You take whatever's on the card. No worries. Do you see do you see niche or niche? Winner. Winner. Oh, he just, probably just tipped her. Niche. The niche key? No, just uh, niche. Clear niche. the bill with. I think he's niche, right? Some of the niche, some of the niche. Oh, you haven't been paying? Because I knew I was going to win. Why would I pay? Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I see this. Tabs on you. You're gonna make yeah. me tip too. I get it. She's like, should I just leave it at the end? <laughs> I thought like, he was supposed to tip. That's very crafty. No, I, I have been tipping. What's the, what's oh, the okay. penalty, by the way, on losing? Fifty, I think. Oh, we've been yeah. doing fifty. Then I would have had to pay for all the beers that I didn't yeah. that I did finish. Oh, he doesn't care about that. He cares about. Oh, this. <laughs> did, you, did you see the guy Sorry, that was 50. in your seat where he won a hand and then like he got in a hand with me? Forgot this. I like distracted him. He didn't show his hand. I We're doing 50 again, right? Yeah. Yeah, 50. And then the he tilted like, off the planet, lost every dollar, reloaded, lost every dollar, lost every dollar. If that's where the table decided, that's, that's what we did. He's won in the, We're doing 50. the first yeah. round. So, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. He, Pierre he putting in the light three bet here. Yeah. King Jack offsuit. Action could heat up. Salim just behind him with pocket eights. Doesn't look like he wants to release. I like the Californian. And then Tito's behind in position with Queen 8 suited, so I'm going to bet we're taking a flop here, unless maybe Salim 4 bets, but he doesn't. He does just call. Yeah, defend your title. Yeah, I'm not going anywhere. Yeah. What are you guys supposed to raise more. makes this so small. <laughs> it was a pot sweetener, you know? Yeah, that's all. We do go four ways. You want sunglasses? No. Salim's pocket eights hold up on the flop. I feel like you should just wear like a full suit and just wear and the sunglasses. sunglasses. All orange. It'll confuse people. They're like, is he loose? Is he tight? I can't, better? I can't wait till you guys see Matt. Is it better if you drove that one Lamborghini that, that comes here? That's, that's exactly oh, the gold one? one? You'd have oh, to have gold Phoenix TTT. TTD, I believe that is correct. Someone did in a 1 2 game fold the nuts face up to make Doug lose his first ever stand up game. And I believe to this day that's the only time Doug has ever lost the stand up game. Not all heroes wear capes. Tito's going to take a stab at this one. He bets 700. <laughs> Should we make it so, nine-handed? Salim <laughs> <laughs> so gets out of the way. Looks like Doug is too. <laughs> you suck at it. You didn't show your hand. Oh, you're right. Oh! oh! <laughs> we could have kept the button. He mucked it already. What's the rule? 
I'll keep playing. I want to hold the title, though. I want to hold the title. Tito, absolutely so, a legend at the Nick game. Some people play if you, if you do that, it doesn't count. But I don't know what you guys... I wasn't here earlier. No, it doesn't just, count. Uh, well, if, if his hand... There's, there's more, there's more yeah. to stake here, though. I've been first out three times in a row now. I, I understand. Oh, <laughs> Excuse me. Uh, game hosts, uh, can cleaning. you kick these riffraff the fuck out of here? No. Back door. Yeah. Who would invite you? He did. He did. You were too slow. <laughs> I debated stealing it, but I'm like, both of these guys are going to trap the shit out of me here. You never pulled anything. And, and like, now the dog's I, out here. We have a new addition to the bunker. Greg Potter is joining us. Welcome to the stream, Greg. We got some action here. You ready? I am so ready. Thank you, Mike. Happy to be in the booth with you, finally. That 4 3 hand was incredible. Nick game is on. Tito has been first out three times in a row now. Three times? That is, that is impressive. Tito, you got to stop knitting it up, man. Master of the Nick game. Master. You bluffed me? I see old Douglas has hopped in the game. He has. Can't imagine he's been knitting it up, but I guess we'll see. Howdy, Yoda. Yeah, I didn't, uh, didn't expect to do comments here today, but I'm more than happy to hop in the booth. He's going to put on the three-bit with ace-jack offsuit from the straddle. And Salim seems like the call with two ducks. Looking for a third one, does not find it. I almost called him with a pair of tens. Uh, I had queen ten. There was four diamonds out there. He showed a jack. Oh. Oh, no, he, was, he had a good answer. You did? Okay, yeah. that makes sense. It's funny, I think if Pierre barreled Boston Timmy, I see you. River, but I was like, man, I feel like a lot of his bluffs just like bet turn. <laughs> like, oh, is Liam going to lead yeah. this board into I mean, E? I, I can't imagine he's going to have that. <laughs> a lot of hands are pretty mediocre on that board if you yeah. don't have it. <laughs> I feel like it, that never works. Interesting line for Salim to take on a board that overall should favor E. I mean, that one you maybe could pick off, but the one he Being the three better preflop. There's no way you can call there. I just, I, yeah. I, I was gonna, j oh, is that the one I four I feel like you would, you would But he does let it go. I was gonna jam any good river, and then it was like- Selene gets it through. Says, like, I think my deuce is- and then ace king. Yeah. We're good for now. Maybe not. Turns him over. Well, Shows the bluff. Straight up value. And he, he gives him the news. Straight value, sir. Six players remaining in the Nick game. Tito does not have a button this time. Good to see, considering I heard he has lost three in a row now. Gets expensive paying out the Nick tax. Who's the interviewer? Doug with ace-five offsuit. He's going to V-pip here in plus two. Definitely loosening it up a little bit. Looks like he's lost some. Short stack. Not I mean, the most unreasonable, yeah. I suppose. He's in a longer hesitation. Bad timing for the... Uh, oh, I'm in there. Super treadle. Wait, that's a, that was a straddle? Straddle, raise, oh, wave. Okay, okay, okay. No, that was a straddle. That was a straddle. Is that a straddle? Yeah. 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 I ah, that oh. makes more sense. <laughs> I was like, wow, I've never seen Doug get That's quite this big. this wow. spicy. I thought he was three betting to polarize. Yeah, a big double straddle. Cupcake going to defend the straddle. <clears throat> really, really locked in today. <laughs> <laughs> Cupcake going to lead. Thing out of the straddle, it's unlikely that he's going to connect with his board very often. Doug may be... Contemplating that idea. Does make the call. Believes his ace high is good. But Cupcake Carlos not going to lay off the pressure. Doug lets it go. How about we take a look at the cumulative winnings? Mr. Salim is up the most 
Up a cool 38. Justin, who is no longer in the game, dusted 4,800. Dug down 3,000. Nice of him to uh, donate to this game. Everybody else in between. The Llama now picking up a nice suited connector in the hijack. But E in the small blind with two nines. It's going to raise it up. Llama just limped in the hijack. Not unreasonable at this stack depth, I suppose. Does not want to get three bets by a player like E in the blinds. Jake now with a very easy call, I think. Unless... He just wants to rip it with 10 high. Easy call indeed. <laughs> <laughs> what do I know? Oh, what a spot for E. It's a big bet. Yeah, you don't often see a limp jam in a game like this, but here we are. I feel like E might sniff this one out. I'll be honest, I'm surprised he didn't call already. I think he's just thinking it through. And there it is. He does call. You got spades? <laughs> <laughs> you got spades? No? Great. <laughs> Ooh. I got that covered. <laughs> I'm dead. Seven, seven. No, he's okay. already That's saying he's yeah, completely <laughs> dead. Whatever. Lions versus Lions. I think I'm going to win. I'm feeling pretty good. <laughs> <laughs> I'm feeling pretty confident. Michael, you sound? Keep saying it. Right in the window. Bonk. Spade. Oh, oh, no. No. Very the sweaty boy. Way too oh. sweated. The way too sweated. Jake takes the lead in equity. <laughs> That's insane. Oh, yeah. <laughs> wow. Back to a coin flip. Dead. I'm dead. That's why I was like, can I buy out? <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah, wow. Just, wow. Gets asked, there. Sometimes, when you, sometimes you just feel it. This is one of those times. What a more. <laughs> 17. Sorry. 17. 17 the llama felt nuts. it with the old 10 high. <laughs> yeah. not, not like you won. No, you made the nuts. Like that, if you could pick your hand out of the deck, you would pick that hand. <laughs> yep. It's pretty crazy. Yeah. Nice. I didn't know you want to see it play out. Add three. Taylor, I'm in for ten total now. I added two, two more. Okay, so admit no more. Three says the llama. I added like almost exactly two more. I'm in for ten total if that's easier. Sure. Dubby's in the game for ten total. I'm hoping they're all two K recently. I'm not. Best time to find out. For ten K total. Yes. If you want it. So. So Mike, how long did you say you're here for again? Just till Sunday. Till Sunday? Awesome. You come down for anything else or just to uh, come hang out at the lot? Just to hang out at the lot. Hell yeah, man. What else? What, what else is the right answer? I do like to eat the food in Austin, but for the most part, always here for the lodge. No, no, no. It just didn't look like 10. That's the only thing I was doing. You can have a was. It doesn't look like that. Sure all right, I'm all in. <laughs> <laughs> careful, if Jeremy is the floor, he'll say that's binding. To say careful, Doug. Verbal that can be binding. Four, Maybe not in your own club, six, but... Nine, Especially seven, in your own club. Roughly. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I, I had a sidebar conversation with somebody about a bet. A little bit. Yeah. All right, who's the math guy? How much is Doug? <clears throat> Sigh. Just normal right numbers? Right, not so like poker math? He's got the $25 draw. I can do the non poker math numbers. We, we, <laughs> <laughs> that's great. <laughs> we trapped them. <laughs> that's, that's, that's the takeaway. I got trapped. <laughs> the takeaway is it was, it was a successful trap. They fell right in. Oh, right. <laughs> Nuts. Well, like, if you got it in any later, he would have folded. That was a perfect trap. That's true. <laughs> Dougie P making the standard call with the 9-3 offsuit. We got three premiums headed to the flop cupcake. Flopping best, arguably, open ender. Doug's got bottom pair. Salim's got a gutter. Everyone a little piece. Doug's uh, getting in there with some hands. 
Just like take, take sitting on a stuff. much shorter so stack than he's used to, I imagine. Like, <clears throat> yeah, like you get your money back, but you also you get my, my but, net, but yeah, then yeah. you have two. <laughs> wow, just a call. <laughs> oh, we should have somebody with two. Yeah, you got two to burn. There should be a mechanism where you get another one. Yeah, that's smart. And that's a straight for Salim. If you get bluffed, it makes it exciting. If you get bluffed with nine high, you get another net button. Oh, yeah. Doug with the only <laughs> club of yeah. the bunch. Yeah. yeah, that actually would be amazing. The, 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 gonna, the like, person that does the bluff is the two who gets it. Yeah. I like that. He can pull you back into the Nick game. Yeah, it's gonna be you to get, get bluffed, you get it. Yeah, you get bluffed, you get an extra nit button. But the nine high or worse. Can you have two buttons at the same time? Yeah, yeah. 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 two hand and a hundred yeah, pop now. Yeah. So you end up with like three nit buttons. You're like, geez. Salim uh, gonna charge. Yeah. You're you're never getting out of them. Flush draws and it once it gets like down to straight like draws as well as cupcake. Final two. It's gonna make the call. But I don't know. I don't make the rules. But like if you're out of Doug the game, was in there as well, in. I believe. That's King on the end. It would just go on forever. Salim well, decides well, not to go for value. He's gonna win this one. Both of you go home. Both of you go home. Also, like people are on guard. They're like, oh, he's trying to bluff me with nine higher words. Yeah. Very strong hand. Thank you. Oh, the head in the fly. I actually, I actually <laughs> it's a good one. It's a great attraction. All right, Doug, what do you think of this next. idea? Hmm. I'm playing the knit game, but you had a rule. Charter. If you get bluffed by nine high or worse, you get a knit button, whether you're in or out. So you could have you two knit The buttons. person who bluffs you, you get, you get, you get, get a win. Oh, yeah. 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 so you get bluffed. Yeah. I see. You're probably seven, right? Yeah, I like that one. Do it on the next round. Do it on the next round. Yeah, but it'll end up there. Not this time. Let's call it a read, but I think What happens if you lose with two knit buttons? You pay double? You pay double. Yeah. No. Oh, wait, you, know, right. you, yeah, you, you would have to lose with, with two at that point. Yeah. Wow, game bluffed is pretty Cut, shitty. Bro. Yeah. It's Imagine like a small. heads up spot at the end between two nit buttons yeah. and like yeah. what, and they, they're rebuffing each other. Yeah. It's so good for action. I think <laughs> it would be great. Yeah, that hand you two played would be real. For yeah. Sure. <laughs> oh, shit. I thought, well, I, would have I, don't, I thought it was the button. He would have raised. I can't wait to watch Ben Hunter not really. It's like he's <laughs> floating the three bet on Good the four with the eight high. You saw my hand? Oh. No, I just couldn't have a net button. <laughs> and you were both yeah. looking at each other like this? <laughs> You're like next to each other, like just like... <laughs> like this is incredible. <laughs> we should have not said anything. Two, yeah. two masters at work. Yeah. <laughs> All right, next, next time it happens, let's just be serious. Yeah, yeah. Just do it. And then we just flip our cards without sweating. And like try to make the bets like yeah. something you might do with a hand, oh, maybe. Yeah. And just people be like, what the Eventually they're going to clip one. Yeah. Put it on the highlight. Well, the button, button. Button. If we keep the doing this one day. Another button was over it. there. Over <laughs> there. <laughs> Look what's in the <laughs> three bet with pocket fives. The knit game is on, and things are happening. Poker Lion four betting. Local diner. 700 to go. Oh, yeah. From the stream. That's it. Real cheap, though. He doesn't have to make it too big. I'm in there. Put on the pressure. <laughs> and Doug is in there. <laughs> I'm loving it. I'm in there. Call. I love it. We saw you on the stream. That's awesome. Wow. I actually that. Poker Lion flops pure. <laughs> yeah, I bet, I bet people from Round Rock would watch that. I mean, people, local people. I have a feeling like Doug's not folding. Called out outside of the poker room ever yet. I'm, I'm sure eventually one day it'll happen. Well, to do that, you have to spend time outside of the poker room. That is my problem. <laughs> <laughs> I don't go out of the poker room. Does make a call. Right. Yeah, no one knows you in Hawaii, dude. <laughs> you know, no, no, no. You don't have enough viewers in Honolulu. That's what I'm learning. Yeah. Doesn't get better for Doug. Poker Lion may start to check this back, but does not. JC got grabbing Green betting chips. At a club. He got 1,300. Mm. Yeah, but did they think he was the Terminator, or did they think he was? Yeah, he's the T1000. Wow, yeah. he's very that guy, right? How's it going? Good. Yeah, Bo yeah. Mike told him. To. I'm pretty sure these are literally giving me this. The weird. Well, wow. He's gonna call again. That's why I lost. Poker line getting some nice value here. He just has to fade a well, five, and he does. Five. Damn it. Oh. <laughs> check, check, and Doug does get the oh, bad Doug, news. You're not me. <laughs> fives, fives take it away, and then the fives take it away. I thought fives were good, yeah. Yeah, yeah it was a, the close one. Wow. Um, Three left. I'm not looking so hot. <laughs> you trapped me. I wouldn't bluff a light. Mm. Uh, you are the under the gun. <coughs> it's hard to make a pair, you know. Be a king. Could be a little bluffski. I, I'm, if I missed, I might have. <laughs> I, I did the uh, backup plan. 
Yeah, hit it. <laughs> Backup plan is it. Backup plan is a good one. <laughs> that's, a, that's a good just backup hit, plan to just hit the board. Where's the five? Did I tip you? Ah, uh, yeah, no. Oh, yeah, I, I didn't yeah. think you needed it. I think you more chips, jeez. It's a straddle? That game really boosts up the stakes, it does. you know? It does. Jordy says Doug just here to burn money. Why not in your own club? Oh, for this net game? Yeah. I'm glad I took 10% of him. Oh, yeah? <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know that. That's awesome. Yeah, he asked me right before he went in there. Okay. Wonderful. <laughs> yeah, why not? Let's go. Didn't yeah. know he was going to be calling 9 3 off in the big, but. <laughs> yeah. Or calling, yeah, so it goes. calling down with third pair. Look magic in. So it goes. <laughs> you get the Doug with the Doug. <laughs> you get the Doug with the Doug. Can't believe they barred in there. Houston heads up. They <laughs> kicked them all out. We go four players. Yeah. What are you guys talking about? Some yeah. raggedy yeah. hands in here. Yeah. Be preserving. Kind of yeah. Yeah. Checks around on the flop. Kind of. <laughs> Ace nine still pretty far out in front. <laughs> Doug's gonna take a stab with one of the two king tens. Definitely don't blame Tito for calling. Probably going to scare off Pierre, luckily for him. <clears throat> Brick City. Let's see if Doug continues his story. I was about to say, I don't think, I don't think he was going to go for it. A lot of draws bricked. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and he has that 10 of spades, which is not really a good card to bluff with on the river. Definitely not. Tito does drag a pot. Get some of that knit tax back. We'll take a quick moment to tell you about Texans for Texas Hold'em. Texans for Texas Hold'em is an organization comprised of dedicated poker players and owners of poker social clubs who are committed to promoting and protect protecting the thriving poker community in Texas. The organization has already announced its first bill, House Bill 2345 by Rep. Guillen, is a proactive social poker bill that looks to amend the Texas Penal Code. Talk to your local state representative and tell them to vote yes on House Bill 2345 if you live in Texas. If not, head over to the website Texans for Hold'em and get involved. Thank you. Be fair, I'm putting on the regular show. Well, we came back at the right time. I'm in there. Doug's in there yet again. Mm, I'm gonna pickle now. Three betting a yeah. suited wheel ace. Oh, okay. never be the Usually very reasonable yeah. in late yeah. position, but Poker Lion just <laughs> happens to <laughs> have it this more time. Here. Mm, mm. Luckily now mm, we have a mm. game host. You don't have to do the embarrassing run yourself, you know? Mm, mm. <laughs> Nice. All right, let me get the lucky like I like the call out of position. Just uh, 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 I didn't see what it was, but I think it's the queen's plus. <laughs> Four bucks, 500. Not even a real size. Not even is a real it, size. It, should I do a different size? No. Probably no. Four bucks, three. Pull in. Good ass. All right. Yeah. Doug gets that one through. Then we're doing this. Brody. Spades were coming. Spades were Doug's not losing the Nick game today. Ooh, not sorry, today. If I had offsuit, I Not when Brady's got 10% of them. too good to <laughs> And I might have jammed. Might have. I really don't know. As we get a quick really check in on our cumulative winnings, <laughs> Doug just joined the table. <laughs> but that's not stopping him from being the biggest loser. <laughs> Down 6,200. Salim, the big winner, up 4,700. Poker line up 4,600. Everyone else. Somewhat close to even. Eh, ish. We're in. They got me. Big up. Until it's not. I guess to be fair, a lot of times, like, if it came on that way bigger, too, because it's just, like, people call, like, super light. And, and I really don't ring stuff, but it heads up. It, it loves huge sizes on that block. I don't know about ring. I haven't looked at any stuff, but... I assume some stuff carries over. Yeah, you're right. I was, thinking, I was thinking it was a four-bet pot for some reason, too. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> Seems reasonable. Also, you fold. I, I don't. I'm not in it. That's nice. Jake, those are just Texas. Rings. No, you're, so you're, you're, you're fine. Oh, it's a Texas. You're fine. <laughs> <laughs>
I saw him reaching for chips. I thought he had cards. And... No, no, I was just trying to act cool. Yeah. He's in. It looks cool. <coughs> He's in. I was thinking I only that play more about that. Cutting out the re-raise. <laughs> I like the angle when You're I'm not in the part. hand. That's, okay. that's much. Are you from Seattle? Uh, I moved to Houston like nine months ago. Oh, okay, gotcha. Oh, right but I was. Yeah. You a hockey guy? Two players left in the knit game here. One of them is in this pot, Pierre. Get half a season and then we have to move. Let's go check, check, quick check. I waited for a football team in Vegas for 10 years or 12 years, and then we get one and I leave before I see a game. Yeah. I think basketball's coming. I don't think we'll get a baseball team there, but I think basketball's coming. I think basketball's coming there. I don't think they'll ever get a baseball like the bet from Pierre. Sport is certainly favorable from him. You can get a lot of folds. One now. The next five years. Your hands exactly now I'm in a place with no like cupcakes. No anything. No NFL, no yeah. well, yeah. one. You, you have one of here. the most fun hum environments for any. And you're not getting team, one. So. Yeah, I mean, yeah. I went to the Bama Tech game. It was, it was no, no, the Austin. Uh, the FC. FC. Oh, <clears throat> I'm not a soccer guy. Mm. Yeah. Go. Have you been in the game? It is a fun. Just go. Time. I tried one time. I tried to go, and then I realized that they put the home team, team in the wrong yeah. location. Yeah. So oh, I was like, oh, finally a home game I can go to. And I realized all of the away games were home games and all the home games were away games. Oh, that sucks. On the west. Okay. Like on their west? Well, no, in, so in soccer, home team goes to the top. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. I didn't know that. I'm picking right. a float so here. You should go to the game, though. It's not rewarded. Yeah, I've heard, I've heard it's fun. It is fun. I mean, I went, yeah. I went to LSU, and I know what great home environments are. It rivals it. Mm. For sure. That's cool. That's pretty crazy. Whenever I think of LSU, oh, you're yeah, yeah. Oh, That's okay. I'm not good at poker, so you can talk to me. Oh, nice. <laughs> um, so the year that USC won the title, the LSU also won the title? The and year that LSU won the title? However you want to phrase that. <laughs> so I got like a, LSU, I got a sweatshirt from my dad, and it was like USC <clears throat> National Champions. 1, and then I was out and about, and I walked by someone and said LSU National Champions, and we had the same year. And I'm like, this is just stupid. <laughs> <laughs> Change everything. Awesome. I mean, that's why they yeah, changed the system. It is why they changed it, but... The fact that you can both have the same sweater for the same sport as champions and right. different teams. <laughs> you could also buy an Oklahoma one, but you probably have to be in another country to do that because they already made them. Yeah. Cupcake giving this a serious yeah. think with just ace queen high here. <laughs> he smells something fishy. Oh, I'm still in the hand. From the other side of the table, he does oh. let it go. Yeah, I like the I like the the bed from Pierre there. Over bed spot, polarizing, repping a very strong hand. Gets the fold. Good bet. Powerful play. Oh, it's over. Terrible fold. Yeah, it's awful. All right, buttons and teeth six. Wait, I don't know. That hand took so long. One lost the Nick game. Yeah, I lost. Yeah. Because it's Jake Trap. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Good bet. Thank you, thank you. It's a, yeah, it's a legitimate trap. Awesome. I thought you were, you were at like 500, and I was going to call 500, and you called whatever that was. That I didn't pay attention after it was more than 1,000. I'm like, I didn't think it was going to work. But Darker, I, I didn't think it was going to work either. I, also <laughs> like, I was like, whatever he calls. Yeah, I also like, like hey, you asked if I had a pair. I'm going to play tomorrow. Nice. I'm like, what's he got to do? Be, somehow got a deuce, he's in there. It's Friday, right? Yeah. Yeah. Recall? How far are y'all from the guarantee? <coughs> I, I, it doesn't matter. We're going to cover. Yeah. For sure. It's too early. Saturday gets the most runners usually, and there's a flight day. tonight, right? It's going to... Saturday day for sure. This is the biggest one almost always. This is this is day two this now. Is where it's it's uh, two, right? No, it's, it's like four days. Day half. Like, okay. Wednesday was a one day. flight. Okay. So the reason why we had a lot of yeah, trouble covering some of our tournaments okay. is we went binds too big. Yeah. Guarantee too big for mm. like the for like the region. The star region. So now area. most of our guarantees yeah, are lower, so and we, we can just like hit like a hundred k guarantee. I, 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 we can consistently hit. Yeah, I, I cut it on out. I get three hundred. Taylor, yeah, that's yeah. okay. That's but we had whatever. a monthly five uh, six hundred dollar five hundred k guarantee, and that one was every month. It was a sweat. It was like we were always just oh, like the monthly monster. Yeah, yeah. Is that four hundred? It is. I will call that. So we got rid of that, and that's helped a lot with making sure we don't overlap. So no, no right. multiple well, multiple here we go. Multiple Salim going to mix it up. Yeah, we're not doing that one. I like Flipping. the squeeze with 6-5. Sure, we missed the red. Like two or three sure. Red flop. Oh. It's hard to know. Unsurprisingly, it's called by Cupcake. Yeah. Oh. We're going heads up to the flop. Oh. Like, and it's 6-3-3. Three, three. Like, Pretty nice flop when you squeeze the 6-5. But you only do it a couple times a year. You can advertise a lot. You can put a lot into it. You can make As far as results go, that's a good one. When it's like a monthly thing and it's 500K, it's not really that 
unique because you have it every month. So you aren't like, oh, I gotta play the monthly monster, right? Yeah. Whereas if you do it a couple times a year and it's a million, then people are like, okay. Sorry, sorry. Yeah. Two to three. So five, five, five gold. There's a bet. I just think a quick call. Literally, partly thought about it. And do them occasionally to make. And he picks up a flush draw. Just like try and constantly push the boundaries in every guarantee possible because then you're just gonna start overlaying a bunch. I agree, and I think that like. I don't know, it's a pretty good scenario for tournament players here right now. So yeah, like, for sure. Not, I mean, you don't have to extend super far right now to keep people happy. Yeah, I think so too. I mean, everyone knows you're just running tournaments, so we have Cup people to play calling. against in cash anyways. <laughs> <laughs> and he bangs it off on the river. Tournament? Ten of clubs gives him the best hand. I have a feeling Salim's not going to give this one up so easy, I though. Wish, cause <laughs> it's cash game, bro. It's funny to see <laughs> journey pros getting out of their leaving bedroom at home. They come with the pajamas and they left the house yeah, and, like, wrong. All those online guys. He's yeah, carving out some bluffing yeah. chips. Does put it in. Feels like you can value do heavy that size. Texas, though, without even traveling too much. No. Do, to do what? Sorry. Do tournaments full time. Hmm. Where I feel like that's not yeah. a thing in a lot of places. Yeah. Houston's been running a couple of good ones recently too. Yeah, you have Houston, and then Lodge, Dallas, Chot, San Antonio. Yeah. yeah. Everything's like a three-hour driver. Cupcake yeah. has not folded yet. In Dallas. Might be. Yeah, not so much as Houston. Thinking Salim's I mean, up to but something. You don't even need, like, is. If you're just traveling in that little hmm. that loop, loop, you only yeah. need one a week somewhere. Texas poker is really, really, really growing in a big way. Houston's <coughs> gotten a lot better last stable. year. Yeah. Texas poker definitely growing. Slim betting, bluffing like with yeah. a six. It's 17 or 16? It is 1600. Yeah, because we we're, we're only running one five five a week, and now it's running every day. And there's a 10 25 and some five tens running. This was like six months ago, that wasn't a thing. <laughs> You're, those chips are only if you're down money. Oh. This would be a sick call if Cupcake <laughs> can find it. <laughs> wow. Does get through. A play by Salim okay. there. Thanks. Squeezes preflop with the 6-5 suited, bets three streets, and takes it down versus the hand that rivered him. Good stuff there from him. Shows the bluff, Cupcake Carlos. I think he had the feeling that he was ahead, but couldn't pull the trigger. You put it right here, kid. I'm going to play against 15 people. Thank you. I'm going to need another 10K. Let's actually make it 20K. <laughs> and then I'll also take a sparkling water too. Positive thinking. So do you have 10%, right? Uh, big chips is probably best, yeah. <laughs> Doug reloading. <laughs> yeah, sounds Getting, like, it, sounds like it could get expensive <laughs> for me tonight. <laughs> yeah. He's like, go ahead and bring me some extra bullets. I'm going to I'm gonna dust it in this game. <laughs> Can you bring me one bullet, actually? <laughs> I'm going to need a second one. <laughs> I don't know. There were three or six. I'm tripling up or burning it all. Good God. And he needs a, he needs a love shot. <laughs> Whatever the hell it is. Was that an air ball? Thanks. I had 10. <laughs> I, I didn't see the board. You had an air ball, right? I had a six. Yeah, pretty six. But air ball. As, as close okay. to an air ball. That counts. You weren't valuing it. I was betting. playing it like an air ball. Nice. <laughs> nice. <laughs> there's times where Jack High is a value bet, and there's times where six, a pair of sixes is a little off. Did you guys want to do your 25? Well said. I did, right? Yes. That was a great move. Do it. Do it. Do it. I'm in. Flush was there too. Pretty hard to call. I, I didn't think he had that. I thought. No, I know. I was trying to figure out if he had thing. like a great mm. one, like four to a flush that didn't hit. But, um, not happy. Some people nine. in chat talking nine. about nine. probably the hand of the day so far, nine. where Jack nine. nine high won a huge pot. Not happy about yeah, it. that was insane. It's hand number not 66. Lighting. If you want to go back and check it out, not the not hand numbers are next to the pot. So if you just rewind quite a bit, you'll find it. Hand number 66. It's a sick one. Just be sure to come back to the present time. Say what's up. <laughs> I said you went over seven years. Oh, I'm sorry. You five the the <laughs> no, I don't, I don't think he meant that. The bounty. Tito takes the lead on the flop. 10-7-2-2 two, two hearts. 
This is the exact result you want when you three bet with two fives. Tilt call. Three calls. Close, you're right there. Now tilt though. Oh, so close. Four clubs on the turn brings a second flush draw. Tito's going to go for another bet. Cupcake is out of the way. I think it was in the front. Yeah. Lucky sweat. Oh. I owe you one still. Or actually, you won one. But you had, you had, you had what, did you, what did you fold? I'm adding 5K more on. Um, on the way. I had so a 10 I have 5K behind. and a good flush draw. I'm going to stop so winning pots against you. On. That didn't hit. Like, I had four to four. I had a spade. All right, let's get it. And I hit a 10 on the end. <laughs> oh, so you had a 10 on the river? Yeah. That's it? Oh, okay. But with the flush draw, I'm like, do you have a king? You can't call that bet. Um, better players would have. No. Worst players would have? No. The right fold. It's a fold. <laughs> it's a fold. <laughs> the game's weird like It's a fold and hope I don't show you 5-6. I, I'm not in that, like, range of calling <laughs> <laughs> Super mediocre. I can't. Go. Oh, I'm gonna try. There's, there's a bell curve. It's like, how could I fold? <laughs> I have a pair. I hit the pair on the end. <laughs> I'm trying, there's to, a, trying to hit the flush. He can only have this. Like, it was my hand the whole way. That's all that means. Doug picks up king queen. He was ahead. Wow. With the twenty dollars straddle on, he yeah, makes it was. seventy-five. Except for pre-flop. Post-flop. Good. You guys ask me one more. <laughs> Eight calls. One fold. This was a Doug raise, right? On a raise, yep. 75. Two balls. Three balls. All right. Five We're on five ways to the flop standard here. 390 in the pot. Lose everything. Standard. Whoa. 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 <laughs> Fishiness. Wow. Trip twos for Cupcake. And he's going to spring to life with a lead here. Doug with king, queen, king of clubs. Kind of a hand that feels like it wants to continue. Yeah, and there it does. Four raises, four raises, He's going to raise five, it up. Seven fold. This poker punt sponsored by Mike Brady. 10% of it, at least. 10%. <laughs> Looks like it's going to be a there quick re-raise from Cupcake. <laughs> you bet, and a very quick fold as well. Yeah, he kind of let Doug off the hook there. Yeah, he I had think just, so. If he had just called, Doug's likely going to continue barreling uh, on the turn, especially if he picks well. up a draw. <clears throat> I don't know if that's correct or not. I just study poker. I'm really new. I just okay. meant flop and two deuces. Oh, yeah, that part too. Because <laughs> after that, it doesn't matter what happens. I don't know. It's if that's true, can I get my chips back? <laughs> 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 yeah, it's all good. We do refunds here. I think that's a. We do one yeah. log and we agreed. <clears throat> I'm going to be honest, I don't know the rules. You, you could be telling the oh. truth. <laughs> oh, sorry. Sorry, Joe. Raises 75. So that was a really good raise for me on the phone. That was good stuff. Until the deuce. Why, please, God. I was not lighting money on fire at all. That was a good, <laughs> strong raise. Yeah, I was like, please, God, have, like, queen jack. I mean, I don't want to tell you how to play, but I usually try not to raise with the guy has trips. <laughs> yeah. No, that's good. I'm, I'm, I'm with you. I'm with you. Great advice. All right. Aww. Sounds good. Yeah, really at least, wanted, at least I, the the I should say, I should I say, I wanted say heads up with the show. Raise. I really did. Sounds good. I wanted heads up with the show. I didn't get it. Three ways to the flop. Charlie? Cupcake and Doug both flopping an eight. Cupcake with the superior kicker, but it's Salim who's going to fire a bet. He bets 175. <laughs> Cupcake not folding. Looks like he's counting out a call. Oh, he's counting out a raise. Wow. He's going to push Doug out. Blessing in disguise. Okay, kids. You have fun. <laughs> There's no fun to be had. Damn it. <clears throat> oh, man. I might have folded the best hand. You did uh, not. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> that was the appropriate sound effect for what just happened. <laughs> like, ah, uh, still not sure. Fun. <coughs> Fun's on here. Button is on here. It was biggish. No, I'll be good. Yeah. On me, right? Yeah. Almost right here. Or here. Preferably. Right. It's up to you, though. <laughs> <clears throat> hurry, hurry. Oh, it's already passed Pierre. Eight no, seventy-five. One point. Oh, Pierre got at the wrong time. Holds this king, doesn't know it. Mm. Oh, okay. It's up. 
This one's on Jake. <laughs> wow. Would have gotten the max. Depending on the run out against two worst kings. Even so, we got an action flop even with ace king not in there. Both players with top pair. Kicker very unlikely to come into play. So it's really Salim with that flush draw. Who has the best chance to scoop the pot. Tito's going to raise. Quick raise. Certainly not unreasonable in a single raise pot. Oh, you've been having that. Have them on the, whole the glasses? Oh, those are foldable I'm glasses. Now. Cool. They seem darker now. First time I've seen them. makes the call. <laughs> I didn't know. Awesome. <clears throat> in case you want to stow them away. It's so light under the brights, I need this aid. All the drugs. Under the lights. Under the lights. <laughs> under the lights. Board pairs on the turn, and a six is definitely a card that both players games. could yeah, potentially yeah, have yeah, here. Not that I see it, like, oh yeah, you're on the whole time. I decided I'm just going to wear them every time here, and then I just realized. never anywhere else. Okay, cool, thank you. Salim puts in the three. call. I think uh, glasses in poker are going to make, shades yeah. in poker are going to make a comeback. Let's take a rhythm. Finally. Yeah, I know, it's... I realize, like, when you're in the back. Yeah. Yeah. And we are going to end up chopping if I did it. these players can find their way to showdown. One thing at a time. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Tito. Not slowing down. Potentially, at this point... Trying to blow yeah, his opponent yeah. off a chop. So bad. I was picking on me. Hard to imagine what he's targeting for value. Maybe. At least sometimes. <laughs> Occasionally. I'd like to play them, man. Thank you. Thank you. Mix it up. Some new styles lately. Yeah, I'm gonna it. do some new stuff. I'm getting like a whole new wardrobe. Mm -hmm. Oh, you get a new word. Speaker, speaker phone. I think I've said that before. We got some oh, bullshit right. going oh, on. Oh, that's right. Salim calling Jungle Man. That's too. exciting. Yeah, so overall. We got more trying to phone a friend. No more tank nope. dogs. Oh, mix them in. Yeah. <laughs> the problem is if you bring a tank top to this room. I feel like you would call. I'm pretty sure I need to fold. It moves between way too hot and way too cold. Yeah. So if it gets too cold, you're out there in the tank top. You don't have a lot of. Then you need to go tank top hoodie. What's that? Tank top hoodie combo? No. no. Like That's I'm pushed for, for Joe to be in. Is Doug talking about like a tank top hoodie? Years, and then you bought the place. I've like, seen those before. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I haven't. That would be, no, 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 be right yeah, up his alley. Me but. a tank top next to me. And I uh, didn't like it at all. Because most of the tank top players are okay. not fit. If you're going to tank top it up, you don't even have to be fit. You just have to be taking showers regularly. That's fair. Or else it gets pretty. Well, but it was mostly heavier and hairy. <laughs> like, it's yeah. both of those things. <clears throat> yeah, that can get pretty bad. But, I mean, yeah, I, I pushed, as soon as he got the job, I'm like, can you please ban tank tops, please? Uh, he's like, can't do it. Can't do it. Can't do it. And then, like, they lose half I, their customers. The first time I, well, the first, no. It's, 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 like, it's like five guys <laughs> and the owner. <laughs> and then I was like, I feel like I should fold. I'm not going to ask anymore. It's, yeah. it's not going to happen. <clears throat> There's a big wing on the tank top front when, when, yeah. I, when I joined. <laughs> I'm a bad kid. Put a sign, no, no sleeves, no service. <laughs> <laughs> I honest, I agree with him though. Tank tops are Oh my god, we should have tank top day. That'd be hilarious. <laughs> if there was a just if, if I say, I'll give it away. Like, it's a, a tank top tournament. Tank top oh, tournament. Yes. yes. Oh my god. No <laughs> guarantee. <laughs> just a lot of fun. Sign me up for that too. I'm free roll. You don't have to wear a tank top. I have a bad Or just like love mine. I'm going to fold. I'm going to fold. Wow. One Tito holds the chop. I think we probably win a chop. Thirty Thursday is a Jesus off. Christ. There it is. Oh. Shows. Hey, leave the bad news. Kind of. Thank you, sweat. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you so much, hey, Budget Chicken, for the Good super chat. Donate your first Slick Ricks next. <laughs> it's so funny how it goes. Buy-in. I, mean, buy in. I want to see played, right? I wasn't even Slicky in place of 100 or 200. There's some cumulative winnings. Doug still dusting off 7K. Hold on. I don't think it was going to work. Selene, even though he got last off a chop, still up the most. It's so funny, though. Every stream. Poker Lion doing pretty well and everybody else in between. The stream starts. People dip their toes in. Everyone's too reasonable. And then a couple of games go. People get stuck, a couple crazy hands happen, and then by hour three or four, it's just no, full floodgates are open. People are just going oh, yeah. hard on the hands. And then Jake bets that Chad can't drink seven beers before the end. <laughs> I'm still impressed. I announced, I announced the angle shoots. I mean, you well, covered Salim. his entire third of the time that you had to cover. Yeah. Seems to be steaming a little bit. Three my bets, goal was to cover a six-four offsuit. That didn't happen, but it was close. You got close. It was close. If that was like the bet, I would have done it. Just, <laughs> I believe All right, that. I'll defend the angle. Good defend, good defend. Tito not folding, and Llama, of course, with an easy call, flops yeah. the best of it. 
pretty good result when you re-raise pre-flop with a 6-4 off. Yeah, he open ended. Open ender on a rainbow board, no less. That's some really great play for me so far. Nicer to have straight draws on those rainbow boards because none of your outs make a flush. Plenty of time to get it back. Your hand also is usually very hidden, especially with when you open the... up some offsuit what? cappers. Wardrobe picks. Um, she well, you. If she felt strongly, she could. She could call. have say if she wanted, but she. But like she's not styling you. Wow. No, 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 I have a stylist. Here we go. Oh, you have a stylist. Yeah. That's awesome. Llama is in trouble. <laughs> you have a so, but Salim is going to slow play the nuts. Yeah, interesting check back from him there. They all yeah, cool. I show up and they have like 50 things all picked out and then I just try them all and she said, no, yes, no, what do you think? And I say like, I don't know, I don't have any taste. She goes, good point, <laughs> no, <laughs> no, <laughs> yes. Good point. That's why I pay you, okay. <laughs> yeah. It's actually pretty sweet. You get there, you spend like an hour and a half and you can go through like a hundred things or fifty things or whatever, yeah. and you just put them on, take them out, put them on, take it off, and then someone like puts it all together, and then she like puts them into like oh, this great, is an outfit, right? this is yeah, an outfit, yeah, this is an outfit. Yeah. So you, you, you take yeah. you take your stylist to shopping. She, she comes with you shopping. You like she well, you, you meet there. You meet there, yeah, yeah. yeah. And then but then she'll also like go to lead from the like, llama. Like, what you Certainly have, not like, unreasonable, but tell you what goes. He's barreling yeah, and then you get straight to the nuts. You get fitted. Which, which tank top works with this couch? Yeah. Yeah, llama, yeah, llama kind of opting for that small, no. <laughs> somewhat of a blocky bet size, kind of like a third of the pot. Salim has calling chips in his hand. This would be a pretty tight just call. Spades did come in, but they're not super likely. Oh, there's more chips. He does raise. Yeah, not a big raise. Heard, just 300 more. Yeah, I wouldn't be too worried about spades here, but given that the board is pretty scary, the 10 does come in. Llama's not ahead of too much other than Stone Bluff at this point. It's big. And if it's tall, it's He does call, though. Wow. Quick call. <laughs> he says, what? What do you have? <laughs> Yeah. I did not expect to see that. That sounds like an That was a very disguised 4 6. The plan. <laughs> so what happened when he's always under the gun? Four, six Says works. that was the plan. <laughs> well disguised. Had this in mind when checking back the turn. Gun, three bet. Check call the flop. Turns 4 6 to the nuts, goes check, check. <laughs> Remember, I bet tiny and he like, raises pretty small. Like, Kept you in, man. I, yeah. Yeah, I did not expect Sounds like he extracted a lot of max value. <laughs> 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 But no, oh, I'm just, I'm just saying, like, it like, sounds like he might have had a plan. Yeah. If someone asked me to bet my life on a hand you didn't have, I would have said 6 4. There's no way you can have 6 four. Bet your life? Oh, that seems like a good thing to be doing. Yeah. Hey, hey, hey I'll, I'll, I'll put my life on the river. Yeah. <laughs> it's, like, it's like that movie Just in Time. Yeah. No, it was <laughs> just in time. <laughs> you know what he's talking about, right? I, I, he's talking about the movie, I think it's called In Time, yeah, but it's with, with Justin, Justin Timberlake. Timberlake. Yeah. So he said just in time. That's, that's one of the best Doug things I've ever heard. That that's, was really good. That's so funny. Because I wondered, I was like, I think I know what he meant, but not what it's called. <laughs> right, right. Drop a one in the chat if you've seen that movie, yeah. In Time. With that crazy poker scene where the guy like calls off like 70% of his life with a gutter and then hits it on the river and then doubles up his life. You know, I had forgot that happened in that movie. I used, I've seen that movie like three or four times. And I know, I know. I, I don't know because I remember I used to watch like you scroll through channels on like HBO and that would that would, oh, it would just be, be on. it would just be on. It it, it is kind of like watching vanilla ice cream. So I, I get you. Like it's easy to watch. Yeah, exactly. As we see Tito flop top two pair race to twelve fifty over this four hundred fifty dollar bet from Cupcake. Yeah, I mean, Cupcake not much going on in, uh, with just Houston the ace and the low kicker. Prime so yeah, he lets it go. Houston, but it was like a couple weeks ago, like the best hand Tito I gonna had show was it. like king five suited for the four hours or something. All three, it was just like out there? it was so miserable. Yeah, you know, like, yeah with me, Mila Kunis was in that I think, right? Maybe no, I could be wrong. Wait, what? I don't know. Someone said Olivia Wilde was in it. Was that who was? Mila Kunis. Oh, okay. She might have been. I, I don't remember. It's been too long. I was like, I don't. My first time playing at the lodge. I don't want that to happen. Yeah, I'm just gonna call and see what happens. I was thinking I might see you raise and go over, but. Oh yeah, yeah. We got the $25 straddle on. There you go, not under the gun. <coughs> I did not feel good about the money raise, but I was like, ah, here we go. 
It's Thank not you. that much. I, I think our chatter and you were thinking of uh, yeah. the movie it's No Strings Attached yeah, with I think Justin so. Timberlake yeah. and uh, Mila Kunis. Mila Kunis. Yeah, yeah. she was not in that. <laughs> Music Ninja Spy says that was the scene that turned me back on to poker. That's unreal, dude. Please elaborate. And then we do the nine high bluff. Yeah, definitely incorporate that in the next one. Yeah, yeah, That's yeah. too fun sounding. All right, next monotone nickname. nickname. Last one. But we're going to add the nine high bluff, and everyone agrees. Yeah, 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 yeah. What is that? If you get bluffed by nine high or worse, you get another you nickname. Get a button. You get their button. So you, it can put you back in the game, or it can give you two buttons. If you lose the two buttons, you play double. So don't get bluffed by nine high is the point, really. Okay, awesome. Yeah. And also, just Sorry. always play or worse, nine high. Or worse. I didn't hear yeah. what Nine eight two is the new aces. What are we doing? Nine high or worse. So if you get bluffed by nine high that. or worse, don't overthink this stuff. It's gotta be you more. get another nit button. Just think of the glory of bluffing but with nine it's high. But it's not gonna happen. Nobody's getting bluffed by nine <clears> high. <throat> it's a low chance, but I'll add some. It'll be too down. amazing if it if it if there's an opportunity. It doesn't. I'm just I'm waiting for the bluff now. rebluff where they both have nine high or worse. Yeah, if you get to a river and both guys have nine high, you're like, well, this is gonna be good. You might have to call the jam with the nine eight. You're like, I got the kicker. I got it exactly, exactly. The guy's like, boat. Call like the four bet jam on the river with nine eight high. I have top boat. I got out kicked. What do you pay? What do you pay your stylist? Just you don't have to say. I don't know. Just I don't know. My assistant coordinates it. Wow, how rich. <laughs> Doesn't even know what he pays. <laughs> yeah, I was like, geez. Wow. It's like this, <laughs> I don't even know. How, much is like, it? how many people you have to ask? insane. It does sound like you're going to add a pretty cool variant to the Nick game coming yeah, up next. Like Just to clarify, uh, if a player is bluffed off, bluffed off by nine high or worse, then that player is going to get an extra button and I believe double the payout if they are the last remaining with both buttons, can so it may or may not come into play, but certainly going to be interesting if it does. Yeah, definitely. Even if it doesn't come into play, it in theory adds action, right? Because Absolutely. you could be facing a bet on the river and you could think, well, he has that extra incentive to bluff with nine high. So maybe I call a little bit lighter. So even if it doesn't actually come into play, it does impact the game a little bit. So that'll be interesting to see. As we see Cupcake and Tito both flop top pair, E with bottom pair. Yeah, we might see more uh, 10 high calls now, I think. <laughs> or like Lama said, 9-8 high calls. 9-8, yeah, got the kicker. <laughs> let's, see, let's see river. River only. River only. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, that's what I thought. Otherwise, yeah, it, gets it won't happen that often anyways. Yeah. It'll like almost never happen, basically. Yeah, yeah it's never going to happen. Wow. Unless Cupcake in a three <laughs> bets. <laughs> the jack 10. 9-9 nine, nine on the river. Yeah. Okay, it's specified. Tito gonna make a good but fold. Like nine high, like your hand you know, I have to say it's not great when you raise kind of for value and the hand one lower folds. Yeah, it's, Never, it's right. rough. It's not great. No. no. It, 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 if that happens, you know that your raise in that instance was not good. Yeah, against that player, at least. Yeah, there are plenty of people I'm willing to uh, three bet top pair with uh, against. Because they'll call down with any two. At least a one two here at the lodge. Come check out the lodge. If you don't think there's action, you're wrong. <laughs> My wife played poker for the seventh time today and yeah, I saw won, it with chips and won seven hundred dollars at one two. There you go. Yeah, I, I'm up like uh, I'm up uh, a little bit this week as well playing one two. Easy game. Easy game. Doug picks up black nines. He raises it up. Tito in there with the jack eight. So consistently. So much, yeah, yeah. Yeah, you guys slept today, every game sleeps on, and it's like, yeah. oh wait, is there a stand? It's like, yes, because you did the stupid monocolor <laughs> thing. And by the way, who's like, oh, there's a monocolor flop, like the poker players say that or think that. Right, right. You're watching the stream like, oh, it's monocolor this time. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I there you go. I had a dealer in All the main event. Right. We're not gonna sleep All on that. Right. Oh! <laughs> Never mind, this shit's easy. <laughs> How dare you call us out? How dare you think you were dumb? Four checks, five checks. I had a dealer in the main who cheered when she got she dealt three cards over a ten on the flop. She was like, "Yes, high cards. I love these flops." Only the wow. best at the Rio. <laughs> <laughs> or, sorry, I guess there's no fair. <clears throat> uh, oh, that should be something Whoa. special. Doug's nines hold up. That makes it a hundred dollar uh, one. Because it's all. Check. You said it now. Nine. Check all the way down. Wow. Knows he's got the best hand. Wow. Does indeed. Yeah, held. <coughs> held. I see, I see seven, seven cards with the same. It's a mono board. something. Yeah. Mono every board. That, that, that makes it a hundred. I have two black. <coughs> uh, I got a kind of fifty. Four? 
mononucleosis. I'm about to lose some money. So we're doing a for 50 again? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So the knit game is so on. The, Once again, there's so a special nine variant. Nine they're already adding new rules. Like nine higher worse on the river, you get a button. You get bluffed by it. Okay. If someone gets bluffed by nine higher worse on the river, they're going to get an extra knit button. Any big hands asked by a presumably new chatter. Plenty of big hands. If you're trying to scroll back and look at them, check out hand number 66. You can check out hand number 96, which is pretty good too. That was pretty recent. Hand number 37. There's three. If you want to go back and watch them. And with that, let's enter the next knit game. Possibly the final one of the night. I'm going to get grilled if that's the case. Like, I bluffed. I'm going to get a button. Like, what happens if you bluff two people, though? Last fold. It's the last fold. Yeah, it's your straddle. Last fold. Always straddle. That's fair. You bluff two people on the river? It's the last fold. Wait, 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 wait. I straddle 50. I straddle 50. C3 straddles for 50. All right. Got him. All right, we have a $100 straddle on. Good okay. trap, good so trap. Uh, so did you get that match? Wow, $100 straddle on this game. Starting the knit game off with a bang. What was that? What was that? I'm going to have a very specific request. We're going to do it off, off get a microphone here in a second. Huh. What happened at 6 Hillary? Yes. Nothing. Yeah, I have no specific, specific request really off mic really from Doug. <laughs> what, what is that face? <laughs> this is cryptic. <laughs> yes, this is the time of the day. It's very, time of day. very suspicious. Are you not buying I it? I know, right? What's going on? Yeah. 400. <laughs> what is happening? Ooh. I have to say what the people on YouTube were thinking. What's the story? Folded, seven folded, eight raises to 400. One fold. Poker Lion picks up nines. Pretty good spot. Yeah. $100 straddle on, someone raises. Mm -hmm. Squeezing here all day. Great spot, great hand to do it with. And he's deep stacked to go along with it. <laughs> All right. What song are you just My reign is over. Okay. Oh. Tito's reign is over. R.I.P. Man. Boop, 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 boop. Boom. Is that a song? Is that a movie? Um, I think it's Eddie yes, Murphy. It's a classic old song. It's probably in, yeah, probably in yeah, one, three, Coming to America. Coming to America, that's yeah. where it is, right? Hmm? That song? You know, you know that? Like the, uh, hey, oh. Hey, 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 oh. That's Coming to America. Do you like Coming to America? That's from Beetlejuice. What movie was it on? It's in a lot of stuff. Beetlejuice. It's, it's in, it's in oh, a lot of movies. Uh, Salim is gonna, movie. is gonna make the okay. call. I don't think. Uh, We're taking a three thousand dollar flop here. Nines versus queen ten sure, suited. A fair yeah. fight. Okay. Oh wow! That's Look an at action this. flop. That I think the money's going in on this one. Top set for Poker Lion. Salim two overs and a diamond draw. I think someone in chat was just asking if there have been any big pots. Well, I think hand number one hundred six might be one. I would say so. They showed up at the right time. 1600 to go for Poker Lion. Salim's only got 6500 to start uh, to go into the flop. He just calls. One of the great things about this game is how simple it is. You're adding like crazy complicated rules that people will forget. But yeah, it's good. I bet 16. Wow. Offsuit 5 on the turn. Let's see if Poker Lion continues betting or if he decides to get sneaky. Yeah, it wouldn't be unreasonable. Maybe let. Some of Salim's floats catch up. Not this one, though. It's doesn't want like to see the, the river. Like all these rules because you're like the number one candidate to sleep on them. <laughs> <laughs> I love all these it's Pierre less than one. Forget them. He goes for the small bets. Why, you know, it takes a yeah, 2200. <laughs> this is a really great size to challenge Salim's flush draws, too, because now Salim either has to <laughs> call with a flush draw, not really getting the proper odds. He actually goes or all jam. in, it looks like. Quick call jam and from a Poker Lion. Nap. And we are going to see a run out. $16,000 pot. Wow, one time does not get there. And that's the biggest pot of the night. $16,000 heading Poker Lion's way. Well played by him there. Fades the flush draw. Not always easy to do. Sometimes it feels like you can never avoid that third flush card. Poker Lion does hold up this time, though. In fact, one of Sleem's outs was dead. The seven of diamonds was not live, not, nor was the five. 
And that's the nit game right there. The nit game's not on. There aren't as many straddles. If the nit game's not on, Salim might not feel compelled to go all in with that flush draw on the turn. It just creates so much action, especially later in the night, and that's why we love playing it here at the Lodge. Such a great variant. Spices up the game. And it brings the pain, for sure. And it's the last fold. Okay. So if there's three people in the hand, it will not work. Only the test. No, the last guy. The last guy. The last person to fold. Yes. But you know what I mean, then? Like going mm -hmm. all in and having to show it. Because uh, yeah, yeah. No. some people would just make... I don't like, know, big bluff and Let me talk to them. Yeah. I've definitely they, thought, so, like, oh, yeah, I get to so see now this. So only yeah, I, I don't river, think it's great for action, but... And, and this, the, the people see it anyway because I was on the, the reader. Yeah, that's a good point. I, I, yeah. I don't know... So I don't know the reason yeah, we do so it. I'm sure there is five, one. Yeah, I just eight, don't know five, it. Five, but I can talk I mean, with it the. Definitely. Yeah, there's like let's say like some action oh, player want to show like five and then they're like I don't want to show this. Oh, 5200 total. 5, yeah. I mean it, 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 it's happened before. Is I mean it's it definitely up. better for the shot we have a to have the cards here, cards here, and then see the board. Because then you can see everything within that. You don't have to go back and forth the bottom left. You can see the the hands. Yeah. So it's definitely, it's only better for the shot, but I don't, I don't, I'll say that, I'm not totally sure. I would make an argument that it's worse for action, which is kind of what you guys want. You guys want more action. You also have a show, you want a good production. Yeah, I don't know, yeah. It's, yeah. I don't, it's well, I don't mean, know. Well, I mean, if you want to, if you want to ship 10-5 yeah. suited, it's kind of cool to have it, you know. Beyond. I think I, if I do, I would like to show it, but I'm sure there's people that don't want to show their hands. I mean, like, I was proud yeah. that I trapped him. I had 10-9. <laughs> Trapped him. I love that. That's like they don't do it at the. <laughs> Still calling it the trap. Yeah. I like the location. I just I knew. I knew. Raise. Yeah. I mean, I'll look into it. Yeah. Yeah. I'm I'm just just a thought. No. I and, and I I think I I think I overall agree with you. Yeah. But I want to understand. Why, why they do it? Before like I, I say <laughs> one way or the other, I, I want to understand fully why. And yeah. Then we can. I feel like we're reinventing the game here tonight. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Rules, he's showing rules, yeah. making history. <laughs> I guess you could also make it like optional, but encouraged. And, nah, I don't want to show. Must yeah. Be I mean, I know You're for sure. Talking about like, showing on all ends. He was yeah. he was saying Flip that like down. yeah like our rule is if you go all in into one college, you have to put your cards up. Mm. He was saying he thinks it would be better for the game if you don't. Mm. Better for the action. Yeah, better uh, and I agree. Action, yeah. Yeah, action yeah. game, whatever you want. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It, yeah well, because I'm the streamers from the viewer, it may not look as The good. streamers already yeah. know. Yeah. yeah. Streamers know mm -hmm. the hand, but I, but there is something nice about showing the two hands right here and then yeah. seeing it all. It, like, it's a pretty yeah. shot to show the hands. Yeah. yeah. We've been watching the World Series of Poker for 30 years doing that or whatever. Yeah. So it's just it's just it's cool to watch the the hands come out like that. But I agree. But it, mm -hmm. I've definitely been like, oh, I get to see it anyway. Are you watching the movie for 30 years? Yeah. Can't you? Yeah. Or, I mean, wow. Like, how, yeah, how long has it been there? It was there. Got two pair of two pair here. here. Cupcake doing the betting. How old are you? Old are you? Shots from like 37, so Feel six so deuce. One, Sneakiest of two pairs. He's got one as well. No, no, no. You might be thinking about going for value here. For something that like is already kind of set for a long time. And there it is. He's gonna rip it all in. Gonna go ahead and go for it. Not afraid. Of Ace X two pair. Well, oh, that's either a really shitty river or I'm just saying a miracle well, river. It's kind of cool to, to see it play yeah. out like that. Cupcake feeling the so pain on this one. Lose. I gotta find out. Makes the call. And E oh, getting the absolute max out of Cupcake Carlos with that Deuce River. Very unlucky for the Cupcake. What were you saying about the Nick game generates action? Is that what it does? Yeah, We're no seeing kidding. Queen eight off, six deuce suited, oh, two nice. pair over two pair, the Texas two pair. Wow. Yeah, nice hand for E there. Definitely. Picks up a nice size pot. Definitely so. And he gets rid of his nib button. Terrible yeah, Can I get another rock or Doug, can I borrow that rock? How much you got now? Um, Can I get a five k chip? We have a twenty-five dollar chip. Just three. Three. You can sell me some of that green once you take whatever you. That's what it sounds like. You can just swap it out. Uh, I mean, I assume you want your five k chip back. Just. No, I mean, you, you can literally just leave the. I don't oh, care. Okay. The denominations are very irrelevant to me. 
Sounds like it was like, yeah, super good for me. What do we got? $25? Well, what you, do you, you got a smaller two pair? Yeah. Five ways to the flop after Salim raises to 75. Yeah. Ace high flop, but no one's got an ace. And you were like, that was a miracle, bro. I was like, you should have Doug has the best of it with a four. Yeah, kind of a jump ball. Anyone can win this with a bet f more than likely. Although Tito takes a stab on the river and Doug's going to be closing the action. So maybe Doug Gotta can find a hero call. Okay. There it is. He does. He does. <laughs> wow. And it is good. Yeah. I, I, thought, I, was like, I had to win that four. I was like, the guy's like, I win every time. I'm the first out. I win every time. And the river is like, is that oh, yeah, I got the straight. I got the straight. Yeah. I'm like, all right. You got the straight. You got the straight, man. I got, I, you got a. Not, not that bad. You're going you're gonna, to yeah, yeah, have to see it. That's your ace. That is a very fair uh, <laughs> you're under the going all desire. Are you going to give me a stack of green, please? Of course. Yeah, I can definitely say I did not think that you had something and a deuce for your two So, like, yeah, I would have got God if I had ace king for sure. The 500s look oh. you river too small now. Yeah, so it's that, small. That's why it's a yeah. 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 They do. But I don't bet that way. Yeah, I don't call that way. That's the big shift. The only downside yeah. is the 500s now all of a sudden seem seem like strangely weak. It's weird deuce. So better, better store value. Yeah, it, it looks like a brick, I would say. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Great yeah, yeah. hand for Pierre to like, pick up. Safeway in the brick territory. Then the game ace queen suited. Big ball. Doug. You shouldn't be in the hand because you are in the hand. I'm in there. Is in there <coughs> from the small blind so seven uh, five suited. Oh, there's a lot of dead money in this pot. They are deep. But Tito and Llama, or excuse me, just Tito. <laughs> gonna defend his big blind. We're taking this three ways. Pierre, well in the lead, still maintains it. Top pair for both Tito and Pierre. Doug. Second with some back doors. Off suit 10 on the turn. <coughs> oh, and looks like Tito is going to be doing the betting. Pierre, could we thinking about a raise here? Yeah, I mean, if I was in Pierre's shoes, I would be very tempted to raise this spot. A lot of draws on the board. We know Tito does like to play pretty wide hand, a oh, pretty wide range of hands preflop, so he can have these like random queens more often than most people would. And those things should push Pierre towards a raise. It looks like he's gonna make it small, just a thousand. So it's not much more for Tito to call. Yeah, I like that size given Pierre's remaining stack. Yeah, really sharp size. Should Tito call, the pot's going to be about 2,700. Pierre has 2,600 behind. So he's going to get to go all in on the river should Tito call. I was like binge the day after die and I was just sick. And wow, Tito. Tito's just going to lay it down. Yeah, nice fold. Pierre shows top top, says he hates to show this one. Be proud of your top pair, Pierre. <laughs> Not calling yet. It's fun for me. It's <laughs> good fold though, because if he had nine high, he's doing nine it again. So that's what I was kind of. I, was kinda <laughs> I got a nine ten. Oh, nine ten. Uh, nine ten. No, no, no. Yeah, if you, if you, if you, if you if was like, well, I was thinking nine high. Yeah, if you like, had like, if you had like eight high right eight, there, eight, you're eight, blasting eight, nine again. Nine hearts or something. Yeah. yeah so yeah, like, you have to know that you're calling. You're like, man, I can't fold river because then I get a fucking button sometimes. I had a shit. That's true. Sometimes you fold turn, it changes the game. Yeah. Uh, that's yeah, the, that's the line, cool, man. Cool you gotta fold. Uh, yeah. uh, I was yeah, gonna fold that. Right right now. Am I the first guy to fold this block? Still have like two thirds. No, one third. I figured out a way to make <laughs> the stream go longer <laughs> too. Slow down here. Just do the Nick game right at the end. <laughs> Otherwise, yeah. yeah. I don't know what happened. <laughs> Wait, what's going on? They love that. Yeah. yeah. Uh, 
All right. I call. You gotta finish the story, you know. So there wasn't much else to the story. <laughs> no, no, no. no so we're going four ways to this <laughs> flop. <laughs> wow, that was great. Check. These days. Pierre flops Jin. Two, three, four. Great results. So oh, wow. So wow, look at no, that. Tito turning average. tricks Excuse you. with the redraw to a chop. Yeah, and Tito's still got his knit button, so yeah. he's going to be the, the new, very new unlikely to fold this hand. Pretty burned out in the back. Yeah. yeah. This could get pretty expensive for the five seat. Indeed, just a call. Okay. Pretty standard seven. Doesn't change much, though. Five six is now... The better straight. Yeah. Is it 630 right now? It's 640. Let's see what size Pierre decides to come with here. I keep wanting to look. Pretty much any bet he makes will get called. Like Looks like he's reaching for about 900. Well, yeah, great size. Not a board you can overbet on, I don't think. I could be wrong about that, but Tito going to make a quick call. Oh, my God. Damn. Pierre getting the max. From Tito, and that is very sick indeed. Lose a thousand, try not to lose 350. <laughs> <laughs> that's that's the Nick game, folks. Risk it all not to lose $350. Yeah, Pierre doesn't great was in there. Be like, there's no way. He's trying to give me a button. This is bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> that was sick. Not like their buttons last week or whatever, but slightly bigger on Saturday's thing. We've been doing slightly bigger on Saturdays for a little bit. Yeah. Uh, I haven't looked. Can I straddle? Yeah, yeah, I think I'm usually playing, so I'm just like, I can't watch half the time. <clears throat> Oops, sorry. <clears throat> Three raises. That, that, that's what you like you to tell money. the owner. Yeah, I don't want to. <laughs> <laughs> it's one of two things. I'm either playing or the wife says I have to hang out with her, so. Oh, brutal. Right. I know, there's the no in between. <laughs> What's it, 100? 100. Seven calls, eight calls. We're playing. Here we go. At least all these hands are suited this time. There's just so much contact. Good flop for Pierre and Celine, second pair. You know, if I'm at home, I'll with anything else, really. I'm not going to be actively watching like 10 hours of 15 hours of streams. What are you eating, Doug? Asparagus, a little zucchini, some rice, and then like a curry spice thing. Solid. Cup is gonna make a move here. Wow. Grass Raising it up to eight hundred with the bottom pair. Grass fed? That should work. You know, it's gonna be grass fed. If, if it's available, but like I don't know. I feel I'm like Salim's gonna like get the, sticky. The calories and oh, it should work. <laughs> I think a lot of the trendy stuff is But Salim does not look wrong, like he's in the mood to fold. Arguing in favor of fact of I believe <clears> both he and, and Carlos still have a nip button. Jam so I can go home. You gotta, you gotta talk to the food people and make those. That's no, not the face of a yeah, believer. Be so great. Yeah, he looks <laughs> almost mad. Yeah. He's like, he looks like a bull, he looks like a bulldog how, right now. How dare you raise me when I have second pair? No, if you guys have that here, I mean. Oh, healthier yeah. food, basically. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. Like, like if, if your person could just bring a price tag meal. of like twenty dollars on, I'd be like, oh, yeah. <clears> there's zero healthy day, options. Light it up. That's... Sorry. One thing at a time, you know? Yeah, you got it. Got a new stream room? Yeah. <laughs> got a new bathroom? Yeah, dude. I, I am dude. Wow, Salim does fold, yeah. and Carlos gonna get it done. That's with six the side. six oh, deuce, no, man. No, 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 no. Yeah, yeah. Oh, oh, oh pair. Never mind. Don't get so excited. So I didn't want to so lose excited. the six deuce with six deuce twice. <laughs> yeah, by the way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. For sure. <laughs> that is right. He did get stacked by E when he had six deuce. Have you ever you're good? Yeah, I bought it. I thought it was believable. I wouldn't believe him. Wait, I still think it was a value, value but... Is button be on six or what button? Oh, uh, I thought it was a 25. No, you... What was going to do that to you? It was an yeah. insta call, but I wasn't strong enough to do the fucking river bet. Yeah, yeah. Button Thanks. should be on Jake. Because yeah, yeah. you analyze stuff yeah. too much. No, that's Doug. That's Doug. You analyze... That's you too. You analyze the fuck out of the hand and realize I had nothing. I mean, like, 93% lane deep, and he's trying to lay with 9 year old deep. Yeah. Balance. God damn it, I knew it. Figured out that I was That's true. Did, did Cupcake yeah, end up finishing his seven beers? <laughs> I heard that was going on. There's that. Like, oh, I don't know. <laughs> I, I know he was at a high number very quickly. I mean, I also, I also yes. I'm going to say yes. 
based on his pacing. Yeah. But I was oh. mostly full of shit. I'd hope so. Wow, here we go. Doug. Yeah, I'm right, so. Two kings. <laughs> I'm doing a min raise each. I, I mean, I thought you were like Pretty good 100. hand. Yeah, $25 straddle is on here. Tito calls the $125 raise. Yeah, was it going to be Turner River? Cupcake initially just called the 25. Now Pierre's going to put in a re-raise. That is music to Doug's ears. Oh, what do you think I was talking about? That, yeah. I don't even that, think no, no, no. I, I Pierre doesn't even have a nip on him. He's just getting yeah. after it. He, he saw yeah, that Doug doesn't either. Later, he's like, oh, four deep. Yeah, I mean, yeah. Queen Ten suited, facing a raise. You can't just call in the small blind if you're trying to play proper poker, quote unquote. So he's gonna three bet. Makes sense. Now Salim, who does have a nip button in front of him, has got to be tempted to play this ace jack offsuit honestly it wouldn't even be crazy for him to do something yeah, like I, shove all in with it i was about to say if he's gonna four bet i think the only size that really makes the most sense is just a jam it would be a little bit ambitious i think but we'll see what he decides to do obviously his timing would be terrible with doug happen happening to have kings he does look tempted Probably thinking over the same things you and I are. Hands on big chips. Does put in a four bet, not all in. Yeah, 2,500. It's over half his stack. Maybe with intentions of folding to a jam. Trying to save a little bit. Oof, that would be a big mistake. Now Dougie P chewing on that 93% beef. Two kings trying to decide what to do, but I think we all know he already knows what is. he's doing. He's going all in. Yeah, a little Hollywood from the, from Mr. Polk. And now Salim's kind of committed. I mean, he only has to call 2,200 more right. to win a roughly 10K there, pot. And there's the call. He does call. That's nice. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, 10.4K in the middle. Let's see how this one runs out. For now, show, but we'll, we'll talk to our fucking people. All right. Once or twice. We're going twice, but only the first board is good for the nick game. So if Salim wins the first board, he will get rid of his nip button. Who you rooting for? No ace on the flop. I wanted to win the six. Four for a sweat. He's rooting against you, and he has a nip. Seven, no help either. What kind of friendship is that? So Doug holds on that one. Salim will be holding on to his nip button. Okay, okay. Now let's see who wins that extra $5,200. Wow. And that's going to be Doug. That was cool. <laughs> yeah, I think, uh, I think Doug's going to win that one. Yay! No. Wow. No. Yes. No. One time. No. This would be good for content. Do not do this. Sure do not do this. Oh, oh, oh man. It rhymes. <laughs> not the time you want to see the A. That is unfortunate, but Doug is going to scoop himself a nice... Ten and a half thousand dollar pots. Salim still <laughs> holding on to his nip God. button. That would have been four uh, K. All right, we're at now four K proceeding. Just got. You know, I have I have ten percent of Doug, so like in theory, I want him to win that. <laughs> but if that last eight came on the river, oh, it would have been the, the greatest. It's too good. I I still wish it happened. <laughs> still wish it happened. That would have been too juicy. Definitely would have uh, been a highlight clip. I'm gonna have that my I think it still might be. I think so. I'll sit down with you one day. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> I think this is two. Give or take. Hopefully. Close enough. If it's not, someone let me know. Do the work you know, for me. You know? yeah. Salim looks like he wants to get yeah, feisty yet that. again. I was like, I looked over and I was like, oh, the food's behind him. He means business. I think he's ready. I see. But I was thinking he thinks again. Yeah. Okay. He's Good thing. Spot I'm ready for three nip. All right. <laughs> Did you get called? You're all in. No, that's my four. He's just gonna call. And look at this poker lion ace jack. No nip button. But certainly a nice spot to squeeze. I'm like That's what he's going to do. Sure. He re-raises to 400. No These big offsuit aces, they don't play that well multi-way. 
There's no way I'm on the But they play really well heads up, so it makes sense to squeeze them. Poker Line does that, and it gets through. It's a nice result for him. One more quick reminder about the Spring Madness 100K Guarantee Tournament. This was just announced this week. We've ran a similar tournament, basically the exact same structure, two times. Huge success. March 31st through April 2nd, there's four day one flights, just a $300 buy-in, and you get to play for what's probably going to be a nearly quarter million dollar prize pool. The last two times we've ran that tournament, it's gotten to around a quarter million. So that 100K guarantee, you know, it's there, but expect it to be bigger. Yeah, first place has always been like 70K plus for a $300 buy-in tournament. That's insane. Pretty sick. That is, that is pretty sick. The sickest tournaments here at the Lodge as Celine picks up Queen Jack. Going to 3-bet his button. Very, very reasonable. We got Poker Traveler in the chat. And as we saw a moment ago, he's in the building. Seti, the man. Could have got you in the game, man. Where were you? Oh, whoa. whoa, whoa, party foul here, party foul here, boys. Give him a nip button back. <laughs> Give him the nip button back, I love that. <laughs> wow, Cupcake Carlos cold called. <laughs> what? What a, what a flop. The game with Robbie and Perkins. The table is just out of control. Everyone's drunk. Ben, ben Lamb oh, and, and Jungle are stuck huge. Like it's the, so like the, so the good players are really stuck. And then Ro Robbie's doing stuff like this one hand she flipped over her cards and had to go like this. She's playing a hand, her card is face up. And she's like <laughs> trying to block what it is. Okay. Perkins is yelling about like, I saw your card. Like I can't call the 2K. It goes on for 17 minutes. Jungle's just like, he's like, <clears throat> oh my, he's like tilting yeah, his face totally off. Yeah. It's like, can you imagine being stuck like 200K in this game? And you're like, a player has a card face up and someone else is just like yelling about they can see cards and like, yeah, you're just sitting there stewing. Bill's just playing a hand blind brutal. while he's pouring wine. Oh, that was great. The blind hand was, I saw that, that was amazing. Glorious. He checked Ray's call of the flop, yeah. right? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> How much Standard. Let's see if Cupcake, Cupcake decides to make a move here. He did call the turn. Kind of feels like he has plans. Yeah, this 10. He represents it decently well, right? But Salim just has too good of a hand, I think. I, I, yeah, he blocking the straights. Top pair. Cupcake didn't. Honestly, a, a 10 might even check raise some of the time. So, yeah, I mean, while we're talking about blockers, having a jack like Salim does, Cupcake is a little bit less likely to have jack 10. It's one of the more, like, common 10s that someone would have. So I think Salim's just got to call this. And if the guy has a 10, you know, you're paying him off. But then again, I'm not stuck a bunch wow. like Salim is, so <laughs> yeah. you never know. Yeah, he was trying to represent a 10, as he says. There but it is. No, no dice. It's tough. You were trying to get I'm not trying to get any just running into too strong of a hand there. Queen Jack just can't be folding. This is my opinion. First that size and that run out. Thanks. It is. Just trying to represent Ace 10. As we get a check in on the cumulative winnings, Dougie P has fought back. He's now down just 840. Cupcake and Salim are throwing the party down about 11,000 combined. Poker line, the big winner today, 12,700. Pierre and E also winning a couple grand each. Poker line just sucking up all the money, man. Yeah, he's had a good session. He was, I think he was down, right? Uh, he was down like, uh, I think so, right he was the big right loser the for the first like two hours. So yeah. nice comeback from him. Going from minus 20, uh, 250 big blinds to plus 1,200 big blinds. So yeah. that said, it's Texas. It is Texas. I mean, the, that's, that's a normal swing. That's an average, like, you know, Friday night. Exactly. And when people are She's double and up. triple straddling every yeah. third hand, I mean, uh, 10 big blinds is not so like, much. Kind of no. We're just, like, making crazy emotional decisions. Like, well, there's, there's... One thing I, I very much respect about Robbie is that she can completely compartmentalize sort of the game that's happening in terms of, like, the story and everything that's going on, like, me doing a video and people talking about it mm -hmm. versus, like, the people, right? Like... I obviously covered it, and I was very aggressive in saying I thought that she cheated. Yep. But like when we talked, and she wasn't like I like you're a dick. I hate Doug. Whatever. She was just like I'm not. I'm innocent. Here's why. And even though I was like I really don't believe some of the stuff you're saying, she, she was like, okay, it's cool. all in the game. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, that's good. So she she like did she like wore it on her sleeve sort of. Yeah. Even though yeah. obviously we're coming from different stances or whatever. Yep. 
and so much so that she was willing to come out here. So <coughs> yeah, I, I respect that a lot. Yeah, yeah that's not easy. Yeah. yeah. Although she did put me on the hot seat over there. That's all. That was great. Okay. Yeah, for you. <laughs> <laughs> It's all about perspective. So are you going to apologize to my fans for saying I cheated? And I'm like, oh, man, this is going to be. I think you just have to, like, double down. It's like, nope. Well, if, if there's a, if I, I get invited to a Robbie game and there's a 30% chance she's cheating in that game, I'll still go play. <laughs> <laughs> I'm fucking taking my chance. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I love Dude, that. No see. chill period. Brutal. <laughs> yeah. I saw some stuff that people were like, oh, if you think she cheated, isn't it hypocritical to have her here? But the thing is, we, we run a fair game here. Like, I right, know right. this is a fair game. It's like, yeah, it's not like so, you're playing a hustler or something, a her game. Sorry. Yeah, like, I, I know what's happening here. Give him a bug. Yeah. Oh, wow. So wow. Hey, hi. What's up? That's it. Oh, you're going to bug. That's, oh, that's oh, he gets the other nip button. Oh. Llama <laughs> had eight high. <laughs> Oh, it was worth it. It was worth it. Carlos now with yeah. two nip buttons. And what what a situation for Pierre? Or was it Pierre? One other person has a nip button. Yeah, that's a great result. And then Llama won the pot, but the nip game is not over because now it transfers to Car uh, to Cupcake. Yep. I almost said Cupcake Carlos because that's another player on our stream, right? Yeah. <laughs> that's funny. They would look at you well, that is Cupcake Carlos. Yeah, oh, his name is Carlos? That, yeah, that's Carlos. Oh, my mistake. Yeah, no, yeah. He's really been owning it. He got that nickname because of the way he ate a cupcake once. And then now he just brings cupcakes. He's wearing a cupcake shirt. He's got a cupcake branded hat. How did he eat the cupcake? I don't remember exactly, but it was it was odd. <laughs> it, was, it was odd to say the least, and he was getting a lot of uh, comments in the chat, both positive and negative. Um, Can we get some guesses in the chat to how this guy must have been eating a cupcake? <laughs> An unusual way to eat a cupcake that would get you the nickname Cupcake. I want to hear the chat's theories on how someone would get that nickname. He might have just like housed the whole thing at once. I don't remember, but it was it was noteworthy at the very least. But he's you know been a great sport about it and he's owning it. Yeah, I love it. Tito, 7-2 off. He's going to go for it here. He bets the flop. Doug with top pair, though. Cupcake seems like he wants to maybe continue. He does have two knit buttons. Does he have two? No, I think he just has one. Oh, does he just he, have one? He, he was out of the knit game. Oh, and now right. He's now, back he has, in. Uh, now he has the button. Just again, when I, I think I'm out, they pull me back in. Pull me in. back in, baby. Yeah. Look at this. Tito picks up a pair. A lot of equity. Flush draw as well. Lots of greens. Well, at least Doug can't get a knit button now. Right. <laughs> that is true, yeah. Because Tito's picked up a pair. She was so pissed at you. Yeah. You, you know what I'm talking about? Yeah. Doug check calls. It was the last hand that you gave the guy a walk. It was Doug. Oh, it was Doug. Yeah, Doug, Doug opened, and I was just like, I have literally... I don't think Tito's going to slow yeah. down. Like, I'm, no, I, I yeah. see what you do. Board getting scarier and scarier for yeah, a king, you, though. I think Doug is going to pay this one. I think it was like Rather, person or 50 a person. call correctly. I'm really gonna pull this is my surprise on my yeah. <laughs> Is there even a way to have nine high? Like nine, so I, I I can't risk it. I, got, I can't risk it. <laughs> I'm gonna have to pay off. Actually, the two fucked me up because I made a pair. I was trying to yeah. Pair high. I was about to say that Tito was actually yeah. probably not yeah. happy to see that yeah. pair. Yeah, that's good. Defense. God damn it. <laughs> card. Still alive, still alive. If the six hit higher when there's only two nit buttons left. The, yeah. the, 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 back the, the nine high thing actually really, really changes the river. It, that's, yeah. it, it makes a big difference. Because now if I fold and I lose, now I'm in the If I fold and he's bluffing, now I'm in the nit game and I'm yeah. heads up. When, when <laughs> I hit a pair of twos, that hand got way less fun. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> This is low key yeah, it's funny. the best thing we ever done for this. It's, it's for pretty exciting. For this poker room. Earlier, Doug and I were saying, what are the odds that Tito loses a knit game today? When he was three and when he was three and zero oh and had been the first out every time. Wow. And now he's heads up for this last one. So, yeah, we were right to not actually make that bet. I guess. Talk about, but it actually happened. Yeah. yeah. We're like, oh, never going to happen. Right. Never twice. Happen. Yeah. Twice. Right. No, one time so far. One, one time. Yeah. One time during the Nick game. Well, but I mean, he, he, no, he had to do it. He had to do it. But, but like it existed. Yeah, there was a, there was a chance. We go some we suited kings. Wow, Cupcake yeah. Carlos not wanting to lose. Goes, I hope so, actually, because I just got a thousand. The nit game. The way he dropped those 25 oh, yeah. chips into the pot. It's like, you know what? We're burning these or I'm getting rid of this button. <laughs> I am not losing the nit game. Yeah. All right. That's a big pot. Yeah.
Side. And Tito loses the knit game, it looks like. Oh, no, Tito no, called. He called with the deuces, yeah. He folded. He's like, you know what? I don't have a button. You guys have fun. Okay, so the winner of this pot fades oh. losing the knit game. And Tito flops a set versus an open ender. Oh, wow. This could actually get pretty juicy. The money's in. It's all in a call. All in quick, instantly quick and a snap. All in. Quick all in and a call. Wow. Nice. Let's listen in. That's it. Yeah. An eight for nine. It's eight ounce. Wow. Yeah, it's one time. One time? That's still good. Do another one of those. But like... <sighs> wow, and Cupcake Carlos uh, does not improve. Wow. Tito! Swapping a set. That's a reasonable time for a set. It really was helpful there. <laughs> I'd say that's, so. That's a, that, that's, a life, get, that's a life support set right there. You guys are thinking he's going to do this with whatever. So you, hitting the set is pretty, You jumped off the good. Titanic, and, and, and you were in the water, and it looked bad, but then a boat just like rushed over. But, and like, you, but like, like a yacht. Like a nice yacht. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Not even just a regular yacht. A luxury like a yacht. yacht. Exactly, yeah. Like... In, in 1920. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> where, where, where was the Titanic? Just got back from a model. 1920. Oh, wow. Okay. 1970. Oh, yeah. What am I talking about? All right. I'll get you guys. 1917. Um, it's a great year. Great year. What a great result for Tito. Over, and an unfortunate one for yeah. Cupcake for, over there. For Carlos. Yeah, he's. Uh, that's a rough way to lose. The Nick game gets bluffed by eight high. Oh, are you coming back and in? then two hands later, yeah, stacked okay. and yeah, loses the right, we'll, we'll find out. What a, what a, the next episode. What a rough We're game, man. Exactly. Salt in the wound for sure. Right, I'm 50 behind. Okay. Gotta love the big <laughs> game. <laughs> oh, I hear it. I see what you're doing. Yeah. Right. <laughs> ah, <laughs> you're little jokes there over there. Good. Uh, $25 straddle action. Twenty-five dollars straddle crazy. is on. We're playing five ten twenty-five. The sand. If it's fifty only. I mean, I've been playing like complete jackass for that. like an hour because of this three fifty to lose. So like, it's, <laughs> it definitely affects quite a bit. You legitimately have to go out there and fight for it. There's no other. Yeah, you got to You got to do it. If you don't, Sorry. you're just gonna eat it at least. So you know this uh, this nine or lower bit. It actually. If you've already given your knit button away, it actually you're still involved. Well, right? but it's interesting to like fold a well, little bit. Well, no, because you can get until can, it's over. You can get two knit buttons. So you're not yeah. stuck in yeah. it. Yeah. It doesn't matter. No, no, but just under the yeah. pot is my point, right? Did, so you, did you did you tip Llama for getting him back I in? I did. I did. <laughs> Yeah, not, it's like definitely weird on you, the turn. You got oh, his no, knit button now back in, or yeah, otherwise yeah. he would have been like out. Risk being oh, left yeah. on the river, so I like have to commit yeah, myself. I, I'm gonna be honest. I actually yeah. forgot in the hand what was going on. Yeah. And I was like, oh, the new game's over. And I was like, wait a minute, <laughs> eight. Yeah, so I was like, when you, when you did it, I was like, oh, that's all right. Wait a minute. Then like yeah, in hindsight, like, you can play too. I guess. I don't know why he showed you the ace before you had your action too, right? Yeah, that confused me. Please bluff me. I was like, I was like, I didn't want to say that. I was like, it was on Jake, right? And he just turns the card over, and I was like. That was bizarre. I was delivering like a small, medium, large. Which does a like pair of juice doesn't win that. I was hand, leaning right? large, and then he showed the ace. I was like, oh, I'm gonna go spell one. Yeah. <laughs> good. I'm sorry. That's, a, yeah, That's that weird. Was... I think most people, when they see the ace, they would go big. Oh. Like, oh, we can't be that strong. I'm just gonna blast. But oh, you, you viewed it the other way. Shows the ace, so most people blast. So if I bet small, it's like I want to call. Well, maybe yeah. it's polarized. I was either gonna go kind of small or just huge, right? Because now that I saw the ace. Yeah. But I got small, it's kind of, it's like, oh, he's trying to milk me, you know? I mean, if you jammed, it could have been one of the most epic hands in the stream. You're like, is that an ace? I'm all in. <laughs> <laughs> he's like, oh, then yeah. it has to be a bluff. Like, look at it, and then, like, look it was the like board. the worst ace, too, because it was the, the flush draw that missed. Yeah. <laughs> like, don't show up that. Yeah, it was every, everything that was just perfect. Because mm. I was like, I'm going to bet big and be like, oh, I could have I could have backdoored a straight with it. And they showed the ace, so I was like, well, I'm not going to rep that. Yep. <laughs> if I lose, I lose. I'm like, let me just rep like a random pair trying to get paid off by ace high. <laughs> it's such a swing when you're like in that situation. You're like, you get to get rid of your button and give it to him. Like, that's... Yeah, I really I like, like that the, variation. That's oh, that's fun. Good. We've seen how, well, how no. dirty it can let's, play let's out as well. Oh, king. oh yeah, oh. missed deal. Missed deal. <laughs> Love kings. <laughs> missed deal alert. Wii U, Wii U, Wii U. The two quad draws. Or I'm at, I'm at none. While we're waiting for the next shuffle, I got a quick question for chat. 
Who is your favorite well, poker player? Sure. Wrong answers only. Well, Who is your favorite poker player, but you, you must say like the wrong yeah, answer? Wrong answers only, yeah. I want to see this. No, no, I know, but before Wait, that. This is him? Yeah. Okay. He, he waits till we're not in the knit game anymore. I don't understand the short stacking. It just, it, it, it just seems unbecoming. Yeah, Phil. I don't know. I just like playing different stacks. Why are you guys <laughs> stack shaming Llama? Stop stack shaming. Yeah. I mean, I guess to be fair, I've seen how he plays deep, so I could. I'm, I'm, trying to, I'm, trying to, I'm trying to mitigate my loss. You're like, oh, never mind. I, I was trying to short stack. Oh, I see how it is. When he roots for an ace versus my kings, it's all fun and games. But if I, if I needle him about his deep <laughs> stack game, <laughs> that's so that's how kind of, dare that's you? That's kind of over the line. Because <laughs> losing players can make fun of winning players. The opposite, you're punching down. Yeah, and he's in your home. Punching down. He's not partner here. <laughs> Good point. Should I retract my statement? <laughs> Muck. Did you say check I did. Okay. Yeah. Well, Doug with Ace King does not touch the flop. Bad, Tito V pipping, even though the nick game's nice. over. It's unbecoming. <laughs> That's why I reload. Llama with a <laughs> He's like, All right, very nice hand for the board. Tito's been, uh, uh, he hasn't needed the nick game to play hands like this today. <laughs> that is, yeah. That, that is uh, that is fair. <laughs> Doug gets out of the way with the ace king and llama. According to our graphic, wins four thousand dollars. That is incorrect. He picks up the pot though. I'm sure he's happy about that. Yes, indeed. Should wait for him to Yeah, we'll wait until he comes back. The moment he comes in the door. We're doing it again. Talking about doing another Nick game the second Carlos gets back. He's gonna agree. He's too stuck not to agree. Should we go to 10 high? No. It's too comfortable. Guess what? Let's see, at least one more rule and then do it. Go. Race. Come here. Let's get in there. Pierre. On the button, gonna raise up. The suited version of Tito's hand, but he's choosing the wrong time. Salim. Don't reinvent the wheel. Two kings. And Salim has not really been running well today. No, he is not. I think if you it's kind of nice that he picks up this spot. Pierre's in position versus this three bet. I think he's pretty likely to peel. A little extra pressure to call. See three cards. Yeah, no, I, I, I like that. It's like impossible to figure out. But so whenever you sweat, if you see something in front of you, you're like, they should absolutely fold. You still never want to influence anything because you're you're the, you're the sweater. Like if they choose to keep going, then but like but like part of you is like. I hope they don't just go ballistic here. Wow. Because I'm and then once in a while you're sweating, and then you're like, oh shit, he's making a stand. <laughs> <laughs> now I'm just in the he car. He has the king of hearts, king of clubs, <laughs> and you get the <laughs> ace <laughs> seven five. I didn't just, no, no, All spades. Yeah. Wow, he's still betting anyway. <laughs> Yeah, I think this is a reasonable spot to still bet. I think the size is a little bit too big, but splitting hairs at that point. Yeah, I guess three bet, three bet versus button call. Certainly out of position. Yeah, monotone board, you're going to want to be betting less than most boards, but I think you still find a small bet with kings. In any case, he does get called. Pierre with ace, six, and the best hand. This bet I don't fully understand from Salim. He's betting 500 into 1,200. I don't think this accomplishes too much. You're going to mostly get called by better hands. Yeah, there's less equity to deny on the turn here, though the five is effectively a break. I mean, maybe you get like like eights with the eight of spades to fold. Right. So you deny like a little bit of equity, but for the most part, yeah, there's not too much. That you're really worried about most hands that have you beat, have you crushed, most hands that you beat, you crush. Exactly. And, and now he's going for a $1,300 bet, $1,500 bet. Wow, I guess razor thin against a queen? Interesting spot. I mean, I don't think Pierre can fold this. He's definitely considering folding, but I, I don't think he's going to let it go. We'll see. Yeah, this might be a side call. Classic side call spot for sure. You'll get the click, but they won't understand the full... Like complexity, people why that, it's so wide. People that get poker yeah. will love that. But yep. then super casually, but like jack time. Not even aces. Yeah. Not even a set. It's not, yeah. Cool. Wow, and there's the call. Everyone that watches that clip. Salim's not loving seeing that. For a trip to Austin. 100%. Shows the kings they are no good, Pierre. I'll sell you the clip for a shout out. Drags a nice <laughs> 5K pot. Can't win with the kings either, huh? 
<laughs> Doug with the needle. Yeah, three, or, three or four times that team's as well. Mine, mine actually helped. Yours helped. Twice. Someone for the record. Twice. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Look, two full boards for the record. Yeah. Yeah. Against <laughs> Salim, if I, if yeah. I recall. The second, the second one was even though. 25. <laughs> The running ace would have been epic. That would have been epic. <laughs> would have been nice. He said it, and I was like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Incredible. Yeah, yeah. Five tall, six tall. Seventy-five. He raises seventy-five. One ball. Got him, Bobby. I'm going to play in the net game. Oh, we got some raggedy hands. Nobody connects. Yeah, a bunch of those offsuit gappers we have going here. Hello. Yeah, the old five well, we to a... seven Hello. gappers. Offsuit five to eight gappers. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> How you doing? Because let me let me bust this ornament real quick. Celine takes it down. Shows more heart than the others. Hey, buddy. Hey, Sandy. Good to see you, man. If, you'd, if you've enjoyed the show today and you aren't already, please subscribe to the channel. It's free for you. It means everything to us. And it means you'll get notified when we go live and when we post great highlight clips, which we post regularly. So please hit that button. Hit the like button, too, while you're at it. And if you're watching this in the future, please leave a comment. Let us know what you think of the show. First it came from my bicycle playing cards, and I said nothing. You know, I was, right? <laughs> <laughs> I was not a bicycle. And the next thing you know, he's giving his cards away. <laughs> yep, that's it. Yeah. And then they, and then they come for the conch. Yeah. And then they're just like, no bananas in this game. We're what, taking the bananas. What's yeah. next? Yeah. Nazis? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. When it's like one person drinking, it's frequent drinking. Can you give up your rights yeah. like that? <laughs> I had to figure out what my drinking balance is going to be because I didn't drink on stream for a while, and then did you I drink too much last night? Uh, oh, <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, oh, oh! Did you watch that stream? One bet sixty-five. Yeah, the it's stream, great. The it's stream great. ended, and there were like a bunch more hours in that <laughs> night. I'm sure there was. <laughs> it's great long watching back a stream where you were too drunk to remember what you did. It's <laughs> <laughs> always good. Oh yeah. How and then you get told you hung out with people for like four or five hours afterwards, and you're like, oh. I, I, I was going to say Doug reminiscing about last about opening weekend, but I don't know if that's the right word considering he doesn't remember a thing. I don't think you can reminisce if you don't remember. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I don't think so. Were you saying with that week were you saying on the round rock? Um, I got a place close by, yeah. Mm -hmm. I don't know if I'll do that again, but it's yeah, it's it's tough, but <laughs> it was uh, it was entertaining. I was there that night and after. Eighty flips pretty deep, Jen. That's yeah. that's pretty. That's pretty decent. That's decent enough, yeah. 80k pot. No, 80k no, each. No, 80k each. 80k <laughs> each. No, no, it's 40. Oh, man. Was it not? I don't know if you I knew about this, but the 80k... Doug and another player from the high six game did an 80k flip. Were you so... 160k total, and neither one of them remembered it. Yeah, I, I actually... I got sent a video from our our social media manager, Patrick. Yeah, right. He, he sent me the video of Doug doing a flip with Kuz off stream. Oh, man. And then I forwarded it to Doug, and Doug watched it, and then was like, oh, that was great, thanks. I don't remember at all. <laughs> so imagine watching a video of you that you don't remember. Wow. With involving $160,000, no less. Winning. And winning. <laughs> yeah. Winning $160,000. Just outrageous. Basically got unstuck from dumping in the game. One flip. Dumping indeed. <laughs> he was he was in there that night. Yes, he was. Tito value betting here <laughs> with a bo with bottom pair. Let's let's go. <laughs> Celine not gonna pay it off, unsurprisingly. We played all these huge spots. I'm really the nice Who is that, Mike? Three, four, five, five. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah, I owe the team three fifty. Okay. All right. So you said you're. There's some winnings. Poker like Lion really, because I owe winning all the money. Pierre, after that last pot, now solidly in the black. Cupcake has donated nearly 10k. Salim, down seven. Everyone else. I'm gonna say I'm 
roughly even. Yeah, some people in the chat asking about the flip. It was basically like, I watched the video, it was like a six card PLO flip. Yes, it was a six. Just pure nonsense, but yeah, pure, <laughs> literally, it, it, was a, it was a flip. And, and Doug dealt it. <laughs> Doug he, did deal it. He, he, was we, sitting, he was sitting where the dealer Taylor is sitting right now, and then he was dealing it. Kuz was sitting in the five seat, and then they dealt out. And I think they did like five or six of them, and Doug ended up winning, winning like a couple of them, and it was enough to get him even from yeah. that first stream night. And he was one of the decent-sized big losers from the first night. So, yeah, the flips were big. Yes, they were. It was, it was entertaining. I was right next to him when it was happening. And I asked, like, the manager chat, like, um, do I have anything on balance? They're like, yeah, you won. I'm like, I won? I won? I in the session. I won? It's amazing. And then, here's, and then someone had a picture of it, and it was like, I won 16K. I was like, gambling's amazing. <laughs> <laughs> that's the lesson to take away from that. Oh, my God. That's the lesson. That's, that's the lesson, that's yeah. the lesson gambling right there. Is gambling amazing. is amazing. As Lama picks up two queens. Is that, I'm trying to be a good host and make sure you go home crushed. Yeah. And lose like 160K. <laughs> There's just, at the end of the session, if someone's really told it and wants to flip, yeah. I don't want to be the like now, now you shouldn't be doing this. Like I'm just no, like you right. want the action. All right, let's fucking. Like game. I'm in. Yeah. I, I know. I'm saying. in there. <laughs> but do you also like kind of cut them off when it's like a little too degen? Maybe yeah, that is too much. much. I guess it depends on the situation. Huh? I see. It's I see. Also I see. Do before. With which one? No. When no, we're like no, in the back room. Oh yeah, yeah. And the guy was like, I just gave him. You're like, dude, this is like. Yeah, I just gave him change. But that that was a good call. Like I feel like. That yeah. was, he was out of his that line and that specific situation. Yeah, if I feel like Llama goes for a bet on yeah. the flop. Cupcake yeah, 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 is going to well, float like with the king six. Like, he does have the king of clubs back to a flush draw, like, but that doesn't materialize. Like Five of diamonds on the turn. Shout out to Aaron McKinnis in the chat. But, Thanks but, for the kind words. What's up, McKinnis? I know that guy. Yeah, I saw him yesterday. Didn't say what's up, but it's good to see him in the chat. But what's up? Yeah, there you go. Nine of diamonds on the river. Let's see if Cup. Uh, Llama decides to bet. If he doesn't, it'll be interesting to see if Cupcake goes for a bluff. Yeah, given this board, I would actually be very inclined to check and let my opponent bet, though. Holding the Queen of Clubs, not a great card when choosing to bluff catch. Well, maybe it is a little bit. Kind of mixed on it. Yeah, it has upsides and downsides, yeah. as blockers yeah. often do. <laughs> but he is going to go for some value. No, you're right. I, I, Quick I, fold from Cupcake. It's different, though. It's yeah, different. It's if, different. It's, if it's in a game, it's yeah. different. Yeah, 20% yeah, you have to take it. I guess I just also, I, I've been in a lot of games, especially when I was in Vegas, where it's just like a lot of nitty people trying to be pros and stuff, and obviously if you're a pro, that's cool, I've been a pro my whole life, but I feel like the vibe of like when you get stuck a lot and someone wants to gamble just to have a chance, yeah. denying them that, I just, I don't know, I, I, I don't feel great about that yeah. in general, if they're coming to play yeah. here. I like, I, the, you know, I will say, as degenerate as it might be <laughs> on the surface, like I do like that philosophy. You know, you can't you can't just suck up a bunch of money from a game and, and give nothing back to poker. That's that's not uh, that's not really good for the community for the ecosystem. Yeah, agreed. And we we have people in the chat or in the comments sometimes that talk about like, oh, you know, it's irresponsible to let people gamble for that way or, or you know, sort of do let. You should be cutting people off almost. Like we should be making decisions for them. Right. And while I see where they're coming from. And, and, and they have noble intentions. I think they're kind of missing like a key point, which is, it's the person's decision. You know, exactly. It's their money, man. And they came here knowing that they brought a certain amount of money in their pocket. You know, we have to let them do what they want to do. Um, and it actually ends up being kind of out of line in a way to deny them the the action or, or to deny them the opportunity to like get even or whatever the situation is. Yeah, I agree. I agree with that philosophy. Although it does get messy sometimes for people. It, it sure does. I mean, it's a muddy subject for sure. Not always an easy answer, but it's a gray area. It's kind of crazy how standard it is here. Yeah, 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 yeah. Almost, to do like yeah, big flips at the end like, if someone sucks. Wait, say it again? I feel like it's kind of crazy how standard it is here specifically. 
in some of the games that run that are the bigger stuff to just do like a big flip at the end if you're stuck. Sure. Yeah. Like, I don't see that as much in other areas. It happens. Yeah, yeah. It happens. Yeah. It's okay. But it's like consistent here. It's like if it's a bigger yeah, stream, it's a bigger game than oh, at the end. People it's flip. less grindy so here. Yeah, you know, I feel like even in Vegas, people are just gonna. There are people who will buy rules. Pierre says it's less grindy. The man that grinds day in and day out here. <laughs> he said grimy. <laughs> oh, grimy? Oh, I thought I he said that's what he meant. Oh, okay, I thought yeah. he said grindy. I was just like, wow, what a statement from Pierre. <laughs> yeah, the grinder of all grinders in Austin, right? <laughs> exactly. Grimy, grimy makes more sense. <laughs> but you have to have that much in the game. That's I've only been to Vegas maybe. one time, but grimy is probably a word I would I would use. Yeah, it's accurate. I like a little grime, but yeah, not, too, not too exactly, much. Yeah, exactly, right? Not you know, it gets weird if it's too too sparkly clean. Oh, yeah. Yeah, for sure. It's almost creepy. Looks like we're going three ways to this flop. You think you can find a flip for Looks like it. Llama with the best of it. Straight up. Could get spicy, depending on how the action goes. Yeah. You, what do you think you specifically could find the most... The biggest flip you could do, what do you think it would be if you at the network? <laughs> it's I a mean, very personal question, I feel like, Pierre. Million, <laughs> we're going to see yeah. the Llama bit its top pair. You think you'll be able to go over? I think Carlos is yeah, going to defend. So. Five? Somewhere probably around that, wow. or three or something. That's, I imagine. that's, that's good. I'm I thought, sure, I'm I thought sure. you were going to do the, the Dwight from The Office. You're like, one million? I can see that <laughs> being a possibility. Yeah, <laughs> two million. <laughs> yes, I can see four that happening. Wow. <laughs> three raises to four fifty. What a great scene. Carlos, I mean, put in the check raise. If I just, even though it would be a, a big number. Maybe you thinking he's got the best hand wants the protection. I think there would be someone that would just love the story of that they yeah. busted me enough yeah. to where there would be some billionaire that would be like, let's just Easy let's call from yeah. the llama. I, I, I neutral, okay, neutral. Neutral. We're not neutral <laughs> Very <laughs> dealer-friendly uh, calls here. You can do a network flip. You think you can find sure somebody, somebody to give you a network flip? That's a lot of money. I mean, I, 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 I'm just guessing, but yeah, that's a lot of money. Could be less than you think. Yeah. <laughs> could be more than we think. Yeah. You keep those 40 k well, That would have yeah. been a spicy one if uh, Salim had seen no, that's the turn. He would have had an open ended straight flush draw. My net worth flip, please. I got a Thursday. It'd be great. Like, you know, in the morning, get my day going. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, get the coffee. Just Good news, though, up. if I win, you get Let's a Let's go check, check. Yeah, exactly. If I lose, you're unemployed. If I lose, the deuce. <laughs> Bad news, friend. Salim hates seeing that card. Nothing worse than, than being stuck really than it's seeing a board yeah. run out. It's like you would have had all you had to do was call one bet. <laughs> you had to call yeah. one time. There's you just had to call with 6 5 high and one time. One time. If you're successful enough, you could look at it like, oh, I could lose 90% of my net worth and be fine. Yeah. So I'll be aggressive. But then you could also look at it like, my quality of life is going to be so good at my current net worth. Why risk anything? Yep. Yeah. But, I mean, yeah, so it's a ne 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 neither neither yeah. is necessarily right or wrong. Because because like when you have like basically nothing, it's the same as having nothing. You know? So like mm. when you're just like super broke or whatever, and you're just like, yeah, man, I'll just put my life on red. I would never matter. Yeah. I'll yeah. go back to work yeah, tomorrow man. and like you know, behind or what do I have like? No, like what's your what are your cards? <laughs> <laughs> That's oh a very personal question, sir. Oh, my God. Because that's what you have, too. I was just going to lay this down, but now you show me a queen. Huh? So you don't have an ace. You have a queen also. It's just who's got the better kicker? <laughs> oh, no. I, oh, no. I, I don't buy your story. This, this is great. Yeah. <laughs> Cupcake gave away his hand, effectively. He says, I only this have a queen. Super stuck play, so let's go. <laughs> you are super stuck. All right. I'm gonna, I'll, show, I'll show one while I think, okay? Okay. Oh, the llama. Oh, no. The llama shows an ace. But you don't have a friend. Jungle. You don't have a friend. <laughs> Jungle, what should I do? If you think I'm showing my best card, you don't know me very well. Yeah, but all the bad cards are also good cards, right? <laughs> Two, three, four, five, dead to all those. So I, need your I stand by my story. If you think I'm showing my best card, that's some good table race. talk. Six, queen, seven, queen, queen, nine. Queen, ten, queen, ten. You got it. You earned it. I fold. Wow. Let's go. Oh! oh. Cupcake. Oh, yeah, nice. oh, so sick. oh Getting it through. Just immediately goes right in. Talked his opponent out of the hand. I was sure you had it.
I don't know why. That's the oh, time. Oh, yeah. Yeah. It's so hard for him not to have it, right? Incredible. It's so hard. Yeah. Like I don't blame him for it. Wow. Like, like, the so best part confident. of Tetris is the second time you pulled so it off. So confident. And, like, the first time you were like... I was about to say, yeah. Cupcake, I don't think you should show your cards. Like, it's bad for the game. And then, no, no, no. Keep doing what you're doing. It's great. Yeah. Well, well, that, oh my that, God. that was just a master class. Own them. Great answer. Master class, indeed. Yes. On That's some table talk. Loved that. Wow. That's going to make a make clip. Sure I, it six, seven, <laughs> <laughs> I, I would have pulled it too. Like, no, I, 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 I thought he had it. You just said queen seven, I'm like, fuck it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Except my hand. <laughs> but you did, you did run through every card I could have with the queen. That was yeah. so yeah. good. I, th I would have pulled it too. I thought you had it. It's incredible. And he's, he's like, he's got to see the flop and be like, I have a middle queen. Oh, I, feel like I have queen five, five, not queen four, queen three. three. Just queen, queen seven, seven check, five. raise, check. I've been playing poker for 10 years, <laughs> and then I've never seen that before. <laughs> I've never seen somebody bluff like that before. It's I always, it's always right, a hand. I fold, I fold. One fold. You're not even gonna give me a little well, bit of speech play? Thank you, you're making me feel good. <laughs> no, I, I know, I'm telling you. Like, I, I tried to get in there with the queen strong. seven, it didn't work out. <laughs> yeah. the, the, the confidence in his voice. Yeah, exactly. Every word it. Just, it was it's really incredible. Yeah, I believe every word of it. The way he put it, Twice chips in, it, everything it's like was so I'm clean. Not, okay. Yeah, if I didn't believe the six deuce earlier, not I'm I'm 100 yeah, like, believe it now. We, we've been tricked twice. <laughs> yeah. in, in my head, I'm like, if if Jake <coughs> calls it, it's such a whale, because that's. Trust <laughs> 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 <Well, laughs> This is the only one. We got 10 minutes left on camera. Yeah, I think that would have worked on me <laughs> too. I think the game. I think there are people that want to play. If you guys can keep going, but I, I'm gonna bounce here in, in about 10 or whatever. Yeah, I'm done. Keep playing. What time is it? 7:30. Yeah, oh, all right. I have half an hour then. One fifty, right? Yeah. I'm in there. Four players. Doug's in there. I don't. I, I think that would be that would be not okay here. Well, we can, we can, we can ask them, right? And see what they say. Yeah, the luck might outweigh it. Tito flops an open ender. Doug with middle pair. Selling with the mystery hand. Let's do a fun little thing. Chat, let's just guess what Salim has. Just guess what he has. And if we find out and you get it right, free hat or shirt or hoodie from the Lodge shop. Just drop your guess. Random giveaway. Go for it. What does Salim have? But we have to be able to find out. <laughs> and we just might. Salim is betting and getting called. Four calls. Four hours. We're good. Oh. No sweat. I, just gotta, I, just gotta, I just gotta put the turn to protect against the <laughs> no. shenanigans. I don't know what happened in the end. I'm gonna like purposely make it. He triggers the flop. Offsuit five on the turn. Low. I don't know why I said offsuit. It's a rainbow I've board. <laughs> I mean, yeah. you're not wrong, per se. Yeah. Doesn't add a flush, bro. protected on the turn against the shenanigans. <laughs> okay, we got just queen three, ace jack. Yeah, show me a card. Some good guesses <laughs> in the chat. This might go to showdown. To Tito's again. gonna fire a bet though. It looks like. Yes, amazing. Wow, That's Tito. I believe the turn check through that got was, that was the seven on the end for the nizzles, the stones. See that in, in the six Los I'm, I'm nuts. Like, Los I, nuts. I have, stop, I have to stop whatever my mental process is. I need yeah. to change it. <laughs> wow, uh -huh. we do not get to know. Uh, no free hat today. <laughs> I'm so sorry, chat. I, I sorry, folks. We did can just get a ton of new merch here at the Lodge you don't show your, you show Some of it looks real clean. Come check it out. With all of my we'll do another giveaway in a second because I, I feel bad. <laughs> But yeah, today's health? Are you in the showing a card business? Because then I knew I was fucking going to handle it. <laughs> uh, actually, convinced every you time that I wasn't. Me, I show. So. I, yeah. To that I, point, I thought you, you had. I, to you that want. point, I thought you also had a queen. I'm, t I'm, I'm trying to give you I, a, I a better 10, kicker. But I don't like Which I know I'm a little insulted that you're considering a call right now. Oh, we're insulted. I was on the fence, and then we and I had to reevaluate, and then I was like. But it's just, oh, yeah, you have to have this box. specific set of hands that, like, okay. I just put it almost in. never check right to the flop, right? So then it's like, what? I, I'm gonna it's make, a lot of money. I'm it's so make hard to imagine that you had one of those down here, okay? <laughs> That's not that discipline. That's an easy lay down. There it is. There's the fold. Easy lay down, Tito. Good answer. Good answer. Good answer. Good Does not get the value. Hard to make pairs. What's that? Hard to make pairs. It is hard to make pairs. The so straights are easy as shit. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for the person in chat correcting me saying Los Nuts. 
<laughs> Unsurprisingly, that was un incorrect. <laughs> <laughs> it's Las Nueces. Thank you for that. Hopefully I pronounced it right. I gotta think of a giveaway mechanism in a second, but we'll get one. I just gotta think of how to do it. I always ask, I don't before I jump in, I don't want my people to think I'm trying to... No, no, no. Well, we knew you were coming eventually, so we all played differently earlier. Oh, that's good. <laughs> Getting your head. It's called Gears. You got Gears. Yep. Now, if I was better, I would have thought about that like earlier on. Like, like use that a little bit to my, to my advantage. Next time. Yeah. You gonna V pip on the button? Exactly. Without telling you guys. Pretty standard <laughs> open. Jack ten off suit. Cupcake gonna three bets. And I think he's seen too much. It's a full jack ten here. He is gonna flick it in. And he's got so Carlos crushed. Pretty rare to call yeah, a three bet and have your opponent dominated yeah. with Jack Ten offsuit. Oh, cool. Indeed. Uh, I'm high board. A little less bit, right about two years, yeah. Carlos nice. might give E. Yeah, it's nice. I like it here. Uh, it's awesome. I thought I was coming Some here for room to long. check behind. Just he does. Here with an old job. King. Loved it. Yeah, it's super nice up here. Yeah, E picks yeah, up a gut shot. Time here now. Wow. Yeah. Might oh, really? feel tempted to stab yeah, I here. Moved, uh, Houston like nine months ago or so. so. Oh, for, you mean you're from Houston? I was gonna say you, you just moved just in to Seattle, general, right? just like the third or fourth time I think I've been here. Yeah, and he okay. does. But I like Seattle. Like That's the quick fold. Cool. Nice hand for E. Just a little bit more like hot and humid and stuff yeah. in here. A little, a little bit. Well, what a funny coincidence that Nueces is walnuts when we were talking about an ounce of walnuts earlier. Did you hear that? Yeah, yeah, yeah I did. Doug measured it, measures an ounce of walnuts out. <laughs> Can you ever imagine? Here, here's what our giveaway mechanism will be. Drop a one in the chat if you've never measured walnuts. A two in the chat if you have. Everyone who puts a number is eligible for the giveaway, and I'm going to pick a random comment. One in the chat if you've never measured walnuts. Two if you have. This is absolutely dead. We moved here like right before the heat wave last year too, like a week or two before, and it was just like ramped up so quick. Yeah. You know what? I still have never been to Houston. Good choice. Been to Dallas a bunch, but I've never. Houston's been to great if you want to go find some amazing food. Houston is a cool city. It's yeah, let me know. I can get you into a lot of ones. <laughs> Couple twos. The food, the food aspect. Wow! Of Look at all those awesome. ones. Yeah, yeah, the food's yeah, yeah. the food's yeah. really good. Food. I don't well, need actually like too cultural, often, other cultural foods. It's yeah. E. Let me let me get the glasses. There's been no like at least. Oh wow! This board is spicy. We'll get back to the giveaway in a second. <laughs> Two pair for Doug, top pair for Tito and E. E with a couple back doors available. And we were in an Airbnb at first, and they, their AC like didn't work, so we had to go buy one. Keep thinking of your cards. I'm like, what are you doing? I wish they were. Wow, E. He's gonna raise us up. This may be a blessing in disguise, saving him some money further down the line. It is. All right. Yeah. Doug just gonna cold call this race. Wow, Tito's still in there. And what a turn card. And Tito picks up the flush draw of the nut variety. Can't imagine he's betting, he does not. Nine on the end. Boatskis wow. for Doug. AKA a Boatskis. Doug checks again. Yeah, he's going to go for the trap. <laughs> trap he does. Tito falls right in, betting 500. <laughs> That's where you want to be. You want to be in somebody else's Wake up in a rage. You want to be in somebody else's dreams about the stream. <laughs> Each hopping with most aces. At this point, still with the player behind who cold called a raise. Great fold by E. Yeah, with the player behind, that's very tricky. Doug, of course, going to put in the check raise. Massive here. 
Well, 8x the last bet. Almost 2x like the pots. Put a couple K in each. I got sixes. What do you have? And Tito oh. is now in the tank. Oh, I'm kings. Randomly. <laughs> Let's do it twice so when you hit your six on the first board, it doesn't crush me. Blink. And six. Tito as well, I, the I tank. Ask 27 people if they have Venmo or Zell. And they end up going you to could ask that. But I will say it's kind of hard to find yeah. bluffs Actually, here for Doug. Phones in here and shit. This is an incredibly <laughs> strong line thus far. But also, then I Cole up calls a raise on the flop. And, a and, here, so. and there it is. He is going to lay it down. Doug, of course, the courteous host, is going to show. Very nice. Oh, he's a good dude, though. Yeah. He's one of my favorite people who plays there. Yeah, nice really hand for Doug like, there. I did draw the giveaway winner. For those who weren't around earlier, Doug measured an ounce of walnuts and brought them to the lodge, and then was snacking on an ounce of walnuts while commentating with me earlier today. <laughs> I want to reiterate, an ounce of walnuts. God forbid he has a little bit too much walnuts. But anyway, I did draw the winner of the giveaway, and it was Francis Dunn. Francis Dunn is the winner. If you could shoot me, I'm not really sure the best way to do this. Maybe you could shoot me a Twitter message. My tweet, uh, my Twitter is at mbradycf. That would be great. Let me know in the chat if you have Twitter or if that's convenient to you. We'll, we'll figure it out. We have a couple more hands here to, to figure it out. But Francis Dunn, you are the winner of the giveaway. You win a free hat or a free shirt or a free hoodie, whatever you want. There he's in the chat. Yeah, man. Congrats. Thanks for answering the question. I believe you did not have not weighed walnuts. Correct. He was not. He was one of the ones who have not weighed not weigh walnuts. Before. Yeah. I, I have weighed walnuts actually. No uh, shit. Yeah, quite a lot. I used to. I bake quite a bit actually. Oh well, that's yes. a science. Yeah, so you need to be doing some baking. Yeah, exactly. Can't. Uh, you can't, can't have, just you can't, can't just be throwing walnuts, walnuts and willy nilly, you know. That's not. <laughs> yeah, that ain't cool. All right, we have cupcake putting in a three bet here. You're locked in either way. Exactly. E, at a position. One time when we go. Cupcake is not deep enough for him to make this call, I don't think. And he does make the fold. And you know what? You're good. You can have it. Oh, don't like that. I like that. Can we uh, two back, please? Yeah. Thanks, Taylor. Doug, can we do an 80k flip? How about 800? Okay. And there at, are the cumulative winnings for the day. Poker line, the big winner, 12.5 thousand extra in his pocket. Pierre up 5,700. The big loser, Cupcake, down 9,400. Salim down 8,000. He did not run well. Llama right around even, as is Doug. And the final V-Pips, Tito, 67% leading the way. He played a lot of hands. Was really good for the stream. Hopefully we have him back. Cupcake and Doug, over 40. Poker Lion at 22, trailing the pack. And that will do it for us here at the Lodge. Had Mike Brady in the booth, Greg Potter as well. Thank you guys for tuning in. Be sure to tune in tomorrow. I believe our stream is 5 p.m. tomorrow, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, and we got a 10:25 game with Doug in the mix, so that's going to be a good one. Be sure to watch, and we'll see you tomorrow on the Lodge Live.